Hi, it's Debbie Kershaw. I am back with you this Thursday, the 23rd of May, with the most exciting show. Now, it is Turtle Day, so we have got to make some turtle themed jewellery. Now this is just one of the incredible 9am projects that I have which all have three sizes of gemstones in the same gemstone. So look at these gorgeous gemstones. So they will be coming at the 9am but you know me, I love it all. 12 o'clock sand casting. Now it's a completely new flask, a completely new tool a completely new crucible and you can make things like this. So if you've been wanting to turn your little treasures into precious metal I'm going to show you how to do it on Thursday. I hope you can join myself, Carol, DJ Neary and the team on Thursday the 23rd at Jewelry Maker. It's a show not to be missed! Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Good morning, Deb. How are you? Hello. I have worked so hard on this show. <laughs> She's back again. <laughs> She's back again. It's an amazing show. I can't believe the projects. The 9 a.m., the gemstones, and then, of course, my metal working. It's just... I love it all. <laughs> You've done so well. With these gorgeous 9 o'clock projects with the Sakura um, Agate and the gorgeous um, uh, carriers, they're stunning, aren't they? I love the carriers because yeah. it just gives such a professional finish, doesn't it? To, to do. adding the charms, really lovely. Um, then, sand casting in the 12. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So before we had Delft clay, which is yeah. different, um, and a lot of people were asking for sand casting. Um, and so, yeah, it, we've got the sand and we've got a pouring machine. <laughs> properly like professional toolage today isn't there <laughs> yeah absolutely it, it's absolutely gorgeous i love the ducky that you've made i know that talk to us about him well oh lord we've done a lot of um you can't really see him from there i'm gonna move the bust a little, the okay. bust a little bit oh look He's so cute, Deb. Look. So that is from a little tiny plastic duck that I nicked off of one of Daisy's earrings. Lovely. Um, because we've done cast in place kind of poly whales style before. Yeah. I'm going to pop it back. Um, so I wanted to do like keepsakes. Now everyone does shells and acorns and blah de blah. So I thought, no, I'm going to do something different. So I did a duck. I did um, a sweet. Uh, oh yes, the um, the love heart. I love it. that. The love heart sweet. Now I didn't so know cool. if that was going to work. Um, but it has. It has. What else did I do? I did a fish. I did. If you look on the pearl necklace, I did the a little different... fishies. So cute. You know what I love about this medium is you never know what you're going to get. So on the bottom of that duck, the silver itself yeah. has actually made a little heart all by itself. Oh, how gorgeous! I'll show you when we come to demo. There's a little heart under there. <laughs> It's the most amazing thing, and 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 as you were saying, um, keepsakes, you know, that what an adorable thing to and be able also, to cast. You know, if, if someone gives you, like my granddaughter will hand me a little stone oh, or look, a there's little the, flower. Um, there's the fishy, love the fishy. Yeah, sorry. Go, um, go and on. then you can just, you know, 
what are you going to do with a stone? But to actually cast a stone in silver, you've got a little yeah. nugget that you could have as a charm or, yeah. you know, and obviously you can do shells, you can do any, anything, mm. anything that will fit in your flask. How gorgeous. So sweet. Oh, I can't. I, honestly, it, it is such a phenomenal medium and Deb just is just so... Uh, you're so creative with it, you, uh, but uh, and, and there's so much you can do, and also there's so much inspiration out there as well, isn't there? There's so much inspiration. I've done you all of the instructions. Oh with, wow! Oh yeah, the mushroom. I forgot about that. Yeah, he's lovely. Now I didn't refine that because from one angle he looks like he's got a little fairy door in the bottom. <laughs> oh, how gorgeous! Um, I don't like my charms to look like they've been manufactured from a machine. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. The whole yeah. Of, point of sand casting is for it to look. Um, like it's been artisan craft. Yeah, exactly. You know? Yeah, so, absolutely. And that's my little goddess. Um, She's gorgeous. Pendant. So, yeah, I had some great fun. It's uh, it's really, really great fun. Yeah. Beautiful. Honestly, it, it, it's going to be incredible. So those are the nine o'clock and the twelve o'clock projects coming up as your early bird today because it is World Turtle Day. We've got um, these beautiful. These are utterly adorable, by the way these beautiful little turtle um, uh, connectors here as your early bird special. They're all sterling silver. Gorgeous, gorgeous quality, oh, double-sided. There he is, absolutely gorgeous. You get three of those in the pack, so really excited about bringing you those as your early bird. You've also got a gorgeous um, uh, bead cap bundle as well in sterling silver coming your way um, in the eight o'clock hour. There's absolutely loads of stuff available on our website though, so please do go and have a look. Uh, in the 11 o'clock hour, we've got um, <clears throat> a load of sapphire and ruby as a showcase. So Ooh. very excited about that. Undoubtedly, we'll put it all on pre-order, but we've got different um, uh, sizes uh, coming your way. This is um, most of the sapphire. We've got loads and loads of gorgeous ruby as well. So really excited about that. Um, deal of the day today. Oh my gosh, uh, this is crazy. Deal of the day is absolutely amazing. So. Um, we have got a brand new carving in red jade and it is Buddha wearing a mala necklace. Oh my gosh. So cool. Sitting, uh, looking down over trees, over mountains. It is absolutely incredible. The detail is just so beautiful. We've also got the last few of the rocking horse um um uh, carving as well which is one of these carvings which moves independently isn't that just incredible it's absolutely beautiful isn't it so that's going to be coming your way as well in the 10 o'clock hour with dave so really excited about that um have a look at the website jewelrymaker.com uh so uh go to jewelrymaker.com click on watch live scroll down look at all the items we've got scheduled in this hour there's loads and loads and loads uh we've got a brand new um uh, clamshell boxes, uh, jewellery boxes, they're really, really cute. We've got everything from uh, pearls to components to uh, tassels uh, to uh, bracelets to, I mean, there's absolutely loads and loads and loads in this hour. So really, really excited about this. What's that, Neary? No way, that's just like yellow selenite. No way. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Oh, look, there's your mirror. And we've got the boxes. Oh, there it is. Last and Stock Yellow Selenite. Oh, wow. Phenomenal. Gosh, they are going to, they might even sell out before we even bring them to air, just to let you know. So, yeah, the sooner you can get involved, the better. We've got loads and loads and loads of incredible items. So, please, please, please do add as many things onto your order as you possibly can, because it's all going to disappear at nine o'clock, just to let you know. Right, what should we do, Neary? We're going to go to the Wall of Fame. Perfect. Let's go to the Wall of Fame. Let's see some of your incredible designs. So first entry from lovely Nancy, your number 602. Good morning to all and fellow uh, Waffers. Uh, I'm loving these pastel rainbow bicones and the bracelets uh, created using seed beads all from JM. Um, however, as soon as they were ready, my daughter borrowed them on long term, she said. I uh, hope you love them too. Good luck to all. That's from Nancy. Gorgeous, gorgeous pieces there. Absolutely beautiful. So lovely. It appeals to everyone. It's just, it's just awesome, isn't it? I love, I love it all. Uh, Deb Briggs, your number 603. Oh, this is gorgeous. It's very aquatic. I like this. 
Um, it's a Larimar sterling silver pendant, which I've completely soldered and set by myself. Everything is from JM except for Seahorse. The main part is made from a toggle clasp. Oh, you're so clever, Deb. Deb, that is gorgeous. Isn't that gorgeous? Well done, my lovely. Next entry is from Joe Hall. Hiya, I went a bit OTT when the summer's out. Um, use virtually all of your faux fordite, memory wire findings and also uh, JM, sorry, findings also from JM. Uh, assorted glass beads from my stash, no fiesta today, a return to wet and grey. I know, I know. Joe, beautiful, beautiful uh, jewellery there, gorgeous colour and the sun will come out, don't worry. Don't worry my lovely, gorgeous. Right Deb, who's your first entry from? My first entry is from um, Kim Hopkins, 605 Kim. Hi, please find my entry to this week's WAF. It's a bracelet made with agate and shell pearls, all from JM. Good luck to everyone entering. Great shows and demos this week. Stay safe, everyone. Oh, that's beautiful. That gorgeous. Love that. So really good luck, lovely. Kim. Thank you. And then my next one is, oh, look at this, bit of pearl. Alan Hopkins, 606. Hi, Alan. Hi, please find my entry to this week's WAF. It's a 925 sterling silver kit I got from you with a garnet and freshwater pearl simple but effective definitely good luck to everyone great job to everyone involved behind the scenes for all the goodies you bring stay safe that's beautiful Alan thank you Alan good luck stunning that's it oh is that it shall I read the news now sorry there's two sorry I thought there was three <laughs> literally just sitting there right should we get should we crack on literally don't know where I was then sorry uh, right, here we go. Uh, satellite. <laughs> That's never a good thing, is it? When the presenter completely loses it. Uh, good morning, lovely ladies. Uh, looks like a fab show. Bean shopping. Deb, love your silver casting. I know June. Isn't it amazing? Oh, thank you, June. She's so clever. It's great fun. Should we start off with natural selenite? Oh, yes. Come on, everyone. Here we go. Natural white selenite. This is such a cool gemstone, isn't it? Such a powerful gem, isn't Very it? Very powerful gemstone. Um, you know, you, you put this with other gemstones you're drawn to and you're going to really magnify their power. I've got this and the yellow selenite, actually, that you oh. spoke about. Yeah. Every time I see selenite, I buy it. It's just so... It's magnetic, isn't it? It really is. And also it's got that magic in it in the yes. same way as like rainbow moonstone or labradorite. Oh, how gorgeous. Elizabeth Kim, we got Janine, well done. We got Maker as well, well done. Lots of people getting involved. We're the UK's only dedicated jewelry making channel, just to let you know. And we're live uh, 365 <laughs> days a year. 366 days this year, actually. Uh, and um, uh, it's 3.95 PMP per order. And uh, you get a 30 day money back guarantee with everything that you buy from Jewelry Maker. I know, it's incredible. Uh, £14.99 pence for your gorgeous uh, natural um, um, uh, white selenite. Cheryl, Elizabeth, Kim, Janine, Maker, well done to you. Lots of people already checking out. That's great to see. Well done. Where are we going now, love? Okay, let's move on to. Oh! Oh, these are birthstone charms. These are gorgeous. Here we go, birthstone charms. Here we go. Oh, look at them all. There they are. So these are all rosary linked birthstone charms. We've got emerald, okay, you've got opal, you've got clear quartz for your April, there's your opal, there you go, there's your beautiful, um, there's your beautiful uh, turquoise, there's your pearls. So you've got gemstones here representing every single month of the year, gorgeous. Uh, they go today for 6 .99. I know, amazing. That saved you some serious time, hasn't it? Well done, go, go, go. Where now? Oh, Branca Onyx drop. Oh, this is a beaut. This is a half drill drop of Branca. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. That's amazing. Look at that, it's three dimensional. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, wow. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Maker and Oxfordshire, well done to you, my lovely. 30 by 20 mil in size. That is a proper, ooh. That's gorgeous, isn't it? That's a proper three diamond. Oh, that's a beauty, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. Amazing deal. Oh, Bursa Jade Station Necklace. I don't think I've ever seen this in my life. Oh my gosh, look at this. Can I have a bus, please, lovely? Thanks, darling. Thank you, my lovely. Look at this. Um, all the way down, 10 pounds for a 10 pounds. <laughs> For a Bursa Jade what? station <laughs> necklace. What's going on? No idea. Oh, Absolutely it. amazing. Jenny and Nottingham, well done to you, my lovely. Bursa Jade, all the way from Turkey in here, uh, with your sterling silver. How is that £10? 
It's a ready-made piece of jewellery. That's gorgeous. Cool. Sally Ann, well done to you as well. Loads of people coming through. That's going to sell out any second now. Well done. Um, okay. Uh, pink business card holder. Here we go. More of a peachy colour rather than a pink, just to let you know. These are so cool. They're absolutely fantastic. Whether you want to put um, uh, photographs in these, whether you want to put your business cards in these, they're absolutely brilliant. A great way of making you feel a little bit more professional on your craft stall. It looks really good to have that. Or you yeah. can even put your little signs in those. Like, you uh -huh. know, little, it looks really professional. 50% off, whatever it might be. Valerie, well done to you, my lovely. They're at £2.99. pence. By the way, I've got the, um, got the blue ones in number 30, if you want to add those on. Do you want the bluey, greeny ones? Do you want to, oh, let's do it. Why not, gorgeous. Beautiful, why not? Add them onto your order, go, go, go. These are the kind of things which are really are gonna um, uh, make such a difference. They're gonna make a difference to how your craft store looks, how it feels, um, but also, um, you know, if you want to use these for photography purposes, you absolutely can do. If you want to literally just, I mean, give it a bit more thought than that, but you know, put, put something there maybe and kind of lean your jade carvings in them maybe, that might be a nice thing to do, or maybe your bangles maybe. Why not, gorgeous, well done. Same price, fantastic, well done, let's move on. 13? Okay. Oh my gosh, Deb. <gasps> Three strands of pearls. Wow. One, two, three. Oh. Three strands of genuine freshwater cup to pearls. Oh my gosh, look at them. <whistles> look at that. We're at 99.99. That's 33.33 a strand. What gorgeous. I mean, size and shape and luster. They're huge. They're huge. Alison in London, we've got you there, my lovely. Well done. Yeah, you are. Yeah, these are available, by the way, on three split payments of 33.33. So, you know, an amazing price point per strand. Drop earring signs. Oh, they have for the um, business card holders. That's a great idea, Angela. <clears throat> Love that idea. Well done. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, number three, Fiona, we will play that. It's going to be a star buy, just to let you know. Okay, yeah, we will definitely play it for you. Don't worry, my lovely. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well done. Absolutely fantastic. Gillian, well done to you as well. Rupal, well done to you. Loads of people getting involved this morning. This is great to see you all. Congratulations, everybody. Well done. Absolutely tremendous. Aren't these deals wonderful? They really genuinely are the best, best, best deals that we can offer today. Uh, well done, everybody. You get your 30 day money back guarantee. Not that you're going to need it, but for three strands of pearls, that's an amazing deal, isn't it? Anything goes with pearls, and this yeah. is the time to get them. Absolutely. Oh, with your um, lovely. Uh, Carrier beads uh, coming up in your nine o'clock yeah, projects. Yeah, you know, and I, I love the size of these and that they just look so expensive. I can't believe that you're getting three for that price. That's yeah. absolutely incredible. Yeah, yeah, Yes, absolutely. please, yes, yeah. please. <laughs> See, exactly. Gillian, well done to you. Check out my lovely. Alison, check out my lovely. Well done, Middlesex. Fantastic, you've got yours. You're doing absolutely brilliantly. Well done, everybody. Go, 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 go. Fantastic. One chance remaining with loads of you there. Go, go, go. Right, should we move on? Let's go. Where to? Mm. Oh, yeah. These are really cool. I like these. So, uh, make your earrings or charms, whatever it might be. Hang on. Got these little cards here, which have got two little holes on one of the sides. You can pop your earring studs through there, your hooks through there. Nice thing about it being in black is you can write on it with like a gold or a silver pen, maybe. Beautiful. Okay. You then got one of these. Put your earrings in the middle. Fold these over. They're nicely kind of scored, which is great. Fold that over. Bish, bash, bosh. Put your little sticker there. Oh. Little gifty. That's amazing. How cute is that? Yeah. Little gifty. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So a really, really great uh, way to gift your pieces, to uh, package your pieces, um, and so much easier. And, and just really professional looking uh you get i believe uh 20 of the uh 20 of the little flower kind of uh, cases and 20 of the little cards so really really great uh, that you can do this and really make it your own as well you can really personalize it you can personalize it for people you can put their names on there if you wanted to you could stamp things onto there if you wanted to uh put your own ribbon on there make, um, have your own stickers made christina make your well done to you loads and loads and loads of people there well done Oh yeah, fantastic, why not? What a deal. Well done, okay, let's move on. Let's go to number, oh, someone's already asked for, oh. Are we gonna do it as a star buy? Do you think? 
I did send you a slide, Neary, with the Elsa Baretti um, uh, melted art on, because we do talk about it quite a lot, but until you actually see it and you realise, ah, yeah, I, you know, I, I, until you see it and you understand what we're talking about, what we're referring to, it's a little bit lost, I think. So, you've got here the most beautiful heart design. This is a carved heart, um, carved out of 100% natural type A Burmese jadeite. It's absolutely beautiful, okay? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous quality. What is it inspired by? Well, this gorgeous kind of asymmetric uh, heart you're gonna be getting, have you got it, Neary? Sorry, lovely. The, um, the design that it's inspired by is a Tiffany's design. Now, Tiffany's, I mean, uh, Tiffany's are a phenomenal institution. They've been going for, um, you know, hundreds of years. They've got lots of different um, collaborations, lots of different um, uh, collections in their inventory, which are uh, so popular and they're so iconic. One of the most iconic uh, designs that they've got in their in their kind of stock, if you like, is the uh, Elsa Peretti melted heart design, designed by Elsa Peretti. Um, and it looks very, very, very similar to this, not too dissimilar at all. Um, when you buy it, it's either gonna be made out of sterling silver, or it can be made out of genuine gemstone. You've got here the most beautiful, beautiful design. Um, in here, because it's type A jadeite, I mean, what, what are you going to do with it? Are you literally just going to pop it on a chain? Are you going to maybe get a piece of red cord and do a lark said knot and then do some lovely macrame? You know, whatever you're going to be doing, keep it simple. Make it all about this incredible gem. Um, here is the open heart pendant. Slightly different to the one that I've, 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 I found, but it's the same kind of design. Here we go. And you can see it there. That really beautiful open design, that melted design. I like the fact it's not symmetrical. I really so like the I. fact it's a, I, I love it's asymmetry and it's organic nature, don't you, Deb? It's iconic. Um, mm. And I like that it's got no hard lines. It's it's just very yeah. soft. Um, the minute you, I looked at that, I thought of the Tiffany's one. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Mm. Um, so you can see the Tiffany one. Um, you're gonna be looking at paying hundreds, if not thousands of uh, uh thousands of pounds okay that's how much you are going to be looking to spend now this we've got a, a great quantity actually we've got 60 chances available okay let's get that price point down 20 pounds oh, that's amazing Get two, make earrings, get three, make oh earrings. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine as well, you know, in the middle of a bracelet, maybe in a gorgeous ring, whatever it might be. Absolutely gorgeous. Now I've got here one which is in jade. I mean, it, it, it yeah, it, it's a different kind of quality of jade, obviously. It's kind of more of an imperial grade. But you can see the cost there is £5,300. And yeah, that will be 18 karat gold chain, blah, 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 blah. I totally get that. But if we're just talking about the design, the similarities with the design, and ours is at 20 pounds. It's amazing. It's absolutely incredible. Oh, and by the way, because we've got 60, we're not done. <laughs> 30 second clock. <coughs> Here we go. Deborah, maker in 5 June in Hampshire, has got two. Nicola, maker, Paula. Loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of you there. Absolutely tremendous. How do you fancy us going even lower? Now I really like the way that we've recorded it there and it's kind of on the on the kind of you know on the slant. It's not kind of you know sitting there absolutely perfectly. I really like the idea of that, don't you, um, uh, Deb? Absolutely. So love relaxed, it. isn't it? And it it can move as well. Yes. So you know that something like this is asking for you to touch it isn't it so you know you can move it along the chain yeah I think absolutely this is, what a beautiful piece i've not seen this before. it's gorgeous isn't it we've yeah. done it in black dough we've done it in various different gems i love it in this taipei burmese jade like today 15 quid wow honestly this is one of those pieces i remember when i was uh, when i was a teenager you know i was in um, sick form and um you know people were having their 16th 18th birthdays and i remember kind of the piece of jewelry that everybody wanted was one of the tiffany bracelets you know one of the beaded bracelets with the heart on all that kind of stuff and if you got one of those it was like wow oh my gosh everyone was kind of crowding around looking at it it became a really iconic piece for for, for kind of young adults to wear 
this, I mean, I mean, I'd like to say that the Elsa Peretti Melted Heart is going to be a similar kind of design, but I mean, no one's going to be able to afford, you know, five grand. It's a huge amount of money to expend. So for £15, you can get the look, you can get the quality. And I have to say, I would feel confident give, gifting this to any teenager. I mean, I, oh, yeah. it, 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 it scares me buying it <coughs> for teenagers. I never really know what they're going to want, but I can imagine that almost every teenager out there um, is going to love that. I th I, there's a message that says use it for sand casting. Oh my gosh! Gee, who sent that message in? Janet. Janet, you're a genius. You! And then you get a silver version of it. You can sand cast anything that you you want to make into that's why i did the duck because it's the most outrageous thing i could think of you know that you can to show you that you can do anything so even your carvings oh you know your jade carvings you could do that in silver as well if you wanted to so buy this melted heart sand cast it oh, i wish i was wearing it today in fact you know what it, oh i might get in trouble for doing this if it's in here i will show it oh my gosh i've got it right can I show you the piece of jewelry my husband bought me when we first when we first started dating? I'm probably oh, I hope I'm not going to get in trouble for this, but look at that. Oh, that's pretty. There you go. Exactly the same design. Yeah, they're pretty much the same design. You sand cast that into silver. Yeah, it's going to look like that. Obviously, with the uh, with the with their kind of aperture in the middle. How amazing is that going to look? And it's going to cast really well because oh you've my got gosh. the roundness of the gemstone. That's genius, <sighs> Janet. You are a genius. Honestly, you are an absolute genius. You know, you know, goodness. No, oh, wow. Amazing. Patricia, Valerie, Karen and John. Well done to Neil and Linda. It's 15 quid. That's absolutely amazing. June, well done to you as well. Loads and loads and loads of you coming through. That's absolutely amazing. Well done. Honestly, just tremendous. I can't believe that. That's absolutely fantastic. Well done, everybody. What a deal. Oh, gosh, Janet, I love that idea. Someone's going to do that. Someone's someone, going to yeah, do someone that. Someone will do that. And then you can wear the silver one with the jade one on the yes, chain. Yes, absolutely. Oh, amazing. Well done. Right. OK, where are we going now, lovely? Oh, okie dokie pokey. Let's go to, oh yeah, here we go. So, oh, yellow selenite. Oh, this is just so lovely. Yellow selenite. Natural yellow selenite, by the way. Oh my gosh, this is just so cool. Um, the fact that you've got all the kind of brilliance of selenite, all of that gorgeous kind of, uh, all of that kind of magical ethereal nature, and then it's this gorgeous natural yellow color. It's absolutely amazing, isn't it? 450 carats in total, 12 mil rounds here. Debbie's already through, great to see you, my lovely. Well done to you, we're at 20 pounds. Can you actually believe that? Amazing. We've got another size for you as well. 10 mil. 30, that's number 37. There we go. 10 mils. Oh my gosh. There it is. Said to be hugely, a hugely charging gemstone as well. Put this near your other gemstones, which you want to kind of charge up with positivity. And it's said to kind of help, help, help do that. Might just be a load of old nonsense, but you know, so many people do believe in this. And it is kind of, if you do believe in the holistic properties of gemstones, uh, then this is one of the most powerful gemstones in your toolkit. It's absolutely incredible. £17.99 for you today. Congratulations, everyone. Well done. These deals are so, so, so good. Well done to you, lovely Lynn. Loads of you coming through. Well done. Congratulations. We've got the early bird coming up. Um, please don't forget, it's all going to disappear at nine o'clock. Things are selling out on the website, just to let you know. So the sooner you can get involved, the better. Right, where now? Oh, what? Oh, oh, there we go. Sorry, I didn't see we had other ones. Wow. So we bought you the 12, the 10. These are eight mil, did you say? Eight mil. Imagine doing graduated jewelry with this. Oh, oh yeah, mama. I love this. How gorgeous would that be? Woo, mama. Amazing, amazing, amazing. 14 pounds, 99 pence for your gorgeous eight mil rounds of your beautiful. 
It, it's such a soft yellow. It's not bright and acidic, is it? No, and I'm not really a big yellow person. But yeah, when I saw okay. this, what blew me away was that it was natural. Yes. Because I didn't realise that selenite came other than white. White and yellow really are the only natural colours that you can get. And I absolutely love that it's natural. It's so gentle. It's like um, yeah. sun coming through a window. It is. You know, it's that warmth rather than it being, ha, you know, bright, acidic, you know, you know, really, really vivid. Patricia Allison, Maker, Linda, well done to you. Should we do the other ones? Come on, let's go. Six mils. Yeah. Six mil, you know, bracelets, necklaces, earrings. This is like the ultimate size, isn't it? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous qualities. Carolyn, well done to you, my lovely. Very lots and lots and lots. Powerful in a mala. Yeah, phenomenal. Mm. Yeah, gorgeous. Absolutely. In fact, I've got some beautiful selenite in a mala, which um, lovely Susie made for me, and it's just... It's just a terrific gemstone. It's just wonderful. Well done. Lots of people coming through. Surrey, well done to you, my lovely, in Lanarkshire. Check out your baskets, everyone. 12 99 Heather, congratulations, my lovely. Anonymous bidders, well done to you as well. It's absolutely fine. We're literally moving on just purely because of time. Last one, four mils. <whistles> Here it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Four mil, Alison, well done to you, my lovely, in London's got two. Ah, uh, Sally Ann's got two, in Shropshire. Debbie in Hampshire, well done to you. Go, 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 well done, 9.99, fantastic, well done. More makers there as well, well done to you, check out. Oh yeah, definitely, Neary, let's definitely do this. Oh, we're gonna make this into a star buy. This is absolutely ridiculous. Uh, in fact, you know what? Let's do it as a star buy. Go on, Brucey. Oh my word. I believe you've worked with this. What's in there? <laughs> it's exciting. Open the box. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Look at those beauties. I mean, wow. Just wow. I love this Baroque shape, Deb. So do I. I just absolutely, I love all pearls, but my favorites are the natural shapes. Yeah. I don't know, they're just, there's something amazing and design-wise you can do so much with them. Do you know what? There's a beautiful bracelet which Monica Venade did, and I can't remember the name of the bracelet. She's always got such lovely names for her designs. And there is a bracelet which is literally half of this. And half gold. And half gold, yeah. Isn't it lovely? It's just gorgeous. Yeah. Do you know what's so cool about this though? It's I mean, the pearls are amazing. The clasp is just ridiculous. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, it's got a really cool working, that one. It's the one that you, you pinch. Yeah. yeah, it's so cool. I think they look like little beans. They do, like coffee beans. Yeah, they're absolutely. so cool. It's just, it's absolutely beautiful. The fact that you've got that really lovely as you say, that lovely bean shape, um, it bends the light, doesn't yeah, it? it? Does. It's just, oh, it's absolutely gorgeous. You just give it a bit of a squeeze. That is so gorgeous. Oh my word. I mean, how, would you, how much would you pay just for that yellow gold plated sterling silver clasp? I know, like in some places you could, you could pay 40 pounds, oh, 30 pounds. without shadow of a doubt, 40, yeah. 50 quid just for the clasp, unbelievable. We're at 50 pounds for the lot. Oh my gosh, get it, <laughs> get it, get it. I bring you pearls, we bring you pearls like this so infrequently. Um, they are, yeah, that is amazing, Neary. That is absolutely incredible. We, no, no, you can't be going like, you can, you can not be serious. You're going lower. <laughs> no, oh my gosh, genuinely, I, 50 quid is amazing. 
You could sell that piece of jewellery that you make with that for five, six, seven times more than that. Oh, without a shadow of a doubt. Because it's such a high-end little project. The melted kind of baroque pearls you're getting there. Look at the luster on those. The, the beauty of those is only matched by the beauty of the clasp itself, which again, really mimics that shape, mimics that kind of organic nature. It's absolutely gorgeous. Dorothy's got two in a basket. Ye May, Oxfordshire, Maker, Tina, Debbie, that is tremendous. And it's 40 Oof. pounds. Oh my God, go, <laughs> get it. How many do we have here? Have we got enough for all of us to have one of these? No, oh my gosh, go, 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 go. June, Hilary, Pamela, well done to you, Vicky. Do you know what? And if you're brand new to jewelry maker, if you're brand new to jewelry maker and you're looking at this and thinking, right, I've never done pearl knotting. I, I, I you know, I, I, I'm never gonna be able to do that justice, honestly, I kid you not, get this home, practice your pearl knotting on other gemstones if you really want to. But I mean, honestly, that we do deals like this so infrequently, don't we, Deb, that you've, you've literally just got to grab that. You have to get that now. Uh, uh, you know, you have to look at it as a piece of jewelry that you can make with it. And ha is it going again? You have to be kidding. <laughs> Are you, is that the wrong clock, Bruce? <laughs> you get instructions with this as well, by the way. Say again. You get instructions with this as well. Oh my gosh, you get instructions. Oh, that's why you said debit. Oh, fantastic. Can you remember what you made with it? Mm. Oh, uh, he's going to find the, uh, he. Oh, thank you. He's going to find the instructions. so many pearl projects. I'm so lucky. Those pearls are absolutely, I mean, everyone, you love your round pearls. We all love them. They're gorgeous, aren't they wonderful? But when you get pearls like this, it's just, I mean, what a treat. What a treat. Oh, <coughs> pearl drop earrings. Oh, gorgeous. Oh yeah, I was thinking of using them sort of, if you're going to use them sparingly, put them with faceted Amazing. gemstones. Um, you know what, what really grabbed me about this was the clasp. It's so high-end looking. It's, that is the kind of clasp you are gonna put on a piece of jewelry, which is a state jewelry, you know, it's an heirloom piece. You know, it is, it, it is a piece which is gonna be kind of four, maybe even five figures. It's absolutely tremendous. Go, 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 go. Here we go. Uh, what? 30 quid. Honestly, no idea how we can do that. That's amazing. You get your instructions, you get your strand of pearls. The pearls themselves, surely they're worth 30 pounds on their own. The clasp, as we were saying earlier on, the clasp is kind of easily kind of 50, 50 easy 40, 50 pounds. That is crazy. This should be at the very, very least, I'd say probably 90 pounds yeah. with the pearls, with the clasp, with the instructions and the little pochette as well. You know, absolutely tremendous. To be able to get that for 30 pounds, that doesn't cover the cost of any of this no. in, my, in my book. That is absolutely crazy. Dorothy's got three, Janet, Teresa, Maker, Yi has got two, Pamela, Maker in five, Helen, June, Hilary, Geraldine, Maker, Tina, uh, Ella, Mary, Mariska, Yulva, Anne, Glenda, Vicky, Debbie, loads of you there. Tremendous, well done. Uh, Maker and Five, go, 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 go. Maker and County Tyrone, Ella, Mary and Jerry. It's absolutely crazy. I can't quite believe that. <laughs> Me neither. Yeah, well done. Let's do a 30 second clock to close. That's got a, 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 unbelievable. I think as well, especially if you're kind of newer to jewelry making, if you were to try to do pearl knotting with a perfect round strand, the pressure is on, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. Whereas what's so lovely about this is it's a little bit more organic, it's a little bit looser, it's a little bit more relaxed. So arguably, you can have a go if you are kind of newer to jewelry making. If you're newer you? to jewelry making, use the two strand, um, get, get a thinner silk, use two strands, yeah. bring them through and just overhand knot them. You can't go wrong, just through the next one, overhand shoelace knot through the next one and you're going to get a tight knot every single time um that's an incredible that's the best deal i've seen for a very very long time that's amazing if i was at home i'd get that like a couple the, deal, of the deals we do for pearls are absolutely amazing but that that takes the biscuit <laughs> that really does take the biscuit that is i genuinely don't know how we can do that should we do some bead caps Oh yeah. I know we've got to do those jewelry boxes. They're adorable, Mary. Okay, right, what should we do first, lovely? Oh yes, let's do the bead caps. Let's do it as a star by. Come on, let's go. Oh, 
Okay, so these are, this is a chance for you to get your bead caps. Um, bead caps are, they are so useful. They have multi, 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 multi uses. Um, if you want to create a center to a design, if you want to draw the eye to the center of a design or you want to pick out a certain part of a design using a bead cap, using bead caps is, is, is a brilliant way of achieving that, isn't it? Completely change the look of a piece. I've used a piece in the nine. I've put two bead caps next to the central pearl. It draws the eye down and completely changes yeah. what that would look like if it didn't have the bead caps. Yeah, there you go. So um, you can yeah. see what's achieved by using those two bead caps either side of that main pearl. Draws the eye in, highlights it, brackets it, whatever you want to, you know, whatever you want to say, whatever you want to kind of explain it as. Jewelry is all about your findings, all about your bead caps, all about everything, your spacer beads. I run out of these constantly. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, but then we've got other guest designers who will get a bead cap and, and it comes to you like this, like a lovely little um, concave shape. Really, really beautiful. And they'll get the bead cap and they'll get the hammer of some description and they'll hammer it flat yeah you're then you've then got a gorgeous floral shaped disc uh we had some on the on air the other day with um guest designer mark and he said well what he'd do is he connect them together with jump rings and make a gorgeous kind of daisy bracelet mm, i mean just use them as connectors I mean, they are precious metal so please don't forget that please don't forget that they're precious metal and you can really make them into the design because there's sterling silver you can solder with these as well so i think that's definitely worth a mention they are absolutely awesome now um are you getting how many are you getting neary i was going to say it's all of them isn't it so you get six mil and eight mil uh, bead caps so if i can show you you get these little baby ones and you get these ones, 12 of those, 12 of those, 24 in total. That's very good. That's very, very, very good, isn't it? Whatever you're gonna be using these for, whether it is a bead cap, whether it is gonna be a tassel top, because of course, because they've got that lovely open aperture there, if you wanted to hang it like that with from an earring finding and have chain or tassel, a tassel of some description coming from the bottom there, you absolutely can do. Um, they're six mil and eight mil in size. So 12 of the six mil, 12 of the eight mil. They're absolutely brilliant, aren't they? Gorgeous, gorgeous quality. Here we go, my lovelies. All the way down. Let's put a fiver back in your pocket. Let's go. Come on. Well done. Look at this. Absolutely brilliant. Yours today, fourteen ninety nine. I think particularly, Deb, if, mm. particularly if you don't necessarily feel confident in creating a design like this out of wire or creating a design like this kind of free form um you know this is a great option to give you that really professional finish for that price i wouldn't even attempt the fiddliness yeah. and the time consuming work that it would take to make that if you soldered on a piece of wire and curled it over you could have a hanging flower design yes how lovely um i just go through these because i use them in almost every single one of my be you know my threading work yeah yeah absolutely mm. they're just phenomenal aren't they congratulations everybody well done and as deb says she's constantly running out of them it's the kind of thing where you don't just want to buy one pack of these you want to get two or three or four i've bought you eight mil ones quite often uh, these little baby six mil ones are so adorable though please do get them add them onto your order you know uh, um uh, you know multi 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 buy it's a great great way of 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 building up your stash we're at 14 pounds and 99 pence for you today. Congratulations, lots of people coming through. Well done. How many have we got in baskets, Neary? Okay, so we've got Sue, Janina, Patricia, well done to you, Jan, Nicolette, Mary, Maker, Kate, Valerie, Hazel, Wendy, Sue, fantastic, well done. We are at 14.99. 12 of the eight mil, 12 of the six mil. Jill, you just message in. Just refresh your uh, YouTube feed. Everything should be fine. She having issues, glitches. Just uh, refresh your feed, lovely. Mary Lynette, well done to you. Heather, well done to you as well. Let's go lower. Let's do one more price. Mary Lynette's just multi bought. That's great to see. Well done. Shall we do something truly, truly, truly amazing? Truly bonkers. Yeah, come on. Let's go for it. Why not? Yeah, they are 925 sterling silver. I mean, you can just solder one of those onto a, onto a ring shank. You know, use them, as, use them as components. Don't feel, 
boxed in by just using these as bead caps. Let's do them for a tenner. Come on, stuff it. Why not? We may as well get them out there. We may as well get them. I know it's sterling silver. You know, it's a precious commodity. It's the kind of thing you need to go, what? That, you know, that's precious metal and we're doing it for a tenner. Yes, I know, but just, just add them onto your order. Go for it. Why not? It's our mission to bring things to you for the best possible prices and basically to sell as many as we can. Because by doing that, it means that our, uh, our vault isn't taken up by kind of, you know, you know little kind of bits of quantity that we've got left over. You know, we can sell things out the very first time that they come to air and we've got more money to spend on other things and bring you more incredible deals. Kate, well done to you, Maker and Five. Lynn, well done to you. Alison in London, well done to you. Debbie, Caroline, and Sue, Maker, Patricia, Angela. Go, 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 go. Well done. Loads and loads and loads of you coming through. Congratulations. Well done. Dorset's multi bolt So is Kent. Well done. Anne in the Isle of Wight. Well done to you as well. Loads of people coming through. That's just fantastic, isn't it? Well done, everyone. Go, go, go. You only have to put um, two of these into a gemstone yeah. piece for that piece to now become a precious metal and gemstone piece. Yes, exactly. So you can say sterling silver, there might not be a lot of it, but it still elevates it. Of course so it does. So if you're making to sell, yeah. that's what you advertise it as. Yeah, precisely. Um, I'm in a lot of metal work groups and someone was saying the other day, where can we get silver for for less and everybody was in there going it isn't less silver has gone skyrocketed in yeah. the last 10 years um but we seem to sort of um, be able to to buy a lot so that our deals are pretty amazing yeah yeah it is it is one of those things you know we don't we definitely don't work on the same kind of margins as other people no. um and that is one of the main differences that we have between you know us and you know you know vendor on the high street but but Deb's absolutely right. You know, silver, the price of silver is the price of silver. Exactly. It's not like you get a better deal. It's no. just that we have a lower margin. Yeah. So instead of having a margin of kind of two, three hundred percent, you know, which, which, which some people have to because, you know, to kind yeah. of pay for rents and, you know, to pay people who work in the shop and to pay for heating, you know, whatever it might be. We just take a lower cut. That's it. That's basically the way it works with sterling silver. The manufacturing side of things, it's, you know, very different because, of course, we do almost all of our own manufacturing, which is wonderful. So we can drive that cost down. But when it comes to the raw materials, you know, we're in the same boat as everybody else. We're, we're paying the same as, as um, anybody else. Right. Fantastic. Well done. Um, OK. OK. Oh, Neri. Oh, look. Oh, wow. These are so cute. Imagine putting pearl earrings in there and the little clamshell. Well, well, the first thing I thought when I saw these the other day was um, use them as a photography tool. Yeah, definitely. They're so cute. Little flock shells. They're so cute. They've got a flat back and they're rounded front. So they sit like that. And you open them up. Oh, oh my gosh, they're adorable. Pop your ring in. Hang on. Oh, ring how does it ring? Oh, it's that's so sweet. gorgeous. It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Come on. In you go. In you go. Isn't that adorable? Oh, my gosh. That's so sweet. Isn't that just stunning? You could display your rings in those. Well, most definitely. I mean, how different is that going to be? Lovely. Um, you can, if you want, I mean, there's loads of different ways in which you can use these. You can, if you want to, take that little insert out. You can see on the back there, you can use, um, yeah. gosh, that looks like a little face, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you, you, you've got a little space there for earrings, for pendants there, those little slices there, to, so you can hang a chain on the other side, which is great. You can have that completely empty if you want, and just use it as a little box to put your jewellery in at the end of the day, you know, on your bedside table, pop your jewellery in there and just close it down. You know, that's, you know, all done, all, you know, ready for you. You've got um, a pack of three of these. I just think they're absolutely adorable. Aren't they sweet? If you're pack selling these. pearl jewellery, that's oh, just definitely. adding to the story of the, of yeah. the jewellery, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Let's, um, I don't even, I didn't even see what price point it came in at. What price point did it, 20 quid. Okay, yeah, that's half the price, 9.99. There you go. Ooh. For three. That's so good. Beautiful little clamshell um, uh, jewellery boxes. Aren't they gorgeous? They're so sweet. I love the way they stand up. They're gorgeous, aren't they? So, so, so sweet. Most definitely uh, to use, um, uh, you know, for your photography tools. Fantastic to be able to sell to your customers. Also, don't you think it looks like the front of a stage in the 1920s with the gaslights? It gas does, lights? yeah. You've got that really lovely kind of almost, not, not like a speakeasy, but like almost like a burlesque kind of club yeah. uh, thing with the lovely kind of gas lights. So if you want to make that lovely stylized jewellery, that really beautiful kind of 1920s jewellery, then absolutely, these are, these are perfect for you. They've got that really lovely kind of gas, gas lit quality uh to them haven't they which is just gorgeous let's get that price all the way down tina heather marie uh marie claire well done to you my lovely 
Uh, Helen Hazel, well done to you. Michael's got three packs, well done to you. 6 99 Amazing. That's 2.33 per jewellery box. Isn't that gorgeous? You know, if you're selling jewellery and you're raising money maybe for a, for a, an ocean charity or for, uh, or, or for World Turtle Day or, you know, whatever it might be, or you're, or you're making mermaidial jewellery or using the mermaid glass or, you know, whatever it might be, these are absolutely perfect. Well done. Loads of people coming through. Oh, my gosh, there's tons in baskets. Go, 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 go. Well done. Isn't that brilliant? As well, have you seen it when people um, get jewellery boxes, little ring boxes, and maybe they're going to propose and they put little LED lights in them? <laughs> I, mean, I just think that's the most adorable thing, isn't it? Lovely, really yeah. kind of, uh, really kind of going that extra mile. Yeah. So if you want to do that, you can because it's got that black background. So really lovely way to kind of, um, to kind of involve those little LED lights as well, which which be really really lovely. Well done, everyone. There's tons in baskets. Lots and lots and lots of people checking out. Well done. Isn't that gorgeous? Well done. So you've got the rounded top there, so it'll sit like that. But then of course you've got the flat uh, top there, so you can either have it nice and flat like that or like that. These look a little bit like Viennese biscuits as well, Viennese whirls. <laughs> they look very high end. I'm just imagining them yeah. on a craft stall. I yeah. Think, you know, they're really going to set your stall apart. What a lovely way to, as you were saying, display your jewellery. Yeah. And at 2.33 each, I mean, it's hardly breaking the bank, is it? Right, guess what I've got? I've got the same, but in blue. Now, So I'm thinking, you know, for your pearl jewellery. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, they're so cool. Oh, wow. They're so cool. Oh my gosh, I love these. Oh, wow. Isn't that amazing? They are epic. Epic. Oh, wow. They are absolutely epic. Yeah, there's your, um, there's a little insert um, again, which you can take, oh, that one's smiling, uh, which you can take out. Um, they're absolutely fantastic, aren't they? So you could put your earrings, there's your little slots there to put your um, chain in for your earrings. There we go. That's to put your ring in. Gorgeous, aren't they? It's like a little happy person, isn't it? Beautiful. Or just keep it, you know, take it out and just keep that completely empty. And, um, you know, just put, just put your jewellery in it. Whatever it might be, put sea glass in it. How lovely would that be? Yeah, just add to that story. Jewelry. That story yeah. of your jewellery. Doesn't it? Just, you know, it really adds to that. Yeah, it really adds to that kind of, you know, connection to the jewellery, you know, where, where where you might have found the gemstones, the theme of the jewellery, whatever it might be. You know, really, really fantastic. Just going that extra mile. Very, I, I mean, I've never seen these anywhere else. Have you? No. No. Yeah. Can you imagine your abalone jewellery in there? Or, yeah, you know, perfect. shell jewellery or That's mother exactly of pearl it. Um, in there. That would just, I don't know, it just, you've spent all this love and energy into making something. Present it like that. Beautiful. Also, Deb, don't you think that there's... Um, a real uh when you you you're absolutely right in what you say it kind of carries on that kind of level of service it carries on that love if your jewelry is just literally thrown on a thrown on a desk it's just it's just gonna you know it's just it's just not gonna look the best whereas if you package it like this it's gonna look beautiful there will be certain gems out there that really suit this bright intense blue as well yeah I think that that you know golden South Sea pearls maybe, uh, or any what well, any of your South Sea pearls, but particularly your golden South Sea pearls, maybe your Tahitian pearls, uh, you know maybe the abalone you want to put in the in the silvery grey ones. It's entirely up to you. But you know pop a ribbon on it. You know why not? Or if you're going to be getting married on a beach, or if you're going to be proposing on a beach, what a lovely little added added extra thing how good i just think they're beautiful well done everyone five scott four packs well done to you my lovely well done yeah there's a big 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 queue on the phone lines just to let you know get involved as soon as you can well done love that royal blue it's absolutely gorgeous isn't it well done gorgeous right okay it's time for your early bird special it's time for the most beautiful turtle connectors you're gonna love them let's go So I didn't realise, but today, the 23rd, it is the 23rd today, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. 23rd of May is World Turtle Day. Gorgeous little things. Turtles and tortoises. 
beautiful. They're beautiful, aren't they? And it was interesting. I was, I was, I'm just looking at it this morning, and um, I'll just, I'll just show you this line very, very quickly. Um, there is a list of things which we can do to help protect our lovely turtles. Yeah. Um, never buy turtle or tortoise uh, from a pet shop as it increases the demand uh, from the wild. Report the sale of turtles and tortoises. Never remove them um, uh, um, uh, from the wild unless they're sick or injured. Report cruelty. Um, if a tortoise is coming into a busy street, pick it up. And, oh, gosh. Oh, emergency care. Right, OK. And write letters to uh, legislators asking them to keep sensitive uh, habitat preserved uh, or closed off to road vehicles, etc., etc. One thing I did learn, um, and it was the other day, and it was just, it, it made my, it, it just filled my heart. There's a beach in India somewhere, which was up until three years ago, literally a, a rubbish tip. There was literally rubbish everywhere. And it was a beach, couldn't even see the sand. It was absolutely awful. And a huge undertaking um, uh, took place which was basically to clean up this beach in India. And uh, it happened and it took months to get it clean and, and to get all of the litter picked up. And I think it was this, this maybe this year just gone, um, they had uh, thousands of sea turtles laying their <gasps> eggs on the beach oh, and all amazing. the baby turtles kind of scuttling oh. towards the sea. Isn't that lovely? That's what we need to be doing more of. That's, that's yeah. a fantastic story. It's lovely, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, clean up our beaches. There's, you know, there's so many, there's so much rubbish yeah. in the news at the minute. So much to drag us down. And to be able to bring you something like this, I just think is, is just absolutely gorgeous. I love it. And if we can take a day to value you know our wildlife and endangered species and you know you know and turtles and tortoises yeah absolutely let's take that opportunity why not what we're bringing you today by the way these are really 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 cute these are 925 sterling silver turtle connectors Oh, Lord. Oh, hello. Isn't he beautiful? The most gorgeous sterling silver turtle. With all of that detail, with that lovely kind of oxidization. Well, it's kind of not really oxidization. It's just, it's just detail, isn't it? You can really see that, that kind of um, impression uh, yeah. that has been made into the 925 sterling silver. Um, the other side, you'd expect it to be flat, maybe, or with a big 925 stamp on it. But look, it's beautifully made. All that lovely detail. Aww. I'm turning him upside down, which I don't want to do, but all of that lovely detail underneath. Isn't he gorgeous? I love his little flippers. I love the fact you can just tell it's a turtle straight away, can't yeah, you? Yeah, you can. I think gorgeous for charm bracelet, gorgeous for earrings. Yeah. You get three. Get a little family of them. I just, it's, it's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? They're just gorgeous. Come on, let's take the price point down straight away. Let's take it down straight away. 19 pounds, 99 pence, well done. Now, I love the idea to put these on a charm bracelet. You could simply take that little loop off there, couldn't you? Just clip that off and then if nail file, just file it down if it's a little jaggedy edge. But of course, it's sterling silver, so you know you could use it as a solderable accent. You could solder it to the top of a ring band. You could solder. Oh, it, what a lovely idea! You know, if you've got um, a bezel set cabochon and it's a sea themed, you could solder him around the side. You oh. know anything like that. So every you've got to think out of the box with sterling silver charms. You can do oh. anything with them that you can do with metal work. I'm just look, thinking back to Deb Briggs's. Yes, like that. Here we go. That's like what I this. Mean. So this is Deb Briggs' uh, Wall of Fame entry today where she used a seahorse, not from JM, but she used a seahorse and kind of soldered it onto that kind of design there. Surely there's a place for these kind of turtles in a similar design, don't yeah, you think? Yeah, definitely. And I, I think everybody knows someone who's crazy about turtles. Yeah, absolutely. You know, so you can make a sea design if you add that to your pearl designs, um, or maybe you've got a mother pearl cabochon or a Larimar cabochon or something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. It adds to the story of the jewelry. Doesn't it just? Yeah. It really, really does. I mean, by all means, if you want to use it as a, 
little charm. There's nothing to say that you have to take the little loop off the bottom. If you want to put a birthstone on there, you absolutely can do. If you want to have him sitting going that way round and you want to kind of raise some money for, um, to kind of raise awareness for turtles and to kind of, you know, for certain kind of aquatic um, uh, charities, then absolutely go for it. Just literally attach your, uh, 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 um, your um, Eslon thread onto either side, make a little sliding class bracelet. They're just beautiful. Leslie, Janina, Brenda, Sue, Maker, Sheila, Lucy, well done to you, my lovely June, Nicolette, Hazel, Debbie, well done to you. Loads and loads and loads of you coming through. We're at £14.99 pence. They're gorgeous, aren't they? For three. That's a fiver each. Mm, and very good. What, what's so lovely is it's not, it, you know, the detail you're getting is absolutely brilliant. So you can see there the detail. You can see there the detail on the back of the shell, the detail of the gorgeous, of his beautiful flippers, the detail as you turn it over as well. And you see the detail underneath on, the, on, his, on his tummy and again on his uh, flippers at the front and the back as well. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? Well done. Um, 14 99 we've got loads of people there. Maker in Oxfordshire, Pauline, well done to you. Maker in Kent, Hazel, Julie has got three loads in her basket. Uh, Julie's got two packs in her basket. Sandra's got two packs in her basket. Janine's got two packs. Uh, packs in a basket as well. 14.99 to a fiver each and let's go lower. Come on, let's go lower. For the turtles, everyone. I know, I know. They're just, they're absolutely beautiful, aren't they? Gorgeous, gorgeous quality. I love them. Sometimes we, oh gosh, no. I don't want to get in trouble. We, we have bought charms to wear before and you look at them and go, is that really a fish or is that really <laughs> a, oh, not like any fish I've ever seen. You know, whatever it might be. These are turtles. You can just tell, can't you? They're so cute. They're just adorable. Absolutely Belinda, are uh, at least 80 vulnerable Olive Ridley turtles made their way into the sea from Vrasova Beach in Mumbai, protected by volunteers who slept overnight. Oh, oh. my gosh, Belinda. That how beautiful and it's that natural instinct that they're born with to yep. kind of find water yeah and the little flippers are just oh my god they're so adorable oh my gosh that makes me so isn't that wonderful oh belinda thank you so much for that message that's just so gorgeous oh how wonderful um elizabeth well done to you mary well done to you as well kerry well done to you sharon well done to you as well um, loads and loads and loads of you there. They're at 9.99. Fantastic, isn't that brilliant? Well done. And another amazing fact: apparently, turtles can breathe through their bottoms. <laughs> Did anyone know that? No. Did anyone know that? <laughs> it, oh no, they can. They can. Amazing. So, do you know somebody who can? No, 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 no. Uh, but at 9.99, what a great deal for you today. And they're sterling silver. Let's remind ourselves: they are 925 sterling silver. Judy's got three packs. Pauline's got three packs. Kerry's got two packs. Jenny's got two packs. Nicolette's got three packs. Brenda's got two packs. Well done. There's loads of you there. Fantastic. Well done. Caroline, Susan, Maker, Wendy, Alison, Maker and Kentish Multiball. Well done to you. Let's do 30 second clock to close. Now, honestly, what we've got coming up after the break is absolutely tremendous. We've got Sakura. Uh, agate projects with the most gorgeous um, uh, turtle connectors which are gorgeous and the most amazing carrier beads as well which are stunning 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 uh, we've got red jade out coming your way don't forget the sand casting as well uh, and we've got natural sapphire and ruby coming your way so it's going to be absolutely incredible an amazing 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 show if there's anything else you'd like to look up on our website please go check it out because uh, it's all going to disappear in a couple of moments thank you so much coming through to get these they're absolutely beautiful and for world turtle day what a gorgeous little early bird or an early turtle i'd like to call him mm -hmm. absolutely beautiful kerry's got three nicolette's got four keep coming through to get these there's still genuine chances left you got all the way through the break to come through and get these if you want to add them onto your order please please do well done everyone don't go anywhere we'll see you in a couple of minutes how would you like to be part of an unofficial world record attempt and amongst the largest number of people making jewellery at one time? On Friday the 31st of May at 10am, Jewellery Maker will be holding the world's biggest make-along, where over Zoom you can join fellow jewellery makers of all abilities as we attempt to break a world record. Whether you've never made jewellery before or it's your favourite hobby, you can join us. All you have to do is sign up via the link below. We will send you an email with the Zoom link to join us near the time. Go to www.jewellerymaker.com for inspiration and of course, how to sign up. See you on the 31st of May for the world's biggest make-along. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com 
where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Hi Jewellery Makers, it's Charlie. I'm back with you this Friday, Friday the 24th, and I'll be with the lovely Elle and the fabulous team. At uh, nine o'clock, we have got some beautiful floral pendants. I'm going to be walking through how you go about setting those. And then at 12 o'clock, we have so many goodies. It's all about metal smithing, forging metal. Uh, so we've got lots of hammers, steel block. There's a new tool as well, a new tool that will help you um, if you're uh, soldering at the minute and you're struggling to get everything set up, this is gonna be really useful for you. Um, so I really look forward to sharing all that with you guys and I hope you can join me on Friday. See you then. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8 a.m. until 1 p.m. And you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a jewellery maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says gift cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Jewellery Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I just, honestly, <laughs> this gem, every time we have this gem on Jewellery Maker, I just, I, I kind of lose myself. Beautiful, huh? It's so, it's so... Um, I don't know. I don't know what it is. It's the the detail, the levels of inclusions you get. I love, I, I, I love gems with inclusions. I think I think that's probably what it is. Um, and it's so decorative and so beautiful. It's like a piece of art, isn't it? I love these. I love every single one of these projects this morning. Um, getting all, I always say this, but getting the same gemstone in different sizes. Yeah. I love that because you can graduate down the back, you can make matching pieces that you might not oh do. Oh my gosh. Like that one I've used, all three sizes love of the gemstones. Because I could. <laughs> I, I absolutely love that necklace. Thank it's you. It's so pretty. So, you know, just I wanted different shapes in there. So, you know, usually you'd put three and I thought, you know what, I'm going to put two. Just break the rules, see what happens. <laughs> there's there's warm colours in there. There's cooler colours in there. There's different textures, as you say, different shapes. It's all wonderful. This oh, oh gosh, I love this. That's finger coral, isn't it? It is, and it's, it's just so beautiful. Very easy to make that um, with your seed beads, and you just you know, again, just adding that little bit of story to your jewellery. So yeah. you've got the turtles. Let's add a little bit of coral. Yeah, isn't it just stunning? Absolutely beautiful. They're all gorgeous, gorgeous projects. They really are. Um, the gems work so beautifully together. We've got Sakura and we've also got Crazy Lace. We're going to start off with the Crazy Lace project actually, which is absolutely um, uh, stunning. I, this is another gem. What I love so much is that Agate and Jaspers are coming into their own. Yeah. They, they are literally some of the most exciting gems we've got at the minute and some of the most popular gemstones you're loving them as much as we are oh 
Oh, really? We're going to start with the Sakura. Lots of people messaging in about the Sakura. Uh, okay. um, so that's, uh, oh, mind you, they're all, aren't they? Those three are all Sakuras, aren't they? Is it this one here? Hmm. Ah, the pinky ones. Yeah, got it. Well done. Okay, so you said this morning, actually, before we went live, it's a bit of an old school project, this one, isn't it? Yeah, because, again, I'll tell you what I've been running out of lately is the tiger tail. Yep. Um, and you get tiger tail, you get monofilament, and you get elastic. And it's a bit like we used to do in back in the day. Back in the day. Um, and I love having this in because this will get used. It's, they're not giving you something you're not going to use. So exactly. this will absolutely get used. And you get these um, in with the projects, yes. which is very old school, I think. Yeah, really, really brilliant, isn't it? It's wonderful to be able to bring you all uh, three of those different threading materials. Your elastic, obviously for elasticated bracelets, elastic uh, stretchy rings. Uh, your monofilament um, uh, is a wonderful threading material. It's, it, it's clear, it's like a fishing line yeah. almost. Uh, and it's great for doing kind of illusion style pieces. Your beading thread or, or tiger tail has got a real fluidity to it, but it's also acts like a wire almost. So, so it's, a, it's a very, very strong uh, threading material. They're all absolutely brilliant. Great to give you that option. You then get your three strands of Sakura. Now, this is an amazing variety of agate. Um, kind of, it, it's got these, oh yeah, it's got these plumes or blooms going through these incredible floral-like oh, kind, mm. of, kind of confetti blooms going through them. It is, it is absolutely phenomenal. Now, looking, hang on. Thanks, lovely. Here we go. So you've got here um, a cherry blossom kind of quality. It's described as, in this particular slide, cherry blossom agate um, is a kind of stone you see and you instantly fall in love with. Now, this is basically Sakura agate, but you've got these three-dimensional kind of flowers, cherry blossoms, going all the way through uh, the gemstones. It's absolutely gorgeous. When you get the pieces, which, and, and some of these pieces will, you know, sell for huge amounts of money, because of course, when you think about the um, symbolism of the, um, uh, the cherry blossom, the symbolism of that over in the Far East, you know, anything which has got anything like these kinds of inclusions going through them, which of course these obviously have, is going to be, you know, it's going to be extraordinarily valuable. You've got three different sizes here. You've got your, is it your eight, six and four uh, yeah. mil rounds? They are absolutely stunning. I love that the, they are on a bright pink strand. Now, when you take them off this strand, they will be a lot, the, the colour will be a lot more gentle, won't it? Oh, it's very gentle. I mean, I just, it's beautiful. So Kira, I couldn't believe that we'd managed to get this in a project. Uh, project with three different sizes of Sakura. Well, this is it. I'm not sure how many projects we've actually done with Sakura Agate in. This is this is a really yeah. kind of new venture for us. This is the jewelry which is made with it. You can see how delicate that colour is, how beautifully pastel that colour is. Now, there are three bead um, Carry, uh, sorry, carrier beads in this project. They are absolutely stunning. And they will, I mean, they, they give you, as you said, Deb, a really professional finish. These are yellow gold plated sterling silver uh, uh, bead carriers that you're, uh, carrier beads that you're going to be getting here. They are absolutely amazing. Look at the quality you are getting there. So this one here gives you a really beautiful, kind of highly detailed quality. You're um, then going to be getting this kind of more kind of barley twist kind of quality, which is absolutely beautiful. They, I mean, honestly, these are such great quality components, aren't they, They're Dad? really beautiful. And that's why I made just simple stretches as well with a pearl underneath yeah. one of these, because it looks like something you'd buy from, you know, a boutique jeweler. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, they look like kind of Pandora charms, yeah, don't they? they? Do. They're absolutely gorgeous. You've got this really stunning, uh, yellow gold plated sterling silver and you can see the three beads there have all got slightly different um, uh, depictions on so you've got that lovely barley twist you've got kind of more of a kind of almost like an Aztec design almost like a more of a Balinese design they're just absolutely gorgeous now 
I, to my knowledge, I don't think we've ever done Sakura in a in a project. I don't think so. Now, this will come with instructions. I mean, ah, this is just, you know, we're bringing you effectively an old school jewellery maker kit with threading material, three strands of gemstones, and you're going to be getting some precious metal components. I mean, this is already amazing. But you also get, oh, look, turtle bracelet um, 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 uh, project. Now, I'm not telling you what to do, but over half term, over the next, you know, over the bank holiday, maybe you're looking for something nice and simple, nice and easy to make, nice and simple to kind of uh, to while away, you know, the bank holiday or to while away half term, whatever it might be. Sit down with a cup of tea and just enjoy this project. So really, really um, 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 uh, accessible project. It's only going to take you, what, half an hour or so? Great for beginners. You can add whatever you like to it, whether it's pearls, whether it's jade, you know, whatever you want to add to it. You can really make it your own. That's the beauty with this. Three individual strands giving you a graduated look with your sterling, yellow gold plated sterling silver uh, carrier beads. And you're going to be getting your threading pack as well. And you're going to be getting your instructions. Now, uh, Jenny has come through without even looking at the price. I mean, we haven't even got a price point on screen and bought three of this project. I mean, it's absolutely amazing. Just to let you know, Sakura Agate is up there with some of the most valuable agates, you know, up there with the Nanhong Agate, up there with some of the most um, kind of valuable agates that, that, are on, that, that are in the marketplace right now, okay? You're getting three strands in a project, okay? There will be a limit to how low we can actually go with this. But honestly, I know you're going to love it. The price is going to be absolutely terrific. Are you ready? Here's your starting price. This is a start price. 99.99. Now, I'm absolutely certain we have bought strands not too dissimilar to this one, Deb, um, uh, before to air mm -hmm. before for about that price point there. That's why I was so shocked that it was in a project. Yeah. And that you had three very decent strands in that project in Sakura. Yeah. Um, you know, it's like, for me, it's a cherry blossom in a gemstone. It's just stunning. Um, but there's a subtlety to it. So depending what metal color you put with it, yeah. whether you want to go vintage, whether you want to go bright gold, whether you want to go silver, it's going to work with all of those. Absolutely. Now, we have bought, we have bought a strand of eight mill like this sakura agate to air before yeah for a phenomenal price okay there is a limit to how low we can go considering this is a gem which on its own we've done showcases on We've done deals of the day. To my knowledge, we haven't done a project. If we have, apologies. I, I, I personally can't remember one. So we've got an option here. We've got three strands. You've got the threading pack and you've got the three carrier beads. Why don't we do today a birthday deal? <laughs> I mean, I mean, it feels like we, it feels like our birthday never stopped. No, that's true, but I like We it. only launched this gemstone <laughs> last year. In birthday, why don't we do a birthday deal for 2023 with a bit of a twist? Okay. Now we're gonna do a crash, but you've gotta be there. Now. Oh. 15 seconds, let's be, how many of this project do we have, Neary? Yeah, we got a really decent quantity. There's, by the way, there's no way near enough of you on the phone lines right now. We need to get more of you there, more of you with this in baskets. There's no way near of you, there is nowhere near enough of you to do the deal that we want to do right now. You need to be there. You need to be there now. Go, 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 go. What an opportunity. Wow, this is so beautiful and pretty. Uh, would love it in my collection. Deborah, it, honestly, it's amazing. And if you've ever looked at Sakura Agate, if, if maybe you tuned in last birthday, and saw the Sakura Agate and you thought, do you know, I absolutely love that, but it is a bit too pricey for me. I can't afford £100 a strand. I can't afford, I don't know, 80 quid a strand. It's 79 99 for three strands. And you get the gold-plated sterling silver carrier beads and you get the three threading materials and you get the instructions. 
79.99 is terrific. You know it, I know it. Honestly, <coughs> for this incredible 100% natural variety of agate, that is amazing. We are not here for just half the stock or three quarters of the stock to go. We want every single one of these to go. I can see you there. There's lots and lots and lots of you there. We need to see more of you. 60 seconds, we're going again. Honestly, this is terrific. This is absolutely terrific. Yeah, if you were to buy all of these strands individually, they would be significantly more than the price point that we're at now. And that's not even taking into consideration the threading materials and the three brand new yellow gold plated sterling silver carrier beads. I mean, that's absolutely amazing. Well done, lots of you there. We need to see more of you. We need to see loads more of you. If we're gonna do the price, well, how low do you think we're gonna go? 79.99 is low, isn't it? For three strands of natural Sakura agate, that is very, very, very low already, yeah? So, you are getting four mil, six mil, eight mil. So in 2023, we launched this eight mil strand here, this single strand on its own for 50 pounds. That was that strand there. So for these two as well, 29.99 and 20 quid, and for your threading material, and for your three brand, I don't even know how to value these, your three brand new yellow gold plated sterling silver carrier beads, 79.99 is amazing. You've got about hundred pounds worth of strands, just the strands, let alone all of this lovely stuff and the um, instructions as well, of course. You've got about hundred, hundred pounds worth of strands. We're nowhere near done, nowhere near done. <laughs> This does seem very, very, very low, Neri. It does, yeah. I mean, are we actually making any money? No, we're not, are we? Oh. Okay. There's loads of you there. We're going down. We're going. Jenny, you were the first person through. Jenny came through before we'd even bought the price on screen. She bought three. So we launched this eight mil for 49.99 last year. That's 30 quid. That's 20 quid. And all of that, that's over 100 pounds just on the strands, or we could just do the whole lot for the price of the eight mil. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> we are literally bankrupting ourselves today. We literally are bankrupting ourselves. You are getting the whole project today for the price point that we launched one of the strands for last year. That is absolutely tremendous. And by the way, at 50 pounds, that strand on its own, 100 sold out. We launched that strand last year, eight mil, for 49.99 today you're getting that 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 and that for 50 pounds that's absolutely amazing loads of you there kate joanne pauline mary in surrey maker deborah elaine sue jane janet caroline maker lisa pauline lisa joan maker sheila jenny it's absolutely marishka it's gone crazy well done to you maker kate Go, 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 go. That is absolutely terrific. The price point for the largest strand when we launched it last year was 50 pounds. Today, you're paying for that strand at 50 pounds and you're getting that, 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 and that free. That's a cracking oh, deal. Oh, and the instructions, free. Just have some instructions. Just know, have, them. Have, have them, have them. It's crazy. It makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. Alison, check out. There's loads of you there. Well done. There's so many people there. You are getting everything free today other than the 8 mil strand. The 8 mil strand, the price point we launched it at last May for this strand here. 50 pounds. Can you imagine? Sorry, let's just get these out of the way. Can you imagine tuning into Jewelry Maker? You've got a brand new gemstone, brand new gemstone, brand new strand, eight mil rounds, 50 pounds. Come through and get it. Well done. Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of you there. Oh, and by the way, we're going to add in that, 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 
that, that, and that free. All you're paying for is that. That's, That's good. it. And all th the rest of that, all of that, free. Free. It's crazy. It makes no sense. 50 seconds, we're taking the details away. Congratulations, everyone. Well done. Maker in Cambridge has got five in the basket. Joanne, Pauline, well done to you. Elaine, Maker, Sue in Edinburgh. Je Sue in Edinburgh. Sue in Edinburgh recognises a great deal. She's always there. She always comes through to get those deals where we're just like, what's going on? <laughs> I mean, it is, it is, that makes no sense. You've got all of that, Deb. Mm. That's free today. That's free. I, this is a fabulous time to get Sakura into your collection if you've been lusting after it because I feel like that you're going to um, absolutely fall in love with it if you haven't totally. had the opportunity to work with it before. It's a, a joyful gemstone. I mean, yeah. I, I'm flabbergasted, really. That's an amazing deal. Thanks, Neary. I know. <laughs> Maker in Cambridgeshire, Kerry, Maker, uh, Candy, Trisha. It's crazy. Got it. Yay, birthday gift to myself for next week. Yeah, this is it. And th the amount of people who I know are going to be coming through to get this today who are uh, possibly looking at this incredible gemstone and, and you know, you know, in, in, in days gone by and thought, you know, I really love it. If only, if only it was just a little bit lower in price. Well, today is the day. Today's the day. That's the best deal you're ever going to get, I think, on Sakura. That's absolutely amazing. Can't believe how low, how, how low we've gone. That's tremendous. Well done. Congratulations. Go, go, go. 50 quid. It's, it's still 60. Jill, there's still 60 in basket. So Jill, Trisha, Maker, Kerry's got 12 in their basket. Maker's got, uh, Maker and Cambridge has got five in their basket. Joanne, Pauline's got two in the basket. Maker, Elaine, Sue, Jane, Janet, Caroline. Maker's got four in their basket. Lisa and Paula. That's crazy. This is Sakura Agate. This isn't fake. This isn't synthetic. This isn't dyed. This is natural Sakura Agate for 50 pounds. And you know we're ignoring Three the, we're ignoring the precious metal. But what were we saying earlier about this is gold plated precious metal? Okay, so we've got three of them. So let's go the other way. Let's say there's three of those. Let's say that is going to be. I mean, I, I I don't even want to say fifteen quid because they're brand new. I want to say more like twenty quid. But I mean, let's say fifteen pounds. I mean, that just, just seems ridiculous. With the threading pack, that's another fiver. So that's twenty pounds. Yeah. Yeah. With the instructions, let's say that's another ten pounds. So that's thirty pounds. So you're telling me that these three strands here are worth 20 pounds. Well, no, because that <laughs> launched at 50 quid. So what are we doing? This strand launched at 20 pounds, the four mil. This strand launched at 30 pounds, the six mil. The eight mil, the eight mil, that launched at the price point of the entire project today. That shows you just what we can do. Yeah, it, it, it's, I think a lot of people have wanted to work. I've not worked with this very much because you know, oh. I just haven't had the opportunity. Yeah. So I think I've worked with it once before. Um, so to be able to get all of this lovely, gorgeous, juicy bundle of gemstones um, for, for this is amazing. Yeah, it really is. Oh, Marishka says, good morning. I love it when Tom produces. He brings irresistible prices. I didn't want to buy today. I couldn't resist. I know. See? You know Marishka. There's a lot of love for Neary No, no. Make her West Midlands, Mary, Jill, Kerry. Thanks, Gosh, there's Neary. lady there. Check out. Right, where are we going now? Oh, yeah, I think it is. Have a, have a look though, Neary. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> this is my favorite. There's a complete, like after the Sakura, this is my next favorite because, oh, the color and the just the, you know, I'm not, I'll be honest with you. Oh. I'm not a rose gold girl doesn't really suit me I'm um, you know I can take it or leave it but I absolutely loved it with this gemstone I went full-on rose gold it just it <laughs> brings something out of this gem doesn't oh, it's it it's amazing with this gemstone these are like koi carps yeah. I love them they're beautiful oh my gosh look beautiful it's got little leaves in it or something. I know We've done recently some amazing strands of carnelian. I'd love to see this with the carnelian mm. or uh, fire opal maybe or smoky quartz. It's got a really beautiful look to it, hasn't it? It really has. The reds it? are amazing in here. You can cherry pick which ones you want to use as well, like which ones you want to go together or um, I had such fun with these yeah, projects. Yeah, I bet. Gorgeous, isn't it? Here we go, my lovelies. Graphics alive. 
Enjoy. This one's going to be very, very, very popular. So, three strands, four, six, eight mil rounds. You've then got your rose gold plated sterling silver carriers. You've then got your threading pack. You've then got your instructions. Oh my gosh. I'm just thinking back to some of the auctions we've had for Sakura Agate and you know it's looked like this and they've been in bangles they've been in the mm. beautiful big pear drops and they have been so well received they've been so 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 popular haven't they um your start price for this today yeah it's crazy isn't it Seventy nine ninety nine. We are no way near done. I love that necklace. It's so lovely. Thank you. Do you see what I mean about the rose gold? Oh, it, it looks just, amazing with it, doesn't it? Yeah, I can't imagine using anything else with it. I mean, it would be lovely with silver. It would freshen it up and the yellow gold. But the rose gold, I just thought, wow, that's just a couple of lengths of chain and some different shapes in pearls. Yeah. Um, and obviously, the bead caps we were talking about earlier. Um, I don't know, it's warm, at the same time it's summery. Um, I love this gemstone. I think when you've got a gemstone which in itself has got lots of moments, lots of different colours and shapes and things going on, when you carry on that theme and use different shapes, different sizes, different, different materials within that piece of jewellery with that gemstone, it just works. It works so well, doesn't it? It just looks... It looks eclectic, but really beautiful. And I just think, you know, I played with these. I had a really yeah. good play. I was like, oh, I'm really enjoying this. It's, you know, and I see a lot of projects and a lot yes. of gemstones. And I just, I do, I see a lot. You do, darling, and I know. I love these. Yeah, I yeah. just, this is what you make jewelry for. This gets people into making jewelry because yes. You've got these beautiful gemstones and pretty much anything you do with them is going to work. Mm, mm. Um, I did a very Debbie Kershaw design. That's very me. I know oh, that's it's so pretty, not no. everybody's taste, but that's the beauty of being a Gorgeous. designer. You can do whatever you want. Exactly. I love it. We're not done. We're going to get that price point down even lower for you today. Uh, this Now, Neary, Neary, oh gosh, Neary's kind of concerning me today because he really does have his big, brave pants on today. <laughs> and he's going to do something <laughs> silly, like really silly okay we've uh got loads more to bring to you we've got tons more to play between now and the end of the hour so neary's just gonna do this okay get involved unbelievable ready steady 50 pounds not done Put it in your basket. Uh, good morning, all you lovelies. Got mine, a little prezies for me, yippee. Thank you to all your hard work and uh, wonderful deals. Do you know what's so lovely about that, Trisha? We've had a couple of messages from people saying, yeah, it's gonna be, you know, it's a gift for me, it's a gift for me. This is the kind of thing which, you know, sometimes you feel guilty about buying things for yourself, don't you? But sometimes you just look at them and go, I've just got to have it. And the fact that it's, you know, the last project was 50 quid, you know, oh yeah, you get the instructions as well with this, um, is absolutely amazing. These instructions, but they take such a long time to put together. You're so lucky to get these included in the price of the kit. Hi, Debbie. Ah, uh, I love your boho designs. I'm a 60s baby and your designs are right up my street, says Mariska. Oh, and I love your name, Mariska. Every time I see your name, I think I wish it's... my name was Mariska. Yes, I know. Thank you. Beautiful and I'm a 60s name. baby just as well. Ah, oh, gorgeous. <laughs> well done. Uh, Maker in Cambridge here. Well done to you, my lovely Sheila. Well done. There's nobody near enough of you. We're about to go really, 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 really low. This is embarrassing. <laughs> This is career ending. It's $29.99. What? Gee whiz. Oh my gosh, he actually just did Sorry, that. Sorry, that was too loud. I was oh genuinely gosh, shocked no. by that. Uh, <laughs> Sorry if I just deafened what you. What are you doing? That's... Uh, it, this does remind me of like a Nan Hong agate. Oh, and can you imagine Nan Hong with it? That would just be incredible. Can you imagine the red jade we've got coming up later on with it? That'd be absolutely oh, incredible. this is a steal of a deal. Incredible. How wonderful. The, um, yeah, absolutely. The red jade that we've got coming up, the beautiful carvings. Thank you, my lovely. Um, honestly, I look, at, I look at both of those and um, consider... Oh, my oh goodness. My oh, my gosh. Oh, Deb. Oh, 
Oh, it's, I want to cry. It's so beautiful. Shove some pearls in there and you've got my dream piece of jewelry. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, it's 30 quid. Go, go, go. West Midlands, Swansea, Surrey, Kent, North Yorkshire, Greater London, Kent, Lancashire, Cheshire, Devon, Cambridgeshire. That's absolutely ridiculous. I can't. Oh my gosh, Are you no. kidding me? Oh gosh. Fantastic. Are you all right in there? Do you need me to call someone, Neary? <laughs> Do you need me to call somebody in there? Are you okay? No. Yeah. I, 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 I don't know. I mean, this is, this is, Neary's gone mad. He's gone wild. He it's absolutely wild. incredible. He's gone super wild. It's just gorgeous though, isn't it? To think that you can get a gem of this kind of, with this kind of quality, with this kind of character going all the way through it. Today, it's 30 quid. No, it's not. We're going lower. I love it with the rose gold. You get your threading pack. You get your three strands in the four, six and eight mils as well. There's loads of you there. And we're going to go even lower. Why not? <laughs> Should we take a pound off, two pounds off? No, let's take a fiver off. What? $24.99. I... I feel really uncomfortable doing prices like this, but you know, it, but, but you know what's so cool? Our customers know they're getting a great deal. They, they understand what they're getting. They appreciate what they're getting. So it's okay, yeah? yeah, yeah. Yes, because Ish. You, that's why I work here. Don't worry about it. This is it, you know, um, our, our kind of- Don't worry about it, Our Carol. perception on what a good deal is, is skewed, isn't it? It is, it really is. You know, that's crazy. Uh, 24.99 just add it just get it well done that is it's a lovely old school type kit that you can have a good play with because you've got lots and lots of gemstones you haven't got one strand you've got three strands of gemstones you've got your threading pack you've got your beautiful carrier bees it's like it brings me back to nostalgic to the early yeah. days of jm absolutely you're so right deb you're so 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 right to give i know that's crazy isn't it it's less than 10 pounds a strand and everything else is free. Yeah, it's amazing. It's crazy. Yeah, it's really, really Jenny's crazy. got two in a basket. Mandy, uh, Irene, Maker in Cambridgeshire. Check out my lovely, well done. I mean, there's loads of you there. Just, just take it now. 25 seconds and we're taking the details away. That's amazing. Well done. You get a 30 day money back guarantee. But honestly, if you look back at um, Sakura, Sakura Agate that we bought to air, I mean, it's just, it's just. It's a no brainer is what it is. A no brainer. Stupid. If you Silly. look at the kind of prices we bought strands like this to wear for, it's unbelievable. Unbelievable, Jeff! Right, okay, let's get those details away. Let's get them off screen, gee whiz. Who? We do have another one as well. What's the other one, Neary? Stop, no, stop it. Don't say things like that. <laughs> Can I really take not... this opportunity to say hello to Kinga? Because I oh, spoke to her yesterday. Kinga! And she still hasn't had a baby. Oh, She's a bit okay. desperate. And she misses everybody. And I want to send you kisses. Kinga, we love you. We miss you. And I hope your baby comes soon. And I can't wait to see you and baby. I did a dubbubba. I did a dubbubba. You're going to be amazing. <laughs> of course she is. All we need to think about is that baby is in the safest place right now. Absolutely. And so is Kinga. Just in rest. In her tummy. Rest just rest. and relax. Rest because you're going to need it. <laughs> You'll be <laughs> fine. You'll be great. You'll be amazing. She's going to be amazing, isn't she? Is, she is, isn't she? She's just, yeah, she's just wicked anyway, isn't she? Ooh. We've got lovely Eva as well. Currently on cameras. Here we go, crazy lace. Oh my gosh. Who doesn't love this gemstone? I don't know a single person who doesn't connect with that gem. I know, and it just... Oh, agates are magical and amazing and I love them and just they're so natural like look at these natural earthy colours it's like someone's mind it and you know obviously they have mind it but it looks like someone's mind it I but know. you know it, you can see that it comes from the earth you've got like slate greys and then you've got these lovely honey Cotswold stone colours I mean it's just like it, it's so oh yeah lovely. it's 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 peaceful, it's calming. It, it's just beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous quality you're gonna be getting here. You've got here layers, layers and layers and layers. Um, thanks love, Cra ah, crazy as I get, it can be traced back uh, millions and millions and millions of years. Um, you're basically looking at quartz, which has got lots of other minerals and elements fused with it. And, they, and these layers 
solidifying calcify over years and then what's left is I mean you look at this one here for instance and I'm only saying this because it is a, a large one there you go there look at the look at the stripes look at the bands you're getting there oh sending Kinga lots of love and luck says Miss Janet I know bless her heart so you've got the layers you've got these incredible kind of layers which are all sandwiched together and compressed together every gem in these strands every single gem tells a story doesn't it yeah it does it absolutely does and each one's different like oh. somebody's painted on it yeah it doesn't it yeah you get three of your sterling silver carrier beads with this project which is absolutely gorgeous uh, and you get the instructions by uh, debbie as well which is fantastic 49.99 this is absolutely tremendous this is just asking to be set with other gems as well i think i think you may get your pearls in yeah. there get your um oh gosh um uh, i mean there's so many different gems uh, larimar would work really beautifully with these as well i think i made a bracelet with this and i'm Did you? bound to have put um oh yes on the yeah in the, uh, with the pearl hanging from it can you see yeah. it there gang um just to show you yeah, how just effective there. These oh, are that's really just pretty. some silver spaces. Oh, with the yellow selenite we had earlier on. Oh, yeah. And just there you a bead go. cap. Can you see there? The yeah. It shows you how a bead cap, that's just one bead cap, can elevate a design. So yeah. look how lovely this is for a stacking bracelet. Yeah, it's gorgeous, isn't it? And that pearl's just going to move so beautifully. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? 49.99. We're not done. 30 second clock. Come on. Let's go for it. It's got that beachy feel to yeah. it as well, doesn't it? Quite boho, Marishka. Yeah, this is all completely natural, by the way. Uh, you tend to get um, crazy lace I get from, you get it from a number of different locations, Mexico, uh, but also Madagascar. When you consider Madagascar, uh, the, the, where Madagascar is, and, and you know, it's, well, I think it's the third biggest island in the world. It's a very, very large island, Madagascar, off the coast of um, Africa. And it's kind of got its own microclimate. It's got its, it's definitely got its own kind of, um, uh, kind of, uh, environment there in the fact that there are flora and fauna that, and, 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 and creatures that you don't find anywhere else in the world other than Madagascar. It really is absolutely incredible. And it's famed for its gemstone mining as well. You know, the world's best appetite, um, uh, pink sapphires, uh, labradorite, rose quartz, and of course, uh, some of the most beautiful agates as well, including this. $29.99, yours today. Well done. Go, go, go. That is what, £15 a strand and the rest is free. That's crazy. These should be 15 pounds. Yeah, they should. These should be 15 <laughs> yeah. pounds. Yeah, yeah. You know, five are each for each of those. Then another five of that is 20 quid. So those two strands are four pounds 50 each. That's absolutely crazy. Bonkers. Well done, everyone. Divinia, well done to you, Maker, as well. Loads and loads and loads of um, uh, uh, people coming through. And by the way, I mean, it goes without saying, these kits are completely um, um, interchangeable as well aren't they oh yeah absolutely i mean you get a lot of gemstones for your buck in these mm. don't you you really do um you know you're getting the, a lot of gemstones there so you've got a, like a little stash you've got your threading materials and your carrier beads great for a gift for somebody if maybe um if you're going to go to one of our make-alongs or you're going to do one of our make-alongs yes. via zoom um, i'm doing one in pudsey so come see me please if you're up north i'd love to see you Fantastic. um mark's doing one oh claire's going to be at one allison's doing one so you know if you want to bring a project or sit at home zoom a project something like this is good oh you've definitely got there's no pressure so much that you could actually do with them and just to show that it does it, it, all of these are interchangeable look at this we've got this project I coming love up those as well together. they're really really lovely look at them together they look absolutely gorgeous don't don't they beautiful quality and it really does kind of extend you know make your jewelry even bigger let's get that price point down we're at 29.99 it's absolutely tremendous well done come on let's go even lower this is this makes no sense this entire <laughs> hour <laughs> makes absolutely no sense it's a genuine gemstone it's natural genuine gemstones you're getting here today 24.99 for the lot for the two strands for the threading pack for the uh, three brand new sterling silver charm carriers uh, B carriers and um, your uh, instructions as well. Nicolette, well done to you, Florence, well done to you, Maker. And again, what, you know, uh, uh, Deb says is absolutely right. Just do a little, you know, if you're going to be joining us for a make along, don't, you know, start making a piece of jewelry which, you know, you need lots of tools for or something which is going to be really kind of really advanced, maybe or something which you've never done before. Just take it easy. Take it yeah, easy. Enjoy Just enjoy yourself. the experience. Yeah. This Absolutely. really will bring the enjoyment back to your jewelry making, won't it? Very playful kit, something that yes. you can get your teeth into. Absolutely. Really help you get your mojo back as well. Yeah, definitely. Well done, Alison. Well done to you, my lovely. Leslie's there in Devon. Fantastic. Janet in Cambridge here. Well done to you. Florence in County London. Well done to you. Jenny in Lancashire. Maker. 
Well done. One more project. Should we do it now, lovely? OK, so um, 30 second clock to close. Final project. Yeah, it really does, Neary. Oh, my gosh, I'm so glad you said that. That's exactly what I was thinking. The final project we've got is a project with natural agate. Now, we bring you lots and lots and lots of banded agate, dyed agate, um, which is, you know, all really, really lovely. Agate's a really great gemstone because it, it takes the dyeing process very, very well. What does it look like naturally, though? Can I, can I just say... Um, when you sometimes see celebrities go without makeup, you look at them and you go, oh my gosh, actually, why do you bother wearing yeah. makeup? Because actually you're so beautiful. Yeah. Like um, Alicia Keys, when she um, goes completely bare face and you look at her and go, oh my gosh, you are so beautiful. Or, um, or a Beyonce without oh, makeup. Yeah. Just, you're so beautiful. You don't need to wear makeup. And you look at this gem naked you look at this i mean not you're not naked well you might be i don't know uh, but you look at this gem so naked without any treatment and you just go oh my gosh if that's what it looks like completely naked like no dying i mean sign me up that this is honestly gorgeous this is so beautiful look at this this kit's gonna fly by the way this is gonna fly ready let's go Eight mil. There's a real mutton fat quality to this, isn't there? So oh, translucent, it, isn't, isn't it? it? That, yeah. I was not expecting that. Next strand, six mils. These are glorious. Look at these. Oh my gosh. Aren't they beautiful? Absolutely stunning. <gasps> that Branca Onyx mm, mutton yeah. fat like translucency is just gorgeous, isn't it? This is your four mil strand. These are absolutely terrific. Oh my gosh. I love it. I absolutely I just, love it. Got, imagine that little four mil in like a flat spiral with seed beads. Oh, I've done that before. Wow. Um, agates are beautiful in your seed bead designs. Um, but again, you, you look at these for a really long time and you kind of cherry pick which ones you want to go where because look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. And it has got like a bit of a Branca Onyx feel to it as well. It hasn't definitely it? does. So you get your threading materials with this and you also get your sterling silver carrier beads again. So those are your carrier beads. There they are. There's your threading material. Here's your instructions and your three strands of totally natural agate. Now, I can't remember the last time we bought you strands of, you know, the completely 100%. You know, the Sakura, yeah, absolutely, that's natural. But to be able to bring you natural agate like this, which looks this, which looks this good, is just, is few, they're few and far between. That's giving you so much character, isn't it? 49.99, we're nowhere near done. Make it Lorraine, Elaine, uh, Suzanne, well done to you. We are nowhere near done. We're about to absolutely smash that price point down for you today. Congratulations, everybody. Well done. 10 seconds. Here we go. I love this. Totally 100% natural, naked <laughs> agate <laughs> rounds. Aren't they gorgeous? I mean, if you dye them, they're going to look absolutely beautiful. But leaving them like this, oh, yeah. They're I love just them like this. Gorgeous. Here we go, my lovelies. All the way down. Elaine, well done to you as well. Suzanne. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Amazing. £21.99. That's amazing. I'd sell this bracelet for more than that. And that's just like a handful of beads of spacers. And look how expensive that bracelet looks. That's £7 a strand and everything else is free. That bracelet looks so expensive. Yes, because of the agate. Yes, because of the pearl. Yes, because of the spacer beads, but also because of that incredible carrier bead yeah, that's as well. Why. I think it that, really is why, yeah, isn't it? It elevates it. Like, Doesn't it? Just you know, if you saw that in a boutique jeweler's, I can't. Twenty one ninety nine is frankly ridiculous. Yeah, that, I mean that bracelet that we've just looked at. That you would not sell that bracelet for twenty one ninety nine. No, 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 no. No way. No, no way. absolutely no way. No. Yeah, there's value in the pearl. There's value in the spacer beads, which obviously aren't <coughs> a project, but. <clears throat> Honestly, that is that is absolutely incredible. I can't believe that. Heather, Caroline, Brenda, Kerry, Wendy, well done to you. Davinia, Maker. 
um, abs just an absolutely incredible deal. Well done. Right, Deb, what are you, uh, you going to make for us, lovely? So I'm just going to make um, the Gorgeous. bracelet, but I'm going to do it in... Um, because not everybody's going to have the same spacer beads as I do. So mm. these are all completely different. Um, and it's just crimping. And um, if you wanted to make the necklace with the pearls, it's exactly the same technique. It's just using different components. Mm. So first of all, um, I've just made half already, so you don't have to watch me for ages. Yeah. Um, so first of all, um, you've got your carrier bead. Now, I've, I know I'm putting a gold turtle on a silver carrier bead, but that's because that's what I had left. Um, but actually, you know, mixed metal works together. So I'm putting a turtle on, but obviously you could put um, a pearl on, like I did in the bracelet, or you can put any gemstone of your choice. Um, you might have an initial bead or a birthstone charm. You can do anything like that. So what you need to do is get a jump ring um, and you're going to just connect your little turtle or whatever it is that you're you're, you're using um, to your carrier bead. So I always do that first so that then I can just string it onto my project. And then I've written in the instructions um, the sort of sequence of, of how I've done um, my design, if you wanted to use that for inspiration. So what I've done is I've crimped one end. I've used a toggle clasp just because I liked the look of this clasp for this particular design but of course you can use any clasp of your choice and then I've written in the instructions the sequence of beads up to here and then I'll show you the other half of the bracelet. Lovely. So what we're going to do you will have done this first so that you then you can pop it on when it comes to his turn to be on the bracelet. It's your turn now you can go on the bracelet. Ah. <laughs> there he is. Now, when you do, um, or when I do, um, a design like this, whether it be a necklace or a bracelet, I always kind of reverse this side down the other side. So basically what I've done here, um, I do here, so it's mirrored. So I'm, I've popped on, and this was literally just, you know, you must have bead soups at home of sort of bits and pieces left from strands. So I always go through that, and this is the Sakura one. Look at that little Sakura there. So Gosh, look at that. I found some little rose pearls that I had like <coughs> four of and, you know, some spaces from JM back in the day, you know, so this is great for using up your bits and pieces. Can I just say, by separating those out and putting other beads in between them, you are, you are really highlighting the merits of each individual gem, aren't you? I agree. And I think that it, what it does is it's really drawing your eyes now to these gemstones. Gosh, such clever use of components. I love it. Thank you. Well and, the, and the beads here you've got the larger ones here you've got the medium one here and then I've used the smaller ones to end so you've actually got three different sizes of the same gemstone and that's why I think in designs like this yeah. it really works so I'm just going to follow my um, design from the other side down and when I say that bead caps and um, spacer beads make a design i think this is a good example of that um, and sometimes you have like a couple of random spacer beads left from a bundle that you've bought um, and that's where like i've only used two of these on here um, sometimes you have a couple of jump rings left from some decorative jump rings that you've bought um, and you can actually add these in um, to a bracelet like this because if you have a look a close look at this design wise <coughs> excuse me um, we've got a lot of different things going on here but it works so you know you've got these little rhinestone spacers I had a few of these that literally are old school JM back in the day I had a couple of these more recent um, gold plated spacers and they're all different but they give a totally different look than if I just used round spacer beads which would equally be really pretty and a little bit more um, I want to not neat but a little bit more basic in construction um, like as if you look here you could have done that all the way along but you're dealing with um, it's just really your design style and I think when you're dealing with a project like this you can just let your design style really sort of shine through so I'm putting on the larger agates and then I'm just going to pop on I'm just mirroring what I did on the other side um, this little space of beads go in little one whatever <laughs> whatever you're not going in if you don't behave well, at least you didn't swear at them oh no i never swear, swear at beads so i bet she does i don't I, I might swear at other things tools yeah like mm. you know 
used to see me trying to maintain my nails whilst doing some serious silversmithing, <laughs> even with the good luck with that. Even with the finger protectors on. I mean, it is actually a miracle that I have any nails um, <laughs> left. As anyone who works with oh, metal darling. knows, but I didn't cut myself or anything, which is. Uh, which is good. So I'm just finishing off now, um, following my sequence, apart from that bead that didn't behave itself. Um, just to finish off, so two more beads to go. Now bear in mind, when you're using a toggle clasp, you need to mm. get um, this part of your toggle yeah. through this part of your toggle. So if you've got really large beads here, sometimes you'll find that you get stuck and you have to undo the whole thing. So don't crimp before you know that you're going to be able to get your toggle sort of through without too much fighting um, there. So then you just pop on a crimp bead and this is how I started the bracelet and most jewelry makers will know this. If you're new, then um, I'm, telling, I'm showing you all of it. So I've got a crimp bead there pop on my toggle clasp here and then I'm going to go back down my crimp bead and it's always a good idea if you can sometimes you can't because the holes aren't drill holes aren't big enough but go down a few of the beads after the crimp beads so we're going to pull this through and you want to have like leave kind of a little loop you don't want like a big lo loopy loop <laughs> a big loopy loop you want a little loop so keep pulling that crimp bead down and then pop your hands on and then just just really pull that and make sure before you crimp that everything's all snug and close together now you can use crimping pliers which will make this into a little tube and then you can pop on those pac-man findings which are actually the crimp cover i really like to see the metal and so i like to just squash it with my pliers so just give it a good couple of squeezes so you know that's really in place there and then all that's left to do is trim your tail there so what you're left with is a little pretty bracelet and I can get that toggle through quite quite easily um, and what's so lovely is every person's bracelet is going to be different everyone's bracelet because even mine were different because I didn't have any of the um, components left from that one because I took them from bead soup that yeah was, I was like oh, I've got two of those two of those put it all yeah. together and it actually it worked well I think it did I like it it's gorgeous um, but if you want to be a little bit more uniform of course you can do that too you're so good. Oh, thank Thanks, you. love. You're welcome. Thanks, love. Someone's asking about the carrier beads on their own. You are cheeky, you lot. Ooh. Oh, so Neary's looked and he can see four different types of carrier beads that, we're coming in, that we've got coming in for June. And they all look really nice. Well, that's great, Neary. <laughs> 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 great news, fun times. Take a look at what you could have won. Um, <laughs> and Bully special prize. <laughs> the only ones we can find are black carrier beads. Okay. So there are okay. some coming in, but not yet. <laughs> Excellent. Not yet. Great news. So June, yeah. Oh, and by the way, were you on the show when I learnt that um, what we've got launching in, what, what we've got coming back in September? No, I don't. Laguna Les Agate. No. <gasps> Hello. <laughs> it's only like eight years I've been asking Wayno for this. He's finally, He's done finally it. found it. Oh, that's exciting. Right, okay. Can we do this, please, Neary? This. What, the, these? This, can we do it? Have we got time? Go on, do it. How, how long's the start by thing? Is it nine seconds? Come on, we can do that, go, go. Right, just look at that. Honestly, this is just, this is ridiculous. Oh my God. Oh, that's beautiful, oh goodness me. Do you know there's affirmations? Mm. And I was writing affirmations in my, in my, in my journal the other mm. day. Um, Cause you know, you go through peaks and troughs, good, good times, not so good times, 
lots of anxiety at the beginning of this week, just really just kind of like feeling, oh, yeah. you know, just overwhelmed with everything, with life, with phone calls, just stupid, stupid stuff, mm -hmm. yeah? So I wrote in my journal, look how far you've come. Look at what you you've achieved so far. just gave me goosebumps then. Yeah. No, it's true. Look, look how far you've come. Look how far we've come. Yeah? Look at that. Literally sitting still. No special lighting, not even made into a necklace. Look how far we've come. Those are freshwater culture pearls and they are, they are awesome. Oh, they are. They're beautiful. There's no kind of, there's no kind of, you know, asking questions. And, oh, and we get told, don't make absolute claims. Don't make absolute claims because the customers can come back to us. They're beautiful. I don't care who you are. They are beautiful. That's not up for debate. They are beautiful. They are beautiful. Aren't they just? Okay. I'm going to pick them up. You look at these on the back of the hand. They're amazing. Oh, my gosh. I love the size. I love the shape. I love the quality. They're beautiful. Look at that. Aren't they gorgeous? Stunning, isn't it? Now this, uh, you, uh, yeah. <clears throat> oh gosh, I don't, I don't want to ruin anything. Okay, so we're at one nine nine. Oh. Okay. okay. Oh, okay. This is so, this is so cool. Right. All I'm going to say to you is, put this in your basket. Put it in your basket now. Ninety nine, ninety nine. Deb, mm. you get instructions by Nikki. Oh, amazing. Amazing. I love these, they're gorgeous. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know what you get with this strand? No. What you hide? <gasps> <laughs> Did you get that with it? <laughs> oh, it's gorgeous. Oh my Oh my gosh, I got goosebumps. Oh my gosh, I got goosebumps. Gold, plated, sterling, silver, oh, that's connector, lovely. with a pearl, ninety nine, ninety nine. Two individual split payments, white topaz. It's all absolutely blooming gorgeous. And we're not done. We're not done. We're not done. We're going lower. Oh, really? Incredible. So you get your incredible pearls. You get your yellow gold plated sterling silver connector with your pearl, with your white topaz. It's absolutely gorgeous. It is outrageous. Swansea's got two. Carolyn Berkshire, Brenda. I thought, uh, uh, honestly, this is crazy. Zara, Angela in Surrey. Well done to you as well. Oh my gosh. Owen in Manchester. Well done to you, my darling. Lovely to see your name. Haven't seen you for ages, sweetheart. This is crazy. This is, look how far we've come. Look how far we've come. Really? Forty nine ninety nine. Oh my gosh, that's way too low. Congratulations. Well done. It's 50 quid for all of that. Take it, add it to your order. Go, go, go. It's unbelievable. Yours today for 50 pounds. It's available on split pay of 25 pounds. That tells you everything you need to know about the price point that it should have been. 49.99 congratulations well done Beautiful. loads of you there check out we're going to go to a quick break when we come back we have got a brand new red jade buddha carving you're gonna oh. love it we'll see you in a sec shopping with jewelry maker couldn't be easier you can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day we also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Hi Jewelry Makers, it's Charlie. I'm back with you this Friday, Friday the 24th, and I'll be with the lovely Elle and the fabulous team. Uh, at nine o'clock, we have got some beautiful floral pendants. I'm going to be walking through how you go about setting those. And then at 12 o'clock, we have so many goodies. It's all about metal smithing, forging metal. Uh, so we've got lots of hammers, steel block. There's a new tool as well, a new tool that will help you 
Um, if you're uh, soldering at the minute and you're struggling to get everything set up, this is going to be really useful for you. Um, so I really look forward to sharing all that with you guys and I hope you can join me on Friday. See you then. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. to be part of an unofficial world record attempt and amongst the largest number of people making jewellery at one time. On Friday the 31st of May at 10am, Jewellery Maker will be holding the world's biggest make-along, where over Zoom you can join fellow jewellery makers of all abilities as we attempt to break a world record. Whether you've never made jewellery before or it's your favourite hobby, you can join us. All you have to do is sign up via the link below. We will send you an email with the Zoom link to join us near the time. Go to www.jewellerymaker.com for inspiration and of course, how to sign up. See you on the 31st of May for the world's biggest make-along. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewellery Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Jewellery Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Dave. That isn't it? Isn't it incredible? <laughs> yeah, you know, I don't know what more we can say. There's no introduction needed. I mean, when you just saw Carol there, you can see those two vivid pops of red, huge pieces oh. across the studio. Now, we, we are, of course, you know, you know, we're talking about a brand new piece of, of red jade, which is extraordinarily important in 2024. You know, just so many of you are aware, the only jadeite that I have bought in the market that hasn't been for Jewelry Maker or Gemporia for myself, my own personal collection, was a piece of red jade. It was this year. It was a tiny, tiny donut. And it was from Mason and Kay, and it was incredible. It was set into 14 karat gold, and it was three times the price of what this is going to be today. Wow. I'm saying that because I gen we'd already placed this order, but the, the teams that we're working with in the Far East right now, with pearls and jade, um, have frequently kind of cancelled orders. And it's not bad form, it's just 
you know, the prices change so much that they'll refund the money. It's not like they keep the money, but they're saying that we can't do it for that price anymore, right? Mm -hmm. we, we make agreements and obviously we do it months and months out. We've already placed orders for January. I was just talking to Wayne. And sometimes things change so drastically. Mm -hmm. Most of the time, if things just change and they'll eat the cost, they'll just say, do you know what? We've, we've got an amazing business relationship. This time we're making no money on it, but we'll honor it. But in, in a lot of instances, specifically with the fancy colors, there has been at least a dozen times in the last 12 months, if you really want to know, that I have had orders both an, for Jewelry Maker and Gemporia that have been canceled after we paid a deposit and it's been in production for six months on the fancy colors of jade. That's the lavenders, the yellows and with red. And for pearls, it's over 20 times that's happened. Mm. In fact, you guys probably are aware, I've told you on air if you join me on Gemporia, about three or four weeks ago, I had a showcase of uh, Golden South Sea pearls. Mm. And I placed the order, paid a, a huge deposit on it, um, and it's you know, been in production for a long time. And it was a strand, a bracelet, uh, earrings, and a pendant. All that turned up was the earrings and the pendant. And they just said, look, you know, it, and there, there was to me work, because we've been working with them for about seven years, this team, incredible team. Yeah. And, and we continue to work with them, by the way. But they said, look, if it, even if it was double the cost, Dave, we'd have swallowed the cost, we'd let you have it. But the price has changed so drastically, we won't. So I knew that I had. Uh, the dream of bringing you red jade this year like it, I knew I'd place the order but that doesn't mean much right now with gemstones like this and so I was in Tucson and I thought I know Mason and Kay very well Jeff Mason the team I trust them implicitly and they had two pieces of red jade on their booth they had a strand and they had this tiny donut in 14 karat gold now you by the way I usually wear it every day but my um, chain is being fixed at the minute but I usually just wear it under under my clothes every day really mm. understated but I just want you know jade is such an important gemstone to me I was like I want to wear a piece every day it has to be the rarest which is that red jade and so I I, I thought to myself am I, am I going to regret this like you know later on in the year if we have no red jade if the orders are cancelled and I had the opportunity to get that one piece in Tucson would I regret it mm. and I'm going to be completely transparent with you and say I paid you know, multiple times what you're about to pay for a piece that is far smaller and less saturated than this. Many of you may have already seen it. I've shown it on air a couple of times. Mm. This is a, an opportunity that we might not get again. Um, we, we place orders all the time. We, the reason we don't talk about them or promote them too far out is because, as I said, with some of the rarest uh, colors, sorry, I might sneeze. <laughs> I'm all right. No. Bless you. I, I oh, almost such made a it. girly sneeze, I know, Dave. I know, I know. Apologies. Oh, <laughs> Apologies. Gee, it's not a big manly Never one. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to do that. You'll hear it in the corridor later. Just to <laughs> regain some macho-ness. I'll fake a really masculine, desperate dance sneeze, you know, with my cow pie or something. But it was a girly sneeze. It, it is what it is. You know, that, that is, uh, that oh, is, that is God, one of my weaknesses. Fine. I'll be honest. I do have a girly sneeze. <laughs> uh, but... Um, now you know, okay, the secret's out. Um, <laughs> it's on live TV. It's probably going to be clipped up, sent into, you know, you've been framed or something, uh, titled the girliest sneeze in the world. But, you know, it is what it is. I mean, you wouldn't expect a macho sneeze from me anyway. Would you? I mean, that would be even more ridiculous, wouldn't it? Oh, but, okay, well, I'm sorry to have disappointed. Oh, and to any of you that were expecting. I know, and I've built it up as well. But Gosh, look at this red jade, Dave. Yes, exactly. So... <laughs> As I said, <laughs> yeah, this on. might well turn out to be uh. the, the, the last of our incredible red jade. On the weekend, I was in uh, London. I was there, you know, uh, for, for having fun, really. But I did go to Mayfair. I did go to Bond Street because I was oh, there wow. for the weekend. And I was looking at the wonderful jade again in the Asprey showroom. Of course. Um, and obviously, again, I didn't ask to see that piece of rough from out the back. I don't think they'd get it out anyway. But the 18 million pound piece because of the, the color of red. And we know that. So Asprey are set to lead the luxury jade art market with the launch of their exclusive collection. This was last year. Um, and you can see it's an article that's been covered by Forbes, the Rob Report, everyone. They talk about how its collection is so rare, only available to view by invitation only. And it's primarily imperial green jade. 90% mm. of it is imperial green jade. And the prices start, the entry level is £130,000. It goes up to 18 million. That's the 18 million pound. Gosh. Piece. So I know we've shown it many, many times. Yeah, it's but stunning. it's worth reminding you that when you're talking about red jade in the current climate, it far outweighs the value and price that we see for the imperial green. I remember speaking to Stanley Chu uh, four or five weeks ago in Hong Kong, and he's the, his family are responsible for bringing the finest jade to the market. And he said, with the way that the red jade price has increased so dr drastically, so dramatically, his family have probably given away $200 million worth of red jade. Good grief. I mean, they've sold them, they made profits on them, but if they'd have sold them today, mm. he's making the point, we, we've sold them far too low because it's the material we can't get anymore. Guatemala is in the news 
over the last year because they've found imperial green jade there they found black jade there they're finding ice jade there Gosh. the one thing that they're probably never going to find is that red jade same with the lavender they probably won't find that in guatemala burma is the only location that has produced red jadeite which mm. is you know extraordinarily exciting and to have a carat weight this large is supreme it's so valued in fact red jadeite that this piece is considered a red jade bangle Mm. Even though it's about 20-15% of it that is red mm -hmm. and white is, is, rare, is, is rare enough, you know, that's valuable enough. You could have said a bicolor jade out bangle, but Bums yeah. list that as a red jade out bangle. And that was back in 2015 when the mines in Myanmar in, in the Kachin Hills were still producing. This is how jade out forms. So on the right is a, a depiction of like the, the holy grail boulder. Um, if, all the, if you think of a boulder as an apple, the, the flesh of the apple is always going to be green jade eye. And you can see it on a real cross section of a jade boulder on the left there. Yeah. It's, it's all different variations of green because of the chromium content. The crust or the skin, which is so thin comparatively, is the only place that the red to yellow series or spectrum can exist. It's the only location that, that can produce that because of the way that it oxidizes. You'll never get a red boulder. And it's one in, I don't know, one in 10,000, one in 100,000, one in a million. It could be any of those numbers that even has red in there. That piece on the left, although it has imperial green in there and celadon green, doesn't have any red or yellow in the crust. It's yeah. not usable. It's not jadeite. We are in the possession right now of a very, very small quantity auction, huge carrot weight, mm. impeccable carving of Taipei red jadeite. And pieces like this, this really illustrates how the boulders form. This is a vase, it's, you know, 1790 to 1860 in that region when it was crafted. And you can see you've got the green, but then you've got that red skin clinging to it. Yeah. When we saw the piece from May, uh, Mayfair, from the Asprey Jewelry mm -hmm. House, it's just that slice inside, that thin vein of red. Mm. That's why we very rarely ever see, well, I've never seen, other than at Mason and Kay, a red jadeite strand. Yeah. Because you can't get enough of the material, you can't create solid color. Usually with red jadeite, it will be bicolor because so little of the material is red. To have a full body red jadeite such as this, Oh is is genuinely gosh. a masterpiece and, and frank look at that from there yeah that's that's red jade eye taipei red jade eye hand carved Dave. thank you guys apologies and we're going to sell this far too low today far too low wow i, I cannot get over <sighs> the fact that this is here on jewelry maker it's beautiful yeah it, it is as good as it gets um and i'm going to offer you a unique exquisite opportunity on this again another red jade out bangle it's another reason mm. there has never been there never has there been a red jade out bangle that exists a solid one yeah, you can't get it really? and, and more often than not even pieces like this i literally had uh, tried to acquire uh, a red jade out piece for my own jewelry house the other day i sent it to be certified and they couldn't determine the color so i had to cancel the order it was five figures and it was still bicolor. Mm. To get full body red like this yeah. is on another level. And I want you to understand that, that this may well be the last chance we have of bringing you red jadeite moving forward. We might have orders in the pipeline, but there is always the risk that they are canceled. Now, when you do get solid red color, these are the prices they command. Yep. Okay, so now you're not got bicolor, red or white or red or green. When you get a slither, a slice of red jadeite and it's full body color, it's just on a shoelace, it's on a cord, this is back in 2014, far before the mines were depleted and exhausted. This was offered at Bonhams for a price somewhere between forty-one and forty-six thousand dollars. Grief. And we, we know that the pre-sale estimates are always low, ridiculously low. Your your piece that I'm bringing you, I'm just going to say it because it sounds insane. It's like a pinch me moment. The piece I'm offering you is larger than that. The carving is more detailed than that, mm. and it's more saturated than that. That's the, the truth. I can't say that if it's not true. That is the reality. And even more so, it's one thing for me to show you the auction houses, you know, historic pieces, uh, unbelievable opportunities. I can take you to you know, places like First Dips. Mm. And I can show you a piece of red jade that is available today. Right now. That's it. It's a bead. And the price is £10,000. Yeah. Okay. Natural Taipei, Manma, red jade, just as ours is. 18 karat gold bale, white gold. With, uh, with diamonds, like a few melee diamonds, again on a cord on a shoelace. You probably look at that and you go, well, it's 10,000 pounds, they're probably never gonna sell it. They probably just priced it there because you can make an offer. Well, first dibs have this great uh, um, feature, feature where yeah. you can figure out you know, if this is a fair price. And it is. 
you know, and this is uh, I I you're comparing prices of previous pieces that have sold in the same size and color range. And when you're comparing the prices, they're saying similar sold items. Well, this is in the medium range. It's not high, it's not low. This is the average price. So I, I had to be here for this one incredible auction today. There's 50 of them, so not really a huge amount, which I don't think any of us thought there would be a huge amount. There's another piece coming up afterwards, which we've only got five of, just mm -hmm. to put it into context. That's your red jade. I'm going to give you 30 seconds, and it's up to you if you want to make the decision today to own Taipei red jade eye, possibly for the last time. Possibly for the last time. In 24 seconds, this piece, this full-bodied red jade eye, is going to be available for our collectors. Just look at that. And I'm just going to show you. Yeah, this is this is awesome. Oh my gosh. This. Wow. You know, we talk about jadeite. Sorry, my torches. We talk about jadeite and it exists on the red to yellow spectrum. Just as the black exists on the black to gray spectrum. And the lavender exists on the, the lavender to pink spectrum. My gosh. Yeah. I can't believe the jade's this large. It's huge, isn't it? Like, it's like, you know, it is. It's absolutely massive. I mean, that, from there, the fact yeah, that that, really um, um, that orb, that huge, incredible opportunity. And we've got the lights fully up here, and I love that. Because yeah, it's one thing to dim like the lights. That. Yeah. And, and you've just got the opportunity to get something like this. And if I was to say to you, do you know what? This is, this is two and a half thousand pounds today. Yeah. It's too low. Like, that's the reality. I'm, if I'll show you the piece that, I've, that was five figures, if I may. Yeah, please. Um, because it's actually smaller than this piece. Um, Look, at this. Look at this. You've got Buddha wearing a mala. Oh, my gosh. Sitting atop a this mountainside. Is, Sorry, go on. This is the piece. Bicolor. Oh, my God. Gosh. Right, and this is something that was five figures. And wow. then you look at the opportunity you've got for yourselves today. That's incredible. Yeah, wow. and it's not, it's not like huge or anything. It's just on a cord, but that's the, the picture that they sent me. I've had to refuse that. Today, you've got pure, glowing, vivid red jade. Maker in Lanarkshire has got three. Hazel's yeah. got two. By the way, just to put that into context, 10% context, 10% of the stock's gone to two people. Yes, yes, yes. That, that, that's, yeah. that's how limited this that's opportunity exactly is. It. I would love to just do this as an upwards auction, just one time in our history. Just go, oh, we could start at zero. We've got one of them. Mm. Bid away, and whoever the highest bidder is gets it. Yeah. What would it, what, I mean, I genuinely, if we had one of these and we said that, look, we're going to do a, a new format just for one auction a week, and we're going to start at zero. There's no reserve. If only one person bids and they bid a pound, they get it. What would this end up at, though? Genuinely, oh. because look how many people want it. Yeah, And if exactly. we only had one, what would that end up at? Because I've got no doubt in thinking we'd be in the thousands. Yeah. We, we, like, we'd have to For do sure. it in like 10 pound increments, right? So you go, right, you can bid in 10 pound increments. Pretty soon, well, by now we'd be in the hundreds. Absolutely. And by the end of this auction, we'd be in the thousands. Oh but I'm gosh. offering you the opportunity to get this for one of the most affordable deals you're gonna get. Um, and I would say, if you can afford to, if you are in the market for a very, very special piece of jade, as I was uh, at the beginning of this year when I was in Tucson, then I'm going to say multi-buy. And I would feel unfair not telling you that. I'm not saying everyone's got that kind of disposable income. I'm not saying it's not going to be considered. But what I will promise you is it's going to be the biggest considered saving I'm going to do this year mm. on Jadeite. For the market value of a piece like this, when we're talking about the, those fancy colors of Jadeite, we're talking about 100 carats with the most incredible depiction of the, the, the smiling Buddha, with the mountains, with the sunset, yes, with the yes. rivers, with the streams. I'm going to start you off at three and a half thousand pounds. I'm nowhere near done. You guys know that. This is actually going to be one of the most affordable red jade items I've ever offered, Jen. I'm making that Incredible. promise early on. Okay, Maker in Lanarkshire's got three. Hampshire's got three. Leslie, West Midlands well has got it. Swansea's got it. Rupaul's got it. Barbara's there. Maker's there. Leslie's there. Julie's there. Maker in Swansea. Yep. Cheshire's there. Heather in Lancashire's there. Wow. I'm genuinely, I could end this auction right now and uh, I'd, I'd go home and I'd feel really, really good about the fact that I've just saved you a lot of money by offering it you yes, three and a half thousand pounds. Absolutely. I'd feel over the moon. 
because I know with my own uh, jewelry house, my own jewelry brand, how difficult it is to get red jade out. I'd love to bring red jade out. You know, the first ever showcase I ever did was Imperial Jade out, on, on my own brand, yeah. right? And the only thing that would top that for me is if I could bring you a showcase of red jade out. Oh, wow. And I can't. I, I literally can't. I'm trying. You've just seen the piece that I tried to acquire for you. I try as I might, I can't get you red jade out. So I apologize. But you've got it right now. You've got the opportunity to get it right now. And I'll also tell you that you're not going to be paying even four figures today. Oh my gosh. You're not even, I mean, just hearing that, this should be sold out. Yeah. The fact that this is going to be available for less than a thousand pounds, a hundred carats of Taipei Red Jade out from Myanmar, it should be gone. Jane's just got two. Yeah, well done, Jane. Congratulations. Alison in Bristol, well done to you. Maker Karen Alwyn, Maker Barbara, Maker, Maker Julie, Maker A, Heather, Maker. There's so many people there. All right, you know what? 30 second clock. Wow. Oh my gosh. This might be the last chance you see it. And yeah. I just want to prepare you for that. I'm not saying it definitely is. I'm saying we're always trying. We're always placing orders. But it's whether those orders uh, end up here in the building. Yeah, for sure. So when, if you see it and you can afford it, take it. That's my, the best piece of advice I was ever given in the jewelry industry. It's as simple as that. If you see something you fall in love with for whatever reason and yeah. you can afford it in that moment, then get it because the, the gemstone world, more than anything else, is feast or famine. Yeah. There's a discovery, the material is prevalent for a time, then it disappears. And Carol, you've been in the industry long enough to have seen that so many times. Oh my gosh. You know, um, Russian Alexandrite, Brazilian Paraiba, you know, the, the, the color change sapphires Absolutely. from southern Tanzania, the, the blue garnets from Madagascar. We don't get that material anymore. Nope. And, and when we did get it, we sold it far too low. Far too low. Straight down to 799, oh not done. Gosh. Straight, straight away we're in three figures. 799 is where I'm going. I'm nowhere near done. I actually started um, this showcase with a sneeze. But other than that, I did start by saying, this is going to be one of the most affordable red jade outs we've bought here. Oh my uh, gosh. Making that promise. Like, but for, for one of the biggest the as well. Yeah, 100 carats. Just incredible. Jane, uh, Elise, we've got you as well. Maker and Angus, Karen in Cheshire. There's loads in baskets. Do consider what Dave has been saying about this particular piece. Mm -hmm. One of the most affordable red jade pieces. Yeah, I mean, with the torch, it, 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 it's, it, insane. it's literally alive. And I just want to it? take you back to that piece at Bonhams from 2014, if oh I may, which was that, that slither, that slice, which was smaller than the piece we've got. Um, this one. Yeah, yeah. You know, like it's full body red. Yeah. And back in 2014, the pre-sale estimate on that, like, is 41 to 46 thousand uh, dollars, 320 to 360 thousand Hong Kong dollars. And like back in 2015, 2016, 2018, we'd have looked at that. I certainly would have at some point, and said, "Oh my God, how the other half live if we could ever get a piece of that." I'm not offering you a piece today. Hazel's got three. But Maker and Lanarkshire's got three. Swansea's got two. Jane's got two. But back in 2014, yeah, when Red Jade, well, when Jade was still coming yeah. out of Burma. And Red Jade, although you know? that's extraordinarily valuable and rare, that is severely underpriced by today's standards. Oh, Isn't that insane? Totally, I'm at 799 totally, pounds right now. Yeah. I am, I'm, I'm under a thousand pounds. I mean, this, is the, this, this already is one of the greatest deals we've ever done at this moment. When we take into to, to, uh, consideration that we're in 2024, 10 years later than that piece at Bonhams. Yeah, exactly. A decade on. 30 second clock, please, Bruce. Don't you love the design? You've got the Buddha, he's got the yeah. Mala, he's sitting atop a mountain, looking down on the, uh, on the trees. You've got the mountains in the background, you've got the sun in the background. It's just, it's a beautiful kind of vignette, isn't it? It's absolutely Half gorgeous. Half the stock has pretty much gone. Look at that. There is more people on the front lines than I have available. We yeah. are gonna look after you today. It is gonna be sensational, it's gonna be spectacular. And Huge I think it's gonna, to it's gonna shock many of you. There's a reason I said multi-buy. There's a reason I said, if you can, make sure you're multi-buying. Neri, I'd like, right. I hope, you know, 30 seconds, sometimes we look at it and we just think it's a gimmick. It's, it's it, you know, there's a clock on the screen. Mm. That was my cue to you to say, this is your time to get involved before I call the price. And now I'm gonna take 500 pounds off the price. How and much? I'm not done. 500 pounds coming off the price right now. 299. You got it. And I'm not done. And it's probably wow. gonna sell out right now. It's probably gonna sell out. Wow. And I'm not done. There's only 50, we only started with 50 chances. Yeah. 50, I mean, that's actually a, a, a really, really decent quantity considering. Mm -hmm. 
Lynn Maker, Zara, loads of you there. A in Cheshire's just multi bought. Patricia in Middlesex, well done to you. Alison in Bristol, you're there. Lynn in Hampshire, well done to you as well. And the more anonymous bidders, well done. I'm, I'm promising you I'm going lower, but I would just say to every single one of you, there's only 50 of them. Yeah. How many times have you tuned into any showcase here when we've got 200 and they sell out like that or 100? Yeah. There's 50 of these. It's jadeite, which is the gemstone that is our best selling gemstone. Everyone loves it. Yeah. It's red jadeite, which is the rarest version and the most expensive and valuable. Oh my There's gosh. Maker in Lanarkshire just took, just took pretty much 10% of the stock to themselves. Yes. You've just bought four of these. Oh my Allison gosh. Allison in Bristol, you've bought two. A in Geraldine, Cheshire, you've bought two. Dad. Hazel's got three. Jane's got two. Swansea's got two. Wow. Over half the stock's gone. Yes. If you if you are if you're considering this, if you're saying, yeah, I, I love this, I want it, I can create something spectacular with this, 100 mm -hmm. carats of red jadeite from Manmar, I can do something insane, then you, you've got about 20 chances to do it. And I'm promising you I'm taking the price lower and oh considerably gosh. lower, not a little bit coming off. Okay, Hazel, you've got four. Maker in Lanarkshire has got four. Lanarkshire's there, more people there. Diane's there, Maker, Lynn. We're at 299 and Dave has already said he is not done at that price. Yeah, and, and I said it knowing that we would be, we would have this influx at this oh, point. Oh, huge. Like, we like this is gonna, I mean, realistically, I genuinely think, you know, you know Jewelry Maker better than I do. If we just stay here for four minutes, five minutes, it oh, sells yeah. out, right? Yeah, absolutely, with, 100%, with yeah, definitely. And I know Dave. that, and it could, I'm happy for it to sell out at this price and I'll still take it lower. That's why I said it as soon as we crashed the price. Maker and Cumbria's got two. Hampshire's got four. Lanarkshire's oh got four. Uh, City of Bristol's got two. Uh, Cheshire's got two. Somerset's got two. Swansea's got two. Wow. We're, we're over allocated at this point with phone line bidders. Yeah. But you've still got, uh, uh, you've still got an opportunity. You can swoop in and take that. Gosh. Particularly if you've got the app or the web. You yes, don't have to definitely. wait in the queue. If you want to be in the queue, that's up to you. Uh, Swansea's just taken three. Cumbria's taken oh two. My gosh. Hampshire's taken four. Lanarkshire's taken four. Bristol's taken two. Cheshire's taken two. Somerset's taken two. I mean, what the hell? People are going to have to wish, on the wish list. list. They're going to have to wish, wish list. list it. Yeah, they're going to have to do that. Right now, I'm looking at this and going, what are we doing? It's at 74 pounds on your interest rate. It's, it's absolutely crazy. When you consider the detail of the carving, when you consider the piece that we just looked at on, um, was it Bonhams? But it was Bonhams, yeah, from 2014, from a decade ago. Ten, a decade ago, when, when the world was so different, when the jade world was so different. And, and, and even beyond that, like we show that because it's a, a more a closer representation of this, because it's full yeah, body, yeah. it's larger, yeah. you know, great. But when we show you a bead and it's 10 grand, mm. it's alarm bells. And see that that is a, a medium, yeah, you know, yeah, a yeah. medium the price, price for it on yeah. first dibs. That's crazy. Okay, we will do it. I've promised that we'll do it. Um, can I have a 30 second clock, um, please? Oh gosh. And uh, I'm taking it lower. Oh, how many do I have left? 15. 15 chances. We've seen how many multi bidders there are. Those 15 chances can go to as little as, I don't know, seven people, five people. Yeah. When we have, you know, multi bidders. There's so many people there. We are way over allocated. People with twos and threes sitting in their baskets. Check out as soon as you can, everybody. We are taking this price point down one final time. It is going to sell out on the live show today. Incredible. Yeah, your deal right now, 199. Oh my gosh. I'm taking there 100 pounds off. I'm taking 100 pounds wow. off. Wow. And we're practically sold out. We're certainly over allocated with the people yeah. on the phone lines. But you, yeah, if you can do it, do it. If you can't, then unfortunately, I do have another piece coming up for you, but there's five of them in the world. Split pays are fifty pounds. My God, look at it! Larger than life, just behind you there on the screen. Yeah. Just rotating it, round, just, glowing. Oh, I always look the wrong way. Absolutely incredible. So glossy, so beautiful. The, the depiction's absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Do you want to shine the torch for it again, Dave? Of course, Cause honestly, because yeah, this is going to go. And can I just say, of um, oh, sorry, no, let's have a quick look at the. Uh, yeah, just look at this. Oh my gosh! Look at that. Sunset, sunrise tones. Yeah. That is absolutely beautiful. I've got eight left. You can still do it. You have not missed out just yet. Wow. How many in baskets? 65 in baskets mm -hmm. for seven. Yeah. That's absolutely incredible. Do a minute clock to close this one out. Minute wow. clock to close out, even if we have the quantity. There's uh, six chances, one minute on your screen. I mean, I don't know if it'll last that long, but we've got to, we've got to find somewhere to close this auction. 
The names that I can see within basket. Oh, sorry. Dave, you're mad, but we love you for it. Spectacular, Jason. Thank you so Hazel. much. Oh. Uh, thank you, Mandy. <laughs> is that for the sneeze or is that for the... Uh... <laughs> yeah, I think it was for the sneeze, Yeah, I think it, it was, yeah. wasn't it? Uh, so we've got Maker in Surrey, another Maker, Deborah, Linda, Maker in Lanarkshire, Maker, uh, Elise, Maker in Angus, uh, Karen, Barbara, Maker in Cumbria, Julie, A, Heather, with two threes in their baskets. And, and they're just the names that we can see. That it, It's absolutely incredible what's happening today. 25 seconds, we're taking the details away. We're down to the final five. Yeah. And we've got over 50 still in baskets. That's absolutely incredible. We can tell that you want it. That is your prize point. Unbelievable. Over 50 in baskets, five price. left. Only one in 10 of you can be successful. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Isn't it? There you, you know, go. like if, yeah. if all of you click check out, you've got a one, one in 10 chance of even getting this. Yeah. Be, be that collector. Get involved. Make sure you're confirming. Make sure you're checking out. Make sure this is yeah. yours. Make sure it's coming home to you. Awesome. Congratulations. Well, well done. done. Congratulations. Woo! I did say we had another piece coming up, but I've only got five of them. I'm going to bring it live straight away. It is oh. yeah, the, the, the turning horse, which is just sensational. Look at him. I'll show you with the torch. Oh, yeah, it's amazing with the torch. But look at that. Just in that central the portion. There. Five chances in the world. I'm going to bring it live for you right now. Wow. Supreme carrot weight, but the, the absolute unbelievable attention to detail. This, this piece is all part of the same piece of jade that hasn't been placed in the center independently because it turns. It moves. That kind of rocking horse, it's absolutely incredible. And that is, uh, that's magic. Or as close to it as you'll ever get. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna call one price on this. Uh, that's all I can do. I've got two left. Two chances remaining. Oh gosh, look! Oh, yeah, straight down. Even though we're, we're talking about a supreme piece and this central portion, what they have to do is the solar bore is so time-consuming and and very low success rate. They have to carve an, a rail on the internal part here, separate this so it can freely move. Yeah, and they have to carve this rail um, on the inside that it sits within without wow. ever removing it and polish it down so that it can move freely like this. Two left. Okay. Um, 249. Look at that. Look at that. Two, Isn't he gorgeous? Four, nine. Look at this. So he's sitting in a. Um, can I show you? He's sitting in the little lucky horseshoe. The lucky horseshoe is just there. Isn't that beautiful? There's your lucky horseshoe. Isn't he gorgeous? It's double sided with that carving, isn't that just incredible? And he moves completely freely around the carving. Isn't that incredible? Isn't that just beautiful? Well done. Two, four, nine, sold out, well done. Oh, wow, incredible. Congratulations, well done. Now, um, yeah. Okay, that's completely sold out. Well done. Okay, look, I've got, I've got one final birthday deal with you. There was a time during the birthday where I was not a bit able to be in the studio. Right. Um, I went to the Phillips Auction House, which was uh, amazing. Oh, yes. Yeah, so I went to the Phillips Auction House. But, How was it? Um, we were talking about sats, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was invited to that. Uh, by Benoit Rappellen, who's the head of jewels at the Phillips Auction House. Yeah. He said, I'd love you to come to the auction. Love what you do. Would love to chat. Maybe have, you can interview me. It was amazing. And I agreed to it and everything. And then I realized the, the, the auction was on the 13th of May on the Monday. And I realized it was my daughter's Sats week. Oh. So I had to call him up and say, I can't do it. Right, so I said, I can't be there. And he was kind enough to say, no worries. If you can, come the weekend before, right? And I'll open up the auction floor to you, but no one's there and you can get hands on with Oh my gosh. Jewels. So it actually worked out better. Yes. Because I'm not in a crowded room. I mean, Lawrence Graff bought the red diamond on the Monday for a world record. 4.2 no. million dollars. How many? 4.2? Yeah, for a 1.56 carat red diamond. It's a world record price per carat for a red diamond. It's a world record for a red diamond in general. Um, and obviously there was a 280 carat um, Colombian minor oil emerald. There was a 6.7 carat pink diamond that was type 2A. Oh. The most chemically pure pink diamond in the world. It was just Harry Winston, uh, incredible necklace of yellow diamonds. It was just insane. It was amazing to be there and get hands on with everything, chat with the team at the Phillips Auction House. But because I couldn't be here, I, I saved a couple of the, the auctions. I, I made some phone calls into the studio, but there were some pieces I wanted to be here for. And this is one of them. It's a red jade eye. I've only got 25 of them. And I'm gonna, if, if, look, as an apology, 
I'm going to do it for the lowest price ever today. Even, what have we done? Uh, 249, 199. I'm going to do this for even lower than all of those. But there's only 25. It's a unique, incredible landscape. This is it. It's a unique, incredible oh. landscape. Um, oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, oh, my God, yeah. You're going to see. Um, it's going to go nuts because we should never. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wow. Wow. That is so right, cool. Neary, uh, we don't have 100, we don't have 50, we have 25, let's 25? bring it live. 25? Let's bring this live right now. And I'm gonna do it as an apology deal. Apologies that I wasn't here. Lowest price ever I've done a red jade for. In, in my whole career with working with jade, this is the piece. If you Thank you, to. yeah. Okay, so. Oh, wow. Yeah, congratulations, multi-buy if you can, it's going significantly. Oh, it's let's, beautiful. Let me just, start at 199. Just, just look at the back. Oh yeah. The back is absolute. Look at that. That's so solid body color. Yeah. Wow. Just to prove the point, I'm going to start at 199. <gasps> oh my gosh. Forget the thousands, forget everything else. Type A, incredible Burmese jade out from from uh, Myanmar, from Burma. It, that intensity of color, that incredible incredible saturation, that translucency wow. which is insane. 199. Yeah. Okay, so I had 25, I don't have 25. There's three split payments on this. Okay. Um, Maker in Swansea, Cumbria, Cheshire, Swansea, Angus. Yeah. If there's ever a piece of red jade out to, to multi-buy on, this is it. It is one of the purest colors. It is uh, translucent. It yes. literally glows. It is this unique landscape with a figure in the foreground, a uh, traditional uh, Chinese artistry. I'm going, to give you, I'm going to give you all 30 seconds. You're getting an equal opportunity. Um, I wanted to be in the studio for this auction in particular. It was meant to be here during our birthday celebrations, but unfortunately I couldn't make it. So it is here today by way of an apology and I'm going to take it even lower than 199. Right now it's 66 pounds on interest free split payments. It's going to get a whole lot better. Goodness me, I am genuinely in shock. How, how could we be sitting at 199 any other day? Yes. This, this piece is 299. Well, I was, I was, I was, I was, yeah, I was gonna maker. say 279, two, 299, two, yeah. nine, nine, 249 even, but 199. Mm -hmm. And we're nowhere near done. But oh, that's I always crazy. like to go to the bank. This is my final deal with you. I know you've got the incredible mass flask coming up. Oh, no, Carol still has some incredible oh. uh, uh, jewelry to bring to you and, yeah. and gemstones to bring to you, but your deal right now, yeah, Cumbria, you've got two, 149. Oh my gosh, that's, uh, that is literally, get it, mm -hmm. that is, Unbelievable. I don't think you're ever going to get a better yeah, deal probably, than that on Red Jade like this. Probably more in line with the size of the piece at the Bonhams Auction House. Oh, I mean, don't. the other piece we brought you was larger than that, I would, I would argue, but wow. this is more that kind of size. You put Look. this on a bale, you put this on a cord. It's £49 on interest-free split payments right now. That's absolutely incredible. Cumbria's got two, Middlesex, Swansea, London, West Midlands, Devon, Cheshire, uh, Swansea, Angus, well done to you. Absolutely amazing. Right. That, is, that is tremendous. David in Great London, Leslie in West Midlands, yes, Carrie in well Devon, done, Karen in Cheshire, That's Maker sick. in Swansea, Maker in Angus, multi-buyers, Middlesex, Swansea, Great London, yes. Merseyside, collectors joining us from all over the world today, wanting to be a part of this wow. incredible showcase. Just look at the quality you've got there. You've got the bridge, you've got the person yeah. on the bridge, which just shows the transition between one world and another. You've got the, uh, the gorgeous acacia tree, which is incredibly lucky. You've got the mountains in the background. It's just amazing they can cram so much yes. into these carvings. Uh -huh. So much detail, so much symbolism. Painstakingly carved. It's exactly yeah, over, it. Over, Let's not Over yeah. many, many, yeah. many hours. I mean, the, 149 would be incredible yeah. just for this piece, just yeah, for well, this we saw plate. A bead, didn't we, for a crazy yeah. deal. I only had 20. 10 grand that you've was. You've still got the opportunity. You can still do it. Maker and Greg London, I'm talking to you. Uh, another maker in London, Kerry, I'm talking to you. Karen, maker, yep. maker in Angus, uh, Leslie. All of you are, can be successful as it stands right now, but we only had the most limited opportunity on this because of that saturation of color, because of the translucency. This is your opportunity. Yep. Um, and I wish you all well. I wish you all the best of luck. This is the, the, the crazy birthday deal that we're yes. making happen for you today. That's absolutely incredible. I'll Congratulations. Do a minute to close everyone. if that's okay. I don't want to oversell this. No, I don't want to upset anybody. I don't know 100% how many we have remaining. Try your luck. It's 149, less than 50 pounds on interest free split payments. That is Jedi. That is the real deal. And uh, oh, there's seven left. Yeah, seven. minute clock to close. Oh my gosh, seven chances remaining. Well done. You've been privy to some absolutely ridiculous deals. This one here, though, is just, I mean, that is. 
That is more than an apology price. That's above and beyond. That's absolutely yeah. incredible. What a gorgeous piece. Well done, everyone. Go, go, go. 50 seconds. We're taking the details away. Well done. Whether you put that on a piece of Five cord, left. like the bottom yeah, one. Yeah, 100%. Or whether you incorporate it at the bottom of a marla, you know, put it Maybe in Maybe some of you that are multiplying are going to make earrings. Oh, Imagine yeah, that. well, it's just the right size, aren't they? That huge pendant that you just bought in the previous yeah. uh, auction. Either way, just make sure you've got this in your collection. Make sure you've got this in your family's heirloom collection. It's red jadeite, for goodness sake. Uh, collectors in Devon and Cheshire and Swansea and Angus, you can be one of the five if you're checking out. Absolutely. Well done, everyone. Go, go, go. 0800 six triple four six double five congratulations everybody well done take advantage of those just so you know well worth it um this is heated red jade which is still considered type a it yep. is irreversible it's not polymer impregnated it is not um uh, coated in any way it's not dyed it is just a, a heat treatment mm -hmm. a gentle heat treatment usually done at the mine um to the, to the skin of the boulder and only a very small amount of it turns red so they, they just wanted to cover that off. Type A still can mm -hmm. be heated material. Type B obviously is your, your polymer impregnated and type C is dyed. So you're mm. still getting type A jade out, but we just go above and beyond in giving you all the information, all the facts. We want you to have that. Fantastic, fantastic. Um, three look, left. we've got three chances remaining. Congratulations, everybody. Well done. Loads still in baskets. Please check out as soon as you can. Thank you so much, Thank Dave. Thank you so much, Carol. Um, as I said, I know Debbie's got an amazing masterclass coming up. Uh, you should be very, very excited for it. I know you've still got some incredible yes. deals for everyone. It's a wonderful day to be tuned into Jewelry Maker, and I'll be seeing you tomorrow. I'm very excited about that. Thank you. Would you like to be part of an unofficial world record attempt and amongst the largest number of people making jewellery at one time? On Friday the 31st of May at 10am, Jewellery Maker will be holding the world's biggest make-along, where over Zoom you can join fellow jewellery makers of all abilities as we attempt to break a world record. Whether you've never made jewellery before or it's your favourite hobby, you can join us. All you have to do is sign up via the link below. We will send you an email with the Zoom link to join us near the time. Go to www.jewellerymaker.com for inspiration and of course, how to sign up. See you on the 31st of May for the world's biggest make-along. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Hi Jewelry Makers, it's Charlie. I'm back with you this Friday, Friday the 24th, and I'll be with the lovely Elle and the fabulous team. Uh, at nine o'clock, we have got some beautiful floral pendants. I'm going to be walking through how you go about setting those. And then at 12 o'clock, we have so many goodies. It's all about metal smithing, forging metal. Uh, so we've got lots of hammers, steel block. There's a new tool as well, a new tool that will help you um, if you're uh, soldering at the minute and you're struggling to get everything set up, this is gonna be really useful for you. Um, so I really look forward to sharing all that with you guys and I hope you can join me on Friday. See you then. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. 
Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewellery Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewellery Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Oh, what, wasn't that amazing? Oof. Beautiful red jade, absolutely gorgeous, I've wasn't it? I've got my red jade earrings on, I love red jade. Oh, you do? Oh, they're really pretty. Oh, sorry, I'm moving my head now. I them? love them. Oh, they're gorgeous. Red jade earrings. Beautiful. Um, we've got the most incredible, incredible deal um, coming up for you now. We've got beautiful turtles, which have been set, well, just, just take a look, just take a look. These are so, unbelievably oh, cute oh my gosh they're like baby turtles they're cute aren't they they're so sweet oh my gosh cutie look at the quality you're getting there yeah now just to let you know the sand casting is all on pre-order very 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 excited about that um it's sand this time it's not delft clay it's sand few people have asked me that I'll show you the sand super exciting um what what okay Neary talk me through these oh look oh I love that one I love that's that Mozambique one. tourmaline oh my goodness when do you ever see that oh, I love that one. Oh my gosh it's absolutely beautiful That's absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh. Okay. Amethyst. Oh. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. And, um, okay, you ready for this? Oh. Tanzanite. <gasps> my birthstone. Oh my gosh, Debbie. That is, uh, that is one of the best Tanzanites I've ever ever seen i have to say that looks absolutely incredible yeah yeah that is beautiful in a baby turtle oh my gosh i love the way the gemstone acts as their shell isn't it gorgeous That's so clever it's so sweet isn't it mm. okay right um oh gosh right are we starting with the tanzanite oh my gosh amazing i want to make these into rings or something or just you could do. You, you just, absolutely yeah, you could, could, couldn't you? Oh, oh no. Like if you put it sideways and then it can be swimming along your finger and then you just put the little sterling silver spacer beads on some elastic. So a stretchy ring. I love that. So yeah. cute. Yeah, no soldering. No kind of, no need to solder. Oh my gosh, isn't that beautiful? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Gorgeous. Textured sterling silver. Oh, yeah, yeah you know, wonderful. If, I don't know what they're going to, but if you've got two and then added, oh, it'd be lovely birthstone with um, yeah. a tanzanite hanging off of it. Oh, yes. Absolutely beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? The most wonderful sterling silver quality with a beautiful little tanzanite in his back. Oh, my gosh, it's gorgeous. Okay, five seconds. Graphics are going to be live. You're going to love, 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 love these. They're so sweet. I love all of them. I want all of them. I think they're beautiful. Okay, here we go. Graphics alive. Best of luck. So collectible. With these birthstones in, so, so, so collectible. Absolutely gorgeous. Tanzanite, obviously, yeah, one of the three birthstones of December. Um, he's just absolutely gorgeous, isn't he? Look at him. Oh, look at so him. So happy. He's so cute. Such a happy chappy. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. So, um, solid sterling silver. I'll show you the back as well because it's really well finished off. Really beautiful finish on this. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful, smooth sterling back on here. Isn't that gorgeous? Stunning quality. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful. 
But I love the little beading on him. You know, the little beading to sort of replicate what a turtle looks like. Gives you know, it gorgeous it, texture, it's doesn't it? Very clever, isn't it? Yeah, really beautiful. Gives it gorgeous texture. Isn't that stunning? Look at that. Maker and Angus, we've got Sharon to you. We've got Judith, there's loads of people. Okay, right, so um, I've got no idea where to start here. You've got 1.4 grams of 925 sterling silver there. So that's a really generous amount of sterling silver. That's kind of the kind of gram weight you would expect to get maybe in a chain that goes around your mm -hmm. neck and you're getting it in, in a connector like this. That really is incredible already. Brilliant, okay. Where do we start? That's a great shout. So you can't find one with the gemstone? Yeah, it's difficult, isn't it? Ah, so Thomas Sabe do what looks like a... Yeah, they blue. don't usually work with gemstones. They, oh. If you look, it'll be glass and mm. still 98 quid. It's lovely. It is sweet, Lovely detail on it. Mm. 98 pounds, though. That's, that's a lot. That's a lot, and it doesn't have any gemstones in. This has got a this has got a pear cut tanzanite in. Did it say what the carat weight of the tanzanite is, by the way? Quarter of a carat, maybe? I don't know. I'm kind of out of touch with kind of with this kind of thing, looking at it and kind of trying to kind of case out what how you know what the carat weight of the gemstone is. But it is important because it's you know that is proper. So it's uh, 33 points, so it's over, so yeah, a third of a carat. That's absolutely amazing. That's loads. That's over a quarter of a carat. That is just, that is a gem, top, 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 gem quality tanzanite. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, look, look at that gorgeous setting. Forty-nine ninety-nine. Lovely quality, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Really, really pretty. And for the side as well, it's not too big and bulky. No. It's got that really to kind of retain that really lovely, cute size. Chantel's got two. Gillian, well done to you. Judith, well done to you. Makeup, well done to you. Anonymous bidder, Sharon. Um, uh, another Judith now in Lancashire. Well done to you. Okay, forty-nine ninety-nine. No way near your price point today. No way near. Sterling silver, and it's got a gemstone, and we're under 98 pounds, which of course is the Thomas Sabo prize. <laughs> this is a big crash, by the way. <laughs> Taking 20 pounds off that price. Gillian, well done. 29.99. Incredible, 29 pounds and 99 pence. Absolutely gorgeous, isn't that stunning? Suffolk, well done to you. Multi-bidders, amazing. Just gorgeous, isn't it? And all the different ways in which you can use this. You know, this is going to be jewelry for you. It's going to be jewelry for for, for, for your daughter. It's going to be jewelry for my daughters. Mm. You know, for all different ages, all different generations. How fantastic playful, is that? Playful and fun. And again, you can remove that um, jump ring from the bottom if yeah. you just want him to just hang on his own. Just snip that off. And if you're not, you don't have files or anything, you can use a nail file to just mm. smooth it and polish it up. It's fine. Gillian in Hertfordshire, Tracy in Norfolk, well done to you. It's playful, it's beautiful, but it's also, um, it's got the tanzanite in there. It's got yeah, the real, yeah. real kind of elegance in there, hasn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Oh my word. I, I don't know. Yeah, come on, let's do a 30 second clock, Bruce. We're not done, we're nowhere near done. Whether it's in a ring, whether it's in a bracelet, a stretchy bracelet, whether it's in a bangle. Oh my gosh, absolutely beautiful. Whether you just literally, like, like the Thomas Arbor one, just attach a bolt ring clasp or a, a lobster claw clasp to the top and make it into a gorgeous kind of interchangeable uh, charm. That'd be lovely. Take the, uh, take the yeah. jump ring off the bottom, as, um, as Deb Cop Riley says, just file it down ever so gently. That would look absolutely brilliant. Catherine, well done to you in Bristol. Tracy in Norfolk, well done to you. Okay. No way near your price point. Here we go. Let's go really low. Yeah? Let's take another £10 off genuine oh. sterling silver a third of a carat of gem quality top 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 grade tanzanite 20 pounds amazing irene and lynn and catherine well done to you go 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 fantastic lynn's got three in a basket catherine's got two in a basket what a deal amazing opportunity for you today well done yeah, that's gorgeous. Barbara, well done to you, my lovely. In Greater Manchester as well. Lynn's just taken three. Fantastic. Well done, everyone. 
Go, go, go. What a deal for you today. Congratulations. Well done. Lots more people coming through. Irene in Thailand. Well done to you. Susan in Devon. Fantastic. Well done to you. Bristol's through. Lovely Catherine. That's absolutely tremendous, isn't it? Well done. What a deal. Congratulations. Well done. £19.99. That. Do you know what? I was looking at that clock thinking, that looks like the wrong clock to me. I'm not going to reference it. Wait, £15. When you look at what charms are elsewhere, that's amazing. Totally. And you know, with the quality of the gemstone. Well, this is it. So what would you expect to get for £15? Well, it would be silver plated base metal. Yeah, it would. That <laughs> wouldn't be a tantalite, it would be a blue cubic zirconia. Yeah. You know, to get a third of a carat of gem quality tanzanite like that, just ignore the fact that it's in a little turtle colour charm and just look at that tanzanite there. That tanzanite there in a solitaire ring. Oh, 150 quid? Hmm. Even in sterling silver, yeah? Now put it into a gorgeous little um, uh, turtle um, connector like this. I mean, what? That's absolutely crazy. 14.99. Lynn, Carolyn, well done to you. These are real, real genuine gemstones. That's absolutely amazing. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. We're not done. We're not done. Okay, we're going lower. <laughs> One final time. This is absolutely ludicrous. This is incredible. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe this is happening. This is amazing, Neary. Yeah, exactly. Bruce is saying he's made it into a multi-buy. A multi-buy opportunity. Yes, all right. Susan's got two. Irene's got five. Gillian's got two. Lynn's got three. Catherine's got two. Tracy's got three. Chantal's got two. Well done to you. Unbelievable. What a deal. Go, 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 go. I can't believe that. That is absolutely amazing. Karen, Nancy, Lynn, Gillian, Susan. Well done to you. Judith, Maker, Sharon. What a deal. Here we go. What are we doing? Oh, I would get all of them and then put them on a, t I have a turtle charm bracelet. I think it'd be gorgeous. Look at that, 12 99 how, how, how? That's how? amazing. How, even if I got the stone for 12 99 I'd think that was amazing on its own in a box, let alone bezel set and a Good sterling grief. silver turtle. Exactly. I think that may be the complete bargain of all time yeah that's amazing karen and nancy have just checked out well done bernadette and kerry and lynn well done to you that's absolutely terrific well done at 12 pounds and 99 pence congratulations well done if you want to get the other two they're available as well uh we've got all of the um all of the uh, sand casting on pre-order as well if you want to add any of it onto your order we've got gorgeous um at sapphires and rubies as well coming up amazing um oh yes definitely uh there we go get the older ear out Look at that, look at that. Yeah, beautiful for Great earrings. Great size. That's what I thought. I love that with a pear shape um, gemstone at the bottom or yeah. anything really, a long pearl. Or yeah, that would be incredible, wouldn't it? Yeah, just absolutely. Yeah, definitely. Beautiful quality. Well done, everybody. Twelve ninety nine. Oh. loads of you there. Michelle and Claire, and Claire and Bernadette, well done to you. Kerry, Lynn, absolutely tremendous. Okay, you can tell them that, Debbie, because I <laughs> I need a drink. <laughs> For the sterling silver alone, 1.4 grams, is it? Does it say? 1.4 yeah. grams of silver. 1.4 grams A of third silver. of a carat of gem quality tanzanite. One of the rarest gems on planet Earth. Oh my gosh. Are you ready? This is ludicrous. I can't believe it. I literally cannot believe it. This is unbelievable. Well done. A third of a carat of tanzanite. All of the stuff and the design. It, it's just, it's, it's absolutely perfect, isn't it? Let's do it. Oh, I'm sorry, little guy. Here we go. Tenor. Goodbye. <laughs> bye Goodbye, bye, turtle. Bye, swim away. I know. Everyone's houses and the postman. That's amazing. Look all the people. God, there's so many people. Unbelievable. Loads of people. That's what I'm looking at when I look that way. I'm not ignoring you. I'm it's looking at all the people. It's genuinely ridiculous. Well Someone's done. got six. Oh, no way. At that price, though. Oh, yeah, definitely. 
Lynn's bought six. Tracy's bought five. Earring, Michelle's amazing. got three. Uh, Maker and Kent's got two. Julian's got three. Nancy's got two. Maker in Nottinghamshire's got two. Maker in Conway's got two. Kerry in Devon's got two. This is absolutely incredible. Go, 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 go. Well done. I can't get over that for £10. No. Yeah, that is absolutely amazing. Well done. Congratulations, everyone. Well done. I can't, I literally cannot believe that. Patricia Maker, Maker, Maker in Cumbria, Christine, Anne, Bernadette, Kerry, Gillian, Judith, Maker, Sharon, Judith, loads of you there. Please check out, my goodness gracious me, Christine's got two in a basket. Oh, wow. Anne in Merseyside's got two. Well done to you, Rosalind. Well done to you as well. That's ridiculous. Congratulations. Well done. It's yours. It's a tenner for a Tanzanite sterling silver baby turtle connector. He's gorgeous, isn't he? He's absolutely beautiful. Well done. So many still there. Jalanta, Anne in Merseyside's got two. Kerry, well done to you as well. And look, Amethyst. Oh, I love that. Oh, isn't that, oh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? And Mozambique um, uh, tourmaline. Let's do the amethyst first, yeah, come on. Look at this, oh gosh, the, the quality of this oh, look at the color. amethyst is absolutely incredible, isn't it? Look at the quality you've got there. That is stunning, isn't it? Wow. I mean, yeah. Rich, deep colour. Does it say where the amethyst is from? I'm assuming it's from um, Zambia, yeah. Do you know what I find so amazing? So Homo sapiens have been around for, what, 90,000 years or so, yeah? This gem was under the ground when the very first civilizations were walking wow, on Earth. Wow, that's mind-blowing. This was under, the, and, and, and it had been under the ground for hundreds of millions of years. That's mind-blowing. Isn't, isn't that it? crazy? Yeah, yeah. I've always loved Literally, amethyst. where the first kind of remains, where the first kind of signs of human life were discovered, which is just near Victoria Falls, actually, in that kind of area between Zimbabwe, Zambia, and um, uh, you've, got, you've got the first kind of remnants of tools, the first remnants of, of, kind, of, um, of kind of hunting tools, but tools to make fires with. All of that, those first signs of human life existed or were first discovered in that area, the area where this gem lay dormant for hundreds of millions of years before it was discovered. This is this is one of those amethysts where the colour is so good, it almost looks like uh, quad tanzanite. True. It's so purple. It's so bluey purple, like a violety bl bluey purple. It does have flashes of pink, which really gives it away as being amethyst, but it, it's almost so purpley blue, it looks like quad tanzanite. Thirty pounds. Yeah, February's birthstone. Gorgeous, isn't it? It is gorgeous. I love the faceting on it as well. It's just I love everything about it. Actually. Well, it's a, just a traditionally pear-cut gem you know, with all of the facets. And I'm glad you've kind of brought that up, actually, uh, Deb, because when you when you get a gemstone and you facet it and you set it with sterling silver. Yes, you've got a lapidris. Yes, you've got a silversmith, but you've got a gem setter as well. That's yeah. another person who needs to be employed in the making That's, of yeah, this. Yeah. So, you know, that, that adds onto the cost of the piece, how much it's cost to manufacture. You know, you've got to involve another set of skills, another person entirely. That's incredible. And then we bring it to you for under £30. <laughs> We're going to go 
Really, really low. Crazy low. Yeah, you saw what happened with the Tanzanite one. We're going to go really, really, really low. You know we are. Isn't he lovely? He's lovely, isn't he? It's not too big. It's not claw set, so it's not, you know, nothing's going to catch on him. Just a really, really lovely, simple, kind of like a rub over setting, I guess, or a bezel setting, would you say? Yeah, I think it's bezel setting. Mm. So clever, just so simple. Julie, Patricia, Mua, well done to you, my lovely. Gillian's got three. Jalanta, Michelle in Shropshire, Michelle in Kent. Barbara Jean, Maker, Judith, Lynn, Anthony, well done to you. Maker and Angus, well done to you. Here we are, my lovelies, all the way down. Great, great, great deal. <laughs> 9.99, unbelievable. There you go. Your gorgeous amethyst. Amethyst baby turtle design set into sterling silver. Can you imagine three of these all swimming in the same direction, connected by jump rings and then just a length of chain on Oh my gosh, side. how lovely is and that? And you could have all the three colours or you could have the same colour or a couple of colours, but they look like they were like swimming around your neckline. Yeah, absolutely. Really oh, that pretty. would just be adorable. Gorgeous. Well done, Cheryl. Well done, Maker. Maker in Nottinghamshire. Maker in London. Well done to you as well. Loads of you coming through. Tracy's bought six. You little beauty. gillian has got three. Well done to you as well. Nottinghamshire's just checking out there. Well done to you. Absolutely fantastic. 0800 644 655 at £9.99. Oh my gosh. These are going to go today. And at 9.99, amazing. Now, if you came through to get these at 9.99, fantastic. If you came through at 29.99, amazing. But none of you are going to pay that. You are all paying a lower price point today. Oh, really? <laughs> I know. <coughs> we are going lower today. How crazy is this? Absolutely incredible. Well done, everyone. Go, go, go. Mm. Absolutely. <laughs> incredible quality. Here we go. Taking the price point down again. Five seconds. Here we go. Oh my gosh, this is absolutely terrific. $7.99. Oh my gosh, just take it. Yes, you've got sterling silver. Yes, you've got gem quality amethyst, which is completely natural. Yes, you're going to be getting... I mean, the quality of the amethyst is absolutely terrific. Genuinely is. I need to show you something. <coughs> this is from an earring. It's plastic. The earrings cost £12.99. It's plastic. It's more than an amethyst and sterling silver turtle from us. That's crazy. That, it, it, totally crazy. Isn't it? Yep, absolutely. Oh, this is from lovely guest designer Nikki. Morning and huge love to the gorgeous gang. Turtles are a reminder to slow down and take life gently and purposefully. Take my money now, <laughs> says Nikki. Oh, Nikki, <laughs> sending you all the love, sweetheart. Love you so much. <laughs> She's, oh, so, she's lovely. so funny, isn't she? I love her. Take my money. Take my money now. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous. Absolutely terrific. I mean, that's seven ninety. That is obscene at that price point. Well done. It is, isn't it? It really is. Yep, 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 yep. Gillian's got four. Janice has got two. Catherine's got two. Michelle's got three. Anne's got two. Lynn's got two. Anne in County uh, Down's got three. Claire's got two. Lynn's got two. Nikki's got. Oh, well done, Nikki, sweetheart. Maker's got two. Tracy's got six. I mean, what is going on? It's crazy. Well done. Maker and Conway's got two. Gillian's got four. Go, go, go. We've got one more. Um, this final one, I'll be honest with you, I've never bought you this gem on Jewelry Maker before. I love it. Mozambique tourmaline? I've never bought it to you ever. I bought you tourmaline from um, Madagascar. I bought you tourmaline even from Burma, which is incredibly rare. I've definitely bought you Brazilian tourmaline. I bought you Nigerian tourmaline. I have never knowingly bought you Mozambique tourmaline. That is amazing. What else can you get from Mozambique? Pareba, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely Pareba. I've never bought you, knowingly, uh, Mozambique tourmaline. I, I, honestly, if, if I had to guess what gemstone that was without knowing what it is, I, 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 I'm not sure I would be able to guess, actually. I'd probably say... Maybe? I, I don't know. It doesn't look like any sapphire I've ever seen. It doesn't look like any tourmaline I've ever seen. It doesn't look like... It's just... It's so... That is such an unusual colour. What colour is that, Deb? Is it... 
It's is it pink? Is it red? Is it purple? What 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 is that colour? I can see all of those colours. I absolutely I can see love blue. This. I've never seen anything like this. No, I think it's absolutely stunning. It is. It is so pleochroic. You've got light pinks, dark pinks, purples, reds, blues, lavenders, violets. It it, it is just. It is an incredibly unusual gem i love it oh i'd guess a spinel yeah that's what i would guess yeah. i guess spinel oh it's gorgeous this is so rare mozambique tourmaline know that the the find of mozambique tourmaline in these colors has not produced since about tw Wow, 2008. Gemstones are offered sporadically due to old inventory hitting the market or a few pieces of rough are found. Um, all I'm going to say to you is... thirty second clock. It is a gorgeous colour. I mean, it is a stunning colour. Yeah, it is. Yes, it does look like rubellite. It does look like rubellite. It does look like spinel. It does, I mean, like some crazy sapphire maybe. I, I, I don't know. What it, I've never knowingly bought you Mozambique tourmaline. It's, that is incredibly rare. Graphics are live. Best of luck, everyone. Honestly, just get this one because, because you can. Get this one because I don't think we've ever bought you anything like this before wow that is unbelievable isn't it yeah i mean that's I'm incredible thinking earrings with this one particularly because as they move all of those colors are yeah. just going to pop up it's they? so play crow that you've got to you've got kind of almost got to put it into a design where they where the where they're going to twist and turn and move i think you're right deb i mean yeah Definitely, they're beautiful quality. My gosh, loads of people there. Congratulations, well done. Right, oh gosh. Um, I mean, rarer than your amethyst, rarer than your tanzer. I mean, I don't know, it's just, I've, I've never seen this color. I must have seen thousands of, ta of, of tourmalines over the years. Never seen anything like this before. This, by the way, is one of the two best zones of October alongside uh, Opal. In case anyone's interested. Oh, is it? Yeah. $29.99. Loads of multi bidders through. Well done. Gillian three, Jacqueline three. Fantastic. Uh, Maker and Angus has got two in the basket. Maker and Lancaster's got three in the basket. It, it, uh, Catherine's got two in the basket. Oh, Catherine's checked out two in Bristol. Well done. Isn't that just stunning? That gem is just unbelievable. Uh, let's do a 30 second clock because we're not done. We're going to take it lower. Gosh, it's very, very, very popular. unbelievable okay right less than 20 seconds we're taking the price point down this might be the first time you've ever seen mozambique tourmaline it's definitely i think one of the first times i've ever seen it it's it's incredibly rare it's so unusual you're getting colors in here which i've never seen before in tourmaline i mean maybe at a push rubellite but honestly i mean i can't really remember the last time i saw rubellite rubellite's the red variety of tourmaline by the way Oh my gosh. Really? Okay, you've got literally the best deal ever. Ready? Best deal ever. Unbelievable. Catherine's got two. Gillian's got three. Tenner. That makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. <laughs> no sense. Go, 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 go. Well done. It's gone, oh. it's gone absolutely crazy. I know. I, I really want to see more of this, Gem. Oh, I, I really it. do. That Mozambique tourmaline's really just been incredible. Genuinely amazing. Well done. Uh, Caroline, well done to you. Now, Nikki in Merseyside, she's bought two. Well done, sweetheart. Uh, Nottinghamshire's got two as well. Well done to you, my lovely. That is incredible. Oh, my loves. Look at everyone coming through. I think everyone is affected by this colour. Everyone's just been looking at this thinking, well, that really is incredible. Oh, it's my darlings, well done. Mesmerising. It really thing. is mesmerising. That's exactly the word for it, Deb. I think I'd want earrings and then one on my wrist so that I could look at it, like move my wrist around and look at it. No, but I think you're right. I think you've got to make a piece of jewellery. You have to let me, make at least one piece of jewellery with this where you're going to be able to look at it all the time. Be it in a ring <coughs> or a bracelet, excuse me. 
Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Barbara's got two. Michelle's got three. Maker in Nottingham, she's got two. Well done. That is just terrific. Yeah, that is absolutely terrific. Well done, everyone. <clears throat> baskets, we've got Alison. Linda's got two in her basket. Stella, Roslyn, Maker, Julie, Anne. Maker's got four in the basket. Rachel, Maker in Surrey. Leslie, Anthony, Julie's got two in a basket. Maker and Angus got four in a basket. Well done. Oh. That's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? People are asking about the consistency of colour. Well, I, well, what I would do, I mean, the only way you're going to find out is, to, is, is by ordering it and by multi-buying it. If you buy two or three of them and then send the two back, send the one back that you don't want to keep or whatever. I, I doubt very much you are going to send it back because it's so unusual. It's so beautiful. If the colour's anything like this. Oh, wow. So the two that you saw, Neri, are this colour. But the picture online slightly more orangey, did you say? Oh, okay. I think it is going to be closer to this colour than anything. I mean, don't quote me on that, but I, but, but I imagine it will be. Kim, Deborah, well done. You've got two. Go, go, go. Keith's got three. That's absolutely terrific. Well done. Incredible. Wow. Okay, right. What a lovely little trio of turtles. I know. The little turtle trio. Before we bring you the sapphire, we've got a, oh my gosh, a star bite. This is going to send the Ooh. call center into absolute <laughs> meltdown. We're gonna do it as a steal of the day. Let's go. Anything that comes to you in that bag is gonna be stunning, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. You know it. You know it. That's gonna be perfect, absolute perfection. Okay. Oh, look at the color of these, they're amazing. Oh, they're amazing. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love them. Deb, these are absolutely... Oh, I need these. Oh, they're stunning. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Look at them. Oh. <gasps> yeah, you're absolutely right, Neera. The One of the only ways we can actually get hold of <coughs> um, pearls like this is to bring you old, kind of, I uh, say old, uh, kits that have been to air. This has been to air how many times? Three, four, five times? No. Once. Once. I like it, yeah. I like that thinking. Turtles live in the sea. It is, in, it is World Turtle Day and uh, pearls come from water too. There we go. There you go, there's Beautiful. the link. That's, a, that's enough of a link. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that, look at the size and shape of these. They are terrifically good, aren't they? Oh, they are. Wow. Wow. Half drilled. Ooh. Oh my gosh, that ring. Oh my word. Yeah, can you imagine? Yes, oh, yes I can. So can I. Oh my gosh. Okay, look. You've got here your, oh wow, oh my gosh, look at this, look. Beautiful clasps. I, don't you love these clasps, oh, I love them, they're so easy. And I always use them as like focals because they're too beautiful oh, to be for sure. back. You've got a little uh, carrier here in the middle which has got a little peg on the bottom there to glue your pearl onto. These two here, literally pop your, pop that up there like that, and put, take your pearls from either one of these. Or, you know, you don't have to use it with these pearls, but if you do, I mean, amazing. And you've got a card of natural silk as well, which has been dyed purple. It's just beautiful. You also get instructions with uh, um, this by guest designer Susie, which is amazing. I love this because we've done this particular project. We've done a very, very similar one in white pearls. It's so lovely to see it with your yeah. dyed peacock pearls. It, it's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Can I just say, these colors really fit in with the turtles we've literally just done, don't they? 
If I, if I they do. hold that and then I pick up, oh, come here, mate. Gee whiz. Here we go. So if I just do that. Oh. Doesn't that look amazing? Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, that looks amazing. If I do, sorry, Michael, I'm being all right, pain in the, <laughs> in the butt. There you go, <laughs> look, look at that. Oh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, do you know what? I think you're probably right, Neary. We bought a strand of pearls to wear the other day where literally we saw every single color of the rainbow oh, really? in the pearls. And these are, do, these are literally doing the same. They're doing the same. Look at that, look at the color. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at that. This is just obscene, this one. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Oh my gosh. Be lovely with the sapphire. Yeah. Absolutely terrific. Okay, so. <laughs> wow. I just love them. So, uh, Maker and Swansea, well done. Diana, well done to you. Maker and Maker, well done. Um, they're brilliant, aren't they? Yeah, you know. I mean, I, 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 gosh, can you even imagine how much these would be valued for, oh, um, Deb? I mean, that would just be think. incredible, wouldn't it? I've never seen anything like them. I love everything about them. They're so beautiful. 999, not your deal. Three split payments of 333 three, pounds. Nowhere near your price point today. Nowhere near. Okay, so we love to bring you great deals for pearls. I mean, I, I, I can't even imagine how much these would be valued at. I mean, this is just incredible. They're so unusual. Look at that. Look at the quality, the size and shape of these pearls. It's absolutely ludicrous. I think they're gorgeous having one of these underneath. You know, like you've got there a ring or, you know, a bit of, bit of precious metal at the top and just as a focal point. And they will go a yeah. long way if you use them individually. Yeah, they really will. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Come on. Here we go. Let's get that price point down straight away. Oh, wow. 15 chances. That's amazing. 499. Four nine nine. Wow. Oh. Yeah, well, do you know what? I was just literally looking at these thinking, look at those sapphires yeah, with it. Yeah, they're amazing together. Aren't they stunning? Don't they look amazing? Fatima, well done to you, my lovely, and Grimsby coming through. That's great to see you, my lovely. Well done. Oh, we're going down. We're going down. Look at that, look at the colours, look at the, the kind of satiny smooth. Oh my word. They are beautiful. They really are incredible, aren't they? Oof. Can't believe I'm about to say this, but look at this. Two, nine, nine. Two, nine, nine on three split payments. That is crazy. Your split payments are now 100 pounds 99 pounds and 66 pence for this i mean is this okay so if you were to knock this into a pearl necklace is it going to be valued for more than 299 pounds oh, yeah absolutely yes 100 percent look at that look at that i mean just incredible it, it, it's just out of this world minute clock we're not done i know I, i've got no idea Keshi pearls as well, let's not forget, you know, Keshi pearls are completely free form. They're not kind of cultured. You don't have Keshi pearl farms. That, that isn't a thing. Because what you're looking at here is basically the direct impression of the inside of the mollusk's shell. The mollusk will form the Keshi pearl completely free form. It's 100% nacre, which means it's 100% luminosity that you're getting. Obviously, they dyed this peacock colour. Um, but, uh, but the quality of the nacre is what dictates all of that incredible luster, that 
iridescent and of course that luminosity that you are witnessing on that recording there and in the studio here today. It really is absolutely terrific. Less than 20 seconds, we're going to give you a lower price point. It is going to be your deal today. Maker and Angus, well done to you. And in Nottinghamshire, congratulations, well done to you as well. So you are looking here at something which is completely free form, completely, a complete fluke, if you like. Ready? £199. <laughs> that is crazy. They are bonkers for that price point. I would be getting all of the sapphire and popping it oh. with it. I, 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 sapphire and, 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 um, and uh, peacock pearl uh, necklace, absolutely amazing. Well done. 25 in baskets, literally for the last couple of chances. Well done, 10 chances remaining, well done. Go, go, go. Teresa Adelaide in Oxford, well done to you. Maker and Angus, well done to you. And in Nottinghamshire, well done to you as well. Go, go, go. That's terrific. Say again. Yeah. Surely in the middle sex, well done to you as well. Maker and Angus, well done to you as well. There's loads of you there. No! <laughs> I thought You that genuinely that can't be going lower than 199. <laughs> you can't be going lower than 199. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, you get your instructions as well. How can that be going lower than 199? That cannot happen. Denise, well on to you as well. A Keshi Pearl Necklace project with them um, from uh, lovely Susie. The most amazing strand of peacock uh, Keshis. And you get your half drilled Keshi. Look at the size and scale and caliber of that. And you get your silk and you get your um, clasp. That is terrific. Go, go, go. Shaolin, Valerie, Denise, well done to you. Oh my gosh, enjoy. Can't believe it, that is absolutely amazing. Well done. Literally cannot believe that. Here we go. One, four, nine. Yes, please. One, four, nine. It is literally a race. <laughs> to a sellout, the race to a sellout. Valerie, Denise, Maker and Angus, Anne in Nottinghamshire, Charlene, Charita, Adelaide, Diana, Fatima and Maker and Swansea. There's so many people there. Well done. Check out as soon as you can. That is tremendous. Absolutely tremendous. Congratulations, everybody. Well done. Alison in Suffolk, we've got you there as well. Well done to you, my darling. Go, go. Eight chances remain. I can't quite believe that. Eight chances. Stella and Devon, well done to you as well. Valerie and Nottinghamshire, that is, that is out of this world. <laughs> One, four, nine. Can you actually believe that? No. Just this, this one here as a pendant on its own, that could command that price point yeah. of 149. Yeah, definitely. Totally. Joanne in Shropshire, well done to you. Debbie in Hampshire, well done to you. Oh, imagine getting these out, you know, when they get delivered and you open it. Oh, what a beautiful Debbie, treat. absolutely, you're going to be... They're mesmerising, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah they are mesmerising. You're absolutely right. You are going to be over the moon. Well done. Yeah, Julie, well done to you as well. You've got this enormous pearl. And then on this particular side, it will vary. You get um, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. 16 pearls. Look at the state of this one. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, nine pounds for that cashew pearl. <laughs> That's incredible. Look at that. Wow. Oh my gosh. Look at the colour. Look at what's happening to that pearl. Valerie, Julie and Tyne and Weir, Julie and Kent, Joanne in Shropshire, Stella. Three opportunities remaining. Oh my gosh. Well done. With one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten in baskets. Sand casting is on pre-order, just to let everybody know. Cool. Good, good, good. 
Um, yeah. Now we've you've spoken. We have listened um, because the last time we bought you Sandcasting, we bought you everything separately, and everyone was asking, "Oh gosh, can you just do it in one bundle for one price?" So we've got bundles coming up. It is going to go crazy, and it is proper sand casting rather than the Delft clay, isn't it? Yeah. So if you've got the Delft clay before. Um, yeah. everything in this new bundle, I was just checking that I was right, is new. Mm. So it's a new flask, it's a new pouring handle, it's sand, not Delft clay, yeah. a new crucible and a new scorifier tongs. It's all amazing. So everything that we're doing today is different to what we did last time. Oh my gosh, amazing. And the, the result is absolutely, it, it's sensational. Gaynor, Diane, Denise, Barbara, Angela, Julie, in kind of weird, Julie and Kent, jo Joanne, Stella, Valerie, Maker, Denise, Maker and Angus, Anne and, uh, Anne and Peter and Sharon. Check out, you've all got that in baskets. I think we've only got two left. That's absolutely Ooh. ridiculous. Right. Oh my gosh. We've got a selection of gems for you now, which honestly, oops. Where's the clicker gone? Ah, has Dave taken it? Was he put it somewhere? We've got, oh, where's it gone? You've got the clicker over there. Oh, oh, have you got it? Thanks, Michael. So, um, I, I, I am never, I mean, I love looking on first dibs. I don't know about anybody else. I love, 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 love looking on first dibs. Um, you will find some of the most beautiful gemstones, some of the most beautiful pieces, some of the most highest price pieces you will ever, ever, ever see. But what we need to get to grips is, is this gem, is this gem a popular gem? Well, the, 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 the mail online says it is, uh, no, but seriously. Diamonds are not forever. Prices of sapphires and rubies soar as women arrive to emulate, sorry, women strive to emulate the Duchess of Cambridge. Now, you will always find, and it's kind of very well known, that uh, particularly the British royals will always go for sapphires over diamonds in their jewellery that they, you know, that they choose, whether it's for engagement rings, whatever it might be, purely because they're rarer they're available in lots of different colors and uh they it's just it's just you know it's it's something which has kind of been passed down through generations you don't have to look far to find um members of royalty uh celebrities wearing sapphire you've got kira knightley jennifer anderson wearing that ridiculous piece there you've got the queen consort in the middle i mean it's absolutely incredible um but you cannot get away from 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 headlines like this dramatic rise in price for fine gemstones as high-end ruby emerald and sapphire sales soar now that's 2022 the reason why the prices are soaring is because during the covid19 pandemic we were you know arguably in the uk in a very lucky position because we had the benefit of things like furlough um Whereas elsewhere around the world, there was no such thing as furlough and the gemstone mines closed and everyone was out of a job. That was it. You're on your own. So lots and lots and lots of people went to then work in factories or then went to work in production lines, whatever it might be. And they were manufacturing everything from defibrillators to um, uh, protective clothing to, you know, mobile phones, to, you know, all sorts of different types of things. Now, Arguably, you could say, you know, they're going to be getting paid less working in a factory than they are, you know, mining for gemstones, but it's a lot, it, it's, it's a lot safer. And of course, when the gemstone mines open back up, the gems are still there, luckily enough. It's very different to the pearl world, but the gemstones are still there, which is fantastic. Are people going to go back working in the mines or have they kind of got used to kind of, you know, budgeting and kind of, you know, working with a, a lower salary, but being in a much safer environment? Yeah. That, that's what a lot of people are doing. So there's fewer gemstones being mined, fewer gemstones coming out the ground, fewer gem cutters cutting the gemstones. It affected the whole industry, not just gemstone mining, but lapidary, drilling, setting, all of it. It's making gemstone jewelry, manufacturing, uh, uh, stunning silver pieces. Mining for gemstones has never been more expensive, okay? And that is reflected in the, um, in the price point that you're paying for gemstones. 11 carat Burmese sapphires fetches 
£660,000 at Bonham's New York auction. You know, you've got articles like this. This is in Forbes magazine. I've specifically, you know, not necessarily gone just for gemstone um, articles, just so you're kind of, um, kind of up to date and up to speed with, you know, sapphires, rubies, they are, they are reaching prices of, of astronomi you know, astronomical levels. It always used to be diamonds. And then I think when Elizabeth Taylor's jewellery was auctioned um, 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 a few years ago, it was her emerald jewellery that kind of made the headlines. And it's interesting, ever since then, sapphire, ruby prices, emerald prices at auctions have literally been going crazy. And the auction houses are basically saying, yeah, we kind of got it wrong. We always thought it was about diamonds, but now we're totally, you know, we're all about coloured gemstones as well, which is just a huge, huge, huge relief. Now, we've got... I've got a whole load of different strands for you here. What I love about all of these is they're pretty much all rounds. They're all faceted. Now, I love going on first dibs. Yeah. I love it. It inspires me. I love it. There's Sotheby's, rose gold, sapphire, diamond, tassel earrings, absolutely gorgeous. Oh, lovely. We've got everything you need on Jewelry Maker to make those earrings. 10 grand on Sotheby's. Oof. Sapphire might be, you know, better quality, you know, whatever. But well, I can bring you everything you need to make those earrings today. Yeah? Go and look on the website for a tassel tops, you know, whatever it might be. Okay. Yeah. Oop, black. Black. Now, as far as inspiration goes, mm-hmm. Have you got that first dibs one I sent you, lovely, with, with the inspiration? Thank you. As far as inspiration goes, if you're ever stuck for inspiration, yes, you can go and look at the v &A Museum. You can go and look at all these incredible, um, you know, places and you can find inspiration. Or you could go to First Dibs. Now, a lot of the pieces there are going to be set into 18 karat gold. It's going to be kind of really kind of couture jewelry. It's going to be beautiful. But you do find pieces like this. This is ruby. You can find pieces like that. That's gorgeous, isn't it? 618 pounds. Unheated ruby with the drawstring closure. Gorgeous. 600 pounds. Ooh, I can give you everything lovely. you need to make that bracelet. I can give you everything you need to make that incredible bracelet there for £12,000 on first dibs. Look at those gorgeous tassel earrings there, £789. Every, that's on, um, that's on uh, Etsy. Beautiful. I love that bracelet. It's so lovely. cute, isn't it? Mm. You watch. These strands are going to go nuts what is the key feature with this strand these aren't just sapphires they're not just faceted sapphires from africa they are natural wow. almost 95 percent of sapphire nowadays is treated it's either heat treated or it's fissure filled or it's diffused and i'll be honest with you it, it it's 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 for a number of different reasons it's either to give you clarity or it's to improve the color or you know whatever it might be this is natural got to love sapphires in the deeper and darker the better j and quality never disappoints thank you so much that's really really kind also i don't think i have ever bought you a strand of sapphire six mill rounds no i mean six sapphire, mil sapphire six millimeter rounds in sapphire and they're natural what these are going to sell out we're so confident look at this 69.99 for a strand of six mil round natural sapphires go 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 loads of you there tons of you there congratulations sold out it's gone not surprised we hardly ever see gone. anything like this six mil sapphire rounds and they're natural now okay anyone who came through to get that a best of luck you know because honestly look you've got to be so quick look at this i mean deb you do whatever you want but if you've got the opportunity oh. to use all of these together Oh my gosh. Yes, yes, yes. Showing sold out. Yep, yeah, I know. I know, lovely. I know. Six mil sold out. 
five mil. Let's go. Maker in Swansea, Valerie in Somerset, Maker in East Sussex, Paula in, in Greater London, James in Greater London. Fantastic. Well done to you. We're at 99.99. We're not done. Oh my gosh. Two split pay. This is crazy. Marie, James, well done to you, my lovely. Loads of you there. Fantastic. Well done. Here we go. Angela, well done to you as well, my lovely. Go, go, go. £34.99. <laughs> there is not a place in the world that can offer you, that can offer you Sapphire 5 mils, which are natural, of this quality for 35 quid. Well, that is crazy. Totally amazing. Natural. Sold out. Gone. Got to be quick if you want them. Next strand. <laughs> These three mil, four mil, four mils. I love this. So we bought you six mil, five mil, four mil. We've got three mil. We've got two mil. I will show them all together because they look absolutely incredible. Look at that. Look at that. 50 of this. You're going to have to be really quick. You've seen how quickly the others have gone. Look at that. Look at all of those together. That is an absolute, uh, 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 September's birthstone as well. Oh my gosh. They're stunning, aren't they? Oh, they're gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. Four mil. A few more of these available. Valerie Maker in Swansea. Angela Maker in West Midlands. Francesca, Julie, well done to you. Elizabeth Donner Maker in Angus. Uh, Valerie, well done to you. And just, just, just going back, sorry, Neri. Just going back to all this jewelry here. I know, you're right. I know I haven't gone for the highest end design, but I've done that purposefully. That's 618 pounds. I know it's Ruby, but you know, you can kind of put Ruby and Sapphire in the same bracket because it's a, it, they're both members of the Corundum family, okay? That there, with everything we've got today, you can make that and it's not gonna cost you 12 grand. You can make those earrings with the strands I've got today. And it's not gonna cost you 7,000 pounds to make. You can make that bracelet and it's gonna cost you, it's gonna cost you a fraction of the cost. Ready? This is crazy, this is absolutely bonkers. 50 available, 20 quid. For 40 carats of natural four mil micro faceted sapphire. We're not done. Wow. There's a reason why we've got, you know, the big four gemstones are the big four. You know, they are, they've got providence, they've got pedigree, they've got value, they've got, you know, some of the most valuable gemstones in the world are sapphires. You're getting, but, but you know, a lot of them are heated or diffused or glass filled or, you know, whatever it might be. These are completely 100% natural. They're natural and they're blue. They're natural and they're not brown. They're not like muddy. They are natural and they're blue. Should we go really low? Should we save you a fiver? <laughs> 15 quid for natural sapphire. Natural blue sapphire, 40 carats. Incredible. Unbelievable. 14 pounds, 99 pence. Elizabeth, two. Cheryl, Valerie, three. Francesca, uh, four. Angela, two. Maker and Swansea, three. Derbyshire, two. It's gone completely nuts. Well done. Now, the, the, the beautiful thing with this is you can make that. Oh, I love Just that. a little stretchy. Yeah. Just a stretchy. I love the bracelet we've got there on, uh, on Etsy because it's like that 50-50 thing, isn't it? So cute. Absolutely beautiful. You know, and a gemstone that is a favorite of the royals. And you can bet your bottom dollar. I mean, I, d I don't know. I mean, sorry, can we have a look at the other PowerPoint with the other sapphire bits on, please, lovely. I, d I can't be on, I, oh no, I can't be honest. I can't be, I can't honestly say to you that, yeah, well done, thank you, lovely, that that sapphire, all that sapphire is natural. I mean, I don't know, I don't know. I assume it is, I don't know. I can't guarantee it's not heated. I mean, that, that, that piece almost looks like a Tanzel that Jennifer Anderson's yeah. wearing. I can't guarantee that that's not all heated. But I can guarantee that ours is 100% natural. It's crazy. Karen's got two. Pat's got three. Linda's got two. Michelle's got two. Well done. Unbelievable. Now, I mean, Deb, you may as well, if you've got all of these... Oh. You may as well stick around because we've got these coming up. Six, five, four, three, two. That's amazing. You can cast in place with sapphires. Oh, yeah. So talk to us. How, how would we do that? Um, 
So what, me, what it means is that you can pour the molten metal on a sapphire, um, on a ruby, on a garnet, on a diamond, um, and on any synthetic gemstone. But these would look lovely, wouldn't they, as just like um, in rings or pendants yeah. if you wanted to. And of course you can set oh gemstones naturally, but I think these would be gorgeous, the little ones especially. Stunning. You're absolutely right, Debbie. They, they, they really, really would. Should we do the three mils? Yeah, oh, these. they're so cute. I love them. Get on the phones. You know we're going to go low. Angela's already bought two. Look. Little ring, stretchy ring. Doesn't need to be any more challenging than that. Stretchy ring. Yeah, stretchy isn't it ring. Lovely. So cute. Put a little char, little char, charm or little sterling silver jump rings in between. It'd be so pretty. So sweet. Julie, well done to you. Maker, Donna in Carmarthenshire. Absolutely unbelievable. That is just incredible. Well done. 29.99 not your price everyone pays a final low price it's crazy absolutely bonkers here we go 12.99 <laughs> 12.99 sapphire for natural sapphire yeah that's silly no heat no diffusion no coating no filling and the luster that you get Deb is absolutely out of this world. You imagine that. Oh my gosh, you imagine that on one of uh, Alison's loom bracelets. Oh, yeah. You imagine a loom bracelet. And you might think, oh gosh, you know, to make a loom bracelet, you're probably going to need two or three strands of this. I know, yeah, probably. But if they're only costing you $12.99 each. Yes. I mean, what a bargain. Mm. And, and also, if you, if you kind of think about the price point you'd be able to sell that on for, I mean, you're talking hundreds and hundreds and yeah. hundreds and hundreds of pounds. Put it with your lovely pearls as well. Just yeah, as, for sure. If you don't like to not all, you know, just as an alternative, put them in between your lovely pearls. Yes, yeah, definitely. As spacers, I mean, for natural sapphire. Amazing. Two yeah, they're gorgeous. Last oh, I trend. love these ones. These are so beautiful. <laughs> uh, yeah. Now. Oh, my gosh. Now, on the break, we're going to be putting a load of last in stock ruby. Most of the strands are rounds. Most of the strands are faceted. So if you want to mix the ruby and the sapphire together, you absolutely can do it just purely because of time. But amazing, amazing, amazing. Ten seconds for a strand of the most incredible natural sapphire. Natural sapphire. One of the most prolific, one of the big four gemstones. That's ten pounds. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Natural sapphire for a tenner. <laughs> and it looks like this. It's not black, it's not murky, it's not muddy. I mean, I've seen natural sapphire from um, Kanchanaburi in, uh, in uh, Thailand. Absolutely gorgeous. It's meant to be blue. It's actually black. It, it's just so like, oh, so inky. It's gone way too far saturation wise. This. You can tell that's blue. You can tell that's a sapphire. And the fact that it's natural is just, is just literally, it's, it, it's ridiculous. Please, 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 when you are making this jewelry, if you are selling it, when you're making with this round, if you are selling it, please shout it from the rooftops that that, that, that is natural. Oh, yeah. Because a lot of people don't sell natural sapphire. Yeah, well over 90% is um, heat treated or fissure filled or diffused or, you know, whatever. Totally 100% natural. 9.99. Congratulations. Well done. West Midlands 2. Fiona 2. Miss Janet 2. Somerset 3. Devon 2. Swansea 3. Surrey 2. Well done. Now we're going to go to a break a little bit early purely because oh, the masterclass we've got coming up is incredible. Oh, we've got loads of Ruby going on the website, by the way. So please, please, please come through. Oh, uh, four mil faceted rounds of, of Ruby on the website now. Go. Oh, good. How much are they, uh, Neary? 20 quid. Oh my gosh, just take them, take them, take them. Amazing. Well done. Don't go anywhere. We've got the most epic masterclass coming up next with Deb. She's worked so hard on everything and it's, and it's paid off because it's just exquisite pieces. You're going to learn so much. We've got so much to bring to you. We'll see you after the break. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Hi 
Hi Jewelry Makers, it's Charlie. I'm back with you this Friday, Friday the 24th, and I'll be with the lovely Elle and the fabulous team. Uh, at nine o'clock, we have got some beautiful floral pendants. I'm going to be walking through how you go about setting those. And then at 12 o'clock, we have so many goodies. It's all about metal smithing, forging metal. Uh, so we've got lots of hammers, steel block. There's a new tool as well, a new tool that will help you um, if you're uh, soldering at the minute and you're struggling to get everything set up, this is going to be really useful for you. Um, so I really look forward to sharing all that with you guys and I hope you can join me on Friday. See you then. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewelry Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says gift cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Would you like to be part of an unofficial world record attempt and amongst the largest number of people making jewellery at one time? On Friday the 31st of May at 10am, Jewellery Maker will be holding the world's biggest make-along, where over Zoom you can join fellow jewellery makers of all abilities as we attempt to break a world record. Whether you've never made jewellery before or it's your favourite hobby, you can join us. All you have to do is sign up via the link below. We will send you an email with the Zoom link to join us near the time. Go to www.jewellerymaker.com for inspiration and of course, how to sign up. See you on the 31st of May for the world's biggest make-along. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel.
Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. I literally feel like I'm. I look like I'm baking a cake. Oh, I love you. Look at you. <laughs> you literally look like you're about to put some cookies in the oven. Only one for a cookie. Um, <laughs> Banana cookie. <laughs> Gee whiz. Hi, Clemmy, um, if you're watching. Oh, little baba. Um, this is like being in chemistry or something. This is so cool. I want, I want, I want all of it. I don't even know what it does and I want it all. It's just. It's so cool. It's. You never know what you're going to get. Even the most experienced caster sometimes oh. will end up with something, you know. But the whole process, that opening the flask at the end and seeing what, what you end up with is just, it's, it's addictive and you just keep finding things that you want to cast. It's amazing. When, um, when you are making pieces like this, yeah. and this is something actually which, um, when Fleur Hastings used to work here on, um, on JM, and she would say this about making sterling silver chainmail pieces. And she would say, you never have to justify the price because people can see it's precious metal. Yeah. They can see it's worth. They can hold it and they can feel. Feel how heavy that is. They can is. feel yeah. it's worth. The job is done for you. And with the pieces you are going to, this love heart piece, that is like an 18th birthday gift. I adore, that is stunning. That is, that is a piece which anyone can pick up and just go, yeah, I see the value. I see the worth in that. That is totally, I, I totally get that. I've had two orders for these since the people have seen them. And I don't really do bespoke orders, only for family and friends. Two people have said, right, got, got the sweets out. Looked at them and said, right, what can I have on my... <laughs> You can get one with Marry so Me if you've got a bride, a bridal business. Gosh. Oh, we skew with. Now, <laughs> we are going. Straighten him up. Michael's got a duck on his hat. He's Aww. just, he's so beautiful. Now, he's got a copper, a copper bale. Do you know why? Because why? someone, some idiot, me, put sterling uh, silver plated wire in the sterling silver wire folder and was really surprised when she put it in the pickle after soldering and it was copper and I thought you do you know what Wally. I quite like it just leave it he looks lovely <laughs> um, it is honestly you are gonna love this now what we're gonna do we're gonna bring the graphics live and we're gonna see how everything works because honestly you are gonna just you're gonna love it I have um, so many people coming through. Oh my gosh! Can I say that I was oh my gosh. up till one o'clock in the morning finishing these instructions that show you all of the photographs of what everything that I can't bring here, the pickle, the everything, and what it looks like after the, the set it's it's come out, what it looks like before. Um, these took me two hours, <coughs> and you're getting a start to finish on not just the duck, but any keepsake sandcast pendant. If you buy this, you will get this with it. So the first piece we are bringing to air is, I don't know actually, Neri, is the first piece we're bringing, is it? Is this. Is it this? Mm -hmm. So this is sand. We did Delft clay before, and I had a few messages afterwards going, is it sand? Now, Delft, Delft clay is great for casting. This is sand, so this is completely new. Also, you get a completely new flask um, with this as well. Now, this flask is really amazing. It's a little round aluminium flask. Very easy for sand casting because the actual silver doesn't have a long way to go down the flask. These flasks alone are usually, well, I didn't have one for ages because they're so expensive. So this comes with it. You get your round um, crucible, nice, um, great size for melting your um, anything. I, I've met, I used my scrap for a lot of these pendants. I just used my silver scrap. Then you get, this which is a pouring handle just make sure that wow. it's, it's pulled down so that it pours and then you also get the little platform to hold your flask in as well so it will come the main platform is actually put together 
and then you just have to put together the little stand now I've taken my platform down a peg because I wanted it to be closer to my flask but if you do want to use it with the bigger flask then you can keep it at two two stories if you like that was made with the Delft clay which is coming in a little bit later um, but you could make it with a sand um, clay and what else if you have a look at the um, can you see the mushroom bracelet or shall I just go and get it oh here we go this here mushroom is. is cast in place um, little mushroom. He's gorgeous. <laughs> and uh, I've cast in place some garnets there. And that was, uh, I think that took about quite a bit of silver, but yeah. that is just scrap silver. So that's just melted down. No off, way. Yeah, off cuts. And so you can, t you can totally recycle using this. So, um, the so sorry Deb, I, I'm 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 just literally looking at all, all the details there. It says Delve clay, but it is actually the sand that you get with this yeah, one. Yes, it's it? sand. Perfect. So it is the sand that you get with this. It's not Delve clay. If it says it on the graphics, it's sand. It's yeah. sand casting. We are going to be bringing you the Delve clay in a moment, it's but sand. it is sand. Okay, so it is the sand casting. It's, it's proper sand. Okay, perfect. Sorry. So you, you literally get. You are getting all of the apparatus that you need, aren't you? This is yeah. incredible. What's great about the pouring rack is that... And that's this. Yeah, often Ooh. you would have that in your hand and then you kind of pour it, but it keeps it on a steady surface. Yes. If you're a little you know, shaky with the flame and then when you're ready, you just lift it in one motion and it pours into the flask, which is underneath, which yes. you've got there on the which other side. Which is here, yeah. So if we pop that there... Yeah. So you just sort of pop that there and then you pour oh, it, and it and it goes in and the on the motion now what I've done is I've taken this bottom part off of mine mm -hmm. so that my flask is really closely up. yes You'll lovely see in a moment um, if you use these on their own they tend to do that which is why this is absolute genius um, if you just have that on your flat work surface, yes. then they, they can move yes. and you've gone to all that trouble and then it moves. So this is fantastic for holding your flask in place. Fantastic. This is absolutely brilliant. So what should we do, Neri? Can we, can we see it in, or what, what do you want to do? Do you want to okay. see, yeah, can we see a bit of right, action? That'd be so let's, lovely. Let's um, start. So you've got to prepare your crucible before you use it right and I've written all about that there's stuff on my JM guest designer page I told you about it last time I've written it how to do it in the instructions you basically heat this up and you add um, powder flux until it it has a clear coating you only have to do that once right wait for it to cool down then it's ready to use really now everything is in the preparation so you have got am I in shot yeah Fab. well done perfect you have got your flask you've got a male side and a female side yeah and what's great about this particular one which they don't all have is you've got your air vents here because ah. when you press your metal uh, you pour your metal um, the hot air and the gases have to escape and usually you make holes like last time we made holes right through and yes. out the other side you don't have to do it here because they're in the flask for you brilliant all right so what you want to do is take a baking tray or something um, and take your sand take a bit more than you need you won't need the whole packet I would say when you get it home just like get half that up. was going to be one of my questions actually just get this is only half of the packet oh my gosh there's loads Sa um during make a sand costume including yeah sand sand not um delft clay not delft clay right so once you've got it you want to get rid of all of your um lumps from your clay and then a metal ruler is a great way of doing that. So you want it to just um, be quite powdery. Lovely. And it doesn't take long, so you can see how that's changed consistency already. Right, and then we're gonna move that to the side. So, you know, you don't have to mess about it, it doesn't take uh -huh. long. So we're going to start. Great. Do not start with the female side, which, um, because you'll fill it and then you'll get it all stuck into the ah, lip. Don't do that. So start with this side that has the air vents in it. Okay, so we just want to now, if you've got an old card, this is just, um, this is great for moving your sand out of the way and clearing up. So put that on a flat surface. Fantastic. Take your sand and push it in with your fingers, first of all. I'll tell you what's also really great for doing this is that pie um, tart maker from the kitchen. 
you can push that in. And also, Gorgeous. if you've got the um, dapping and doming block, there yeah. is one of these. You can use that as well. So you're really compacting it. Really compacting it. And then I'm going to just pop some more in. And then I want it overflowing. I might need some more sand for the other one. So once you get it on the top, overflowing, yeah. you're going to hammer it. Don't oh. hit your flask. Just um, flat hammer. Yeah. I'm going to compact it down. This is great. So just compact it down, okay? And then let's just move this out of the way. And then you want a nice level surface. So what I'm gonna do is take my metal ruler and just carefully run it across the top. <laughs> yeah, you do with, Neri a, does this with, a, with, with beer. a beer. I love to get the head off your beer. I love that, Neri. So that we've got a nice flat top. <laughs> that looks like Iron Man's heart, by the way. Anyone else think that looks like Iron Man's heart? And then yeah. this side part, I'm just going to squeeze in so that it doesn't. Gosh, that's really great. Yeah, push fantastic. Out. Okay, so I'm just. This is messy, so I'm just trying to keep the mess to a minimum. So we're going to then pop that down. And we just need to decide what we're going to cast. Now, okay. there's many things that you can cast that I've brought with me. This is the duck that made the pendant. Oh, duck so he's a little, he's a little um, duck. You can do shells. Cute. You can do this made the face. It was a broken piece of jewelry oh, um, that made the goddess pendant that's with the pearls. So Love just that. that. This actually made the mushroom, which was a plastic pair of earrings that somebody wore me. Uh, bought me. Now this is, I thought would be interesting. Oh, a little gummy bear. Gummy bear. These are just ideas. Now what I used to cast the... Oh, do a sweetie. Shall I do a sweetie? Yeah. So what I used were these sweets. And look, I couldn't believe that that didn't smash in the clay, but it didn't it. So that's the share love. Let's do that so you can see the, see the letter. So you don't want to pop your piece that wants to be cast, probably overhead's the best for this one, um, too far uh, too near your lip because sorry I'm just looking at the monitor to make sure you can see that's it you so you wouldn't want to do it down here because your silver's got to flow all the way down here and let's not, not make it work so hard so have it up near your pouring point yeah. but we're going to make a spout so not too near the top this is very trial and error the more you do it the better you'll get if you don't like it, pop it back in the pot. You've not lost anything. That's the wonderful thing just about this, Just do it every it? time. Just do it again. So I'm going to do this face down, this share love. Now let's just make sure that we haven't got any sand on there. Now the best thing to do before you start is get some talc and just pop it on here. Now you don't want too much in here because it might get in the grooves of the letters and, and, and interfere with it. Sticking. Stop it from sticking. Good call. Okay, I'm just going to brush that on here. Lovely. Like that. And then I'm going to take it and place it probably about there. Now, if you pressed that in now, you, you, there's a risk that it might break. Um, obviously, it's mm. a sweet. It might break anyway because I've used it before, but let's see. So what I do is I apply even pressure. So pop even pressure, and I'm pressing that in. Now you want it to go in about halfway. Now I know from experience that this isn't really wide enough to get a good pour, so I'm going to push it even further in. Now you might need to just keep pressing this pour point in with your finger because that can crack there. Okay, so I'm just pushing in um, that far for now. Now if you get any cracks or anything around, you can just use your fingers to make sure that that's all nice. Like there's a dog hair there. <laughs> to make mm -hmm. sure that these, that's all nicely in. And then I'm going to pop some more talc over the top. Let me move my duck out of the way and just give that a gentle dust. Lovely. Okay, so then I'm gonna take the top part of the flask and I just wanna make sure that I haven't got any of the clay in the lip because it can make it difficult to open and also around the sides of this one as well. So I'm just- Get all that sand out. Getting all the sand out. Let's move that out of the way. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to just match up. Um, it's easy on this flask because you've got that pouring hole, which I will show you in a sec. Mm -hmm. um, so you've got that pouring hole there. I don't want to shove it upside down. Okay, so that's there. Then we're going to get the sand. I like to sort of crumble it for the first little bit. Yeah. And then I'm going to 
push it down with really my push it. Lovely. fingers. Let's use the, the pie crust maker. <laughs> It's amazing what little tools you can find. Isn't it just? You have in your workshop. So you really do want that. It does look like pestle and mortar to um, be compacted down. We might have enough here. Let's just yeah. get it all. So I'm going to get all of it. Pop it in. It's like playing sandcastles. It's lovely, isn't it? So you can it? see the difference. So I didn't bring the Delft clay with me, but the Delft clay is like clay. It's sticky and it's different. Does the same job, just a different way of doing it. I would say this is easier. I was going to say, is this easier? This is easier in my opinion. Um, but you know, we all have different opinions as jewelry makers. Some people would say it wasn't. Gonna hammer it. I've actually got my finger, my thumb over the hole just to help ah, that compact yeah. and not come flying out. When you first use your sand, you might notice an odor or a smell. Um, and it might be a slightly different consistency as you keep using it and you can keep using it it changes in consistency and it and you don't get as much of the odor that's mm. just the oils that are inside the sand so you always want to work in a well ventilated area mm -hmm. and then i'm just going to take the top of this you can do it with a card as well as a metal ruler anything you've got to hand basically this one's not as important because we're not casting anything with this mm -hmm. okay let's clear up Okay. Now the moment of truth, and obviously we can redo this if we're not happy. We're going to open it. Oh yeah. So I've got a, pro a proper indentation in that side. Now I'm just going to have a look at it and see if I think it's deep enough, and I don't. So I'm going to change that in a minute. Now, before I take this one out, the easiest way to do the pour spout is with this still in. Uh -huh. So what I'm going to do, probably overhead is best for this bit. <laughs> and we're making enough mess. Yeah, it's great. Not a cookie in sight. I know, disappointing. So if we go on the overhead, what I usually do is I take a paintbrush or something similar, and then I'm just going to like pull a pouring hole. Oh, it's quite a wide. Yeah, pull oh. a hole. Well, it sort of fell open there. And then just use my thumb at the top <laughs> like that and then when I, I don't really want any sharp corners so I'm just taking my paintbrush and sort of rounding off those corners and then make sure that your clay is compact because anything that falls off and goes into your pore might ruin now I need to lift this up to eye line and just see I need to see if that hole is okay so once you've got your little pouring hole you want to take this out but you don't want to um, mark the inside so sometimes it will come out like that sometimes it won't so now you've got your little pouring hole you can actually get it and just lift it ah and look at that perfect indentation that, is gorgeous, that I've got there. Though. Now, I'm not too happy with this side, only because I poured before and it all came flying out because it wasn't deep enough. I'm happy with that one. So what I'm gonna do is match where the pattern was. And I'm going to just take that indentation a little bit deeper, like this. And if you need to get something smaller in there, we'll do that. Okay, so then I need to make a pouring hole on this one as well. It doesn't have to be exactly the same, but kind of vaguely in the same place. So I'm going to just take my paintbrush there. Whoops. And then take my thumb. Now, obviously, I'm hurrying. You won't be hurrying. It's, it's not something you want to hurry. But we are on live television, so we have to hurry. I'm holding this up. You um, so well. Just to make sure that I can see that that pouring hole... Is. Now, it's worth spending time on this because if you don't, you go to all that trouble to pour the metal and it isn't any good. So I'm just going to remove any sand from this lip here. And now I want to take this out. So that will probably come out. There we go. That's much better. I can see. Yeah, perfect. So we are doing that in just one, um, I'm sorry, in both sides. Okay, so both sides are done. Um, when I finished setting this up, uh, Neary, um, then you can go to product and then I'll pour if we've got time. Is that okay with you? Oh my are gosh, we... yes. Okay, cool. 
Now, <laughs> you're actually going to pour it today? If we've got time. Oh yeah. my gosh, I'd love to see that. Ah. If not, I've made a video. Ah. So, um, you get all of this. Uh, can I, sorry, I just haven't quite finished. Oh, <laughs> Come on, Carol. hurry up. Carol, Don't I touch me. I love get you. away from me. I love you. No, that's fine. Go. <laughs> I'm just excited about actually seeing it happening. I know, I know. I do my very best. Oh, Sorry, I just don't want to mess this bit up. No, I know you don't speak so, up. So um, you've got your um, <laughs> pouring holes there. Yes. And what we're going to do is use something nice and fine. You can either use a card or... Knife. Where's my little, a little kind of pokey thing? Ah. Um, because you don't want great big um, grooves here because no. your silver will escape and you'll get like a sunshine effect. It doesn't matter, you can take it off later. So what I do is I just take that through and out the pouring hole yeah. and then just remove the excess sand like that. Yeah. So I, I know from experience that I only really want about three of these, so I don't need to use all the pouring holes. Okay, so do the same again. And then one more. Like that. Oh, that one's wiggly, doesn't matter. It's wiggly. It's wiggly. Okay, so we've put a pouring spout on both sides, but we only need to, sorry, we only need to do the holes, uh, the air vents on one side. Okay. Okay, and then when we're quite happy, so you want to really work on these uh, pouring spouts um, to make sure that they're clean. I'll do that while Carol's showing you the product. Um, and then you just put the flask together, but you need to make sure that you haven't got any sand inside the little the pouring. Oh yes of course go back and check just go back and check and then check here that you're not haven't got any sand blocking your little air vents okay remove any sand from there i mean this has been done very quickly it may not work but we'll soon find out won't we okay so then you put your um mold together matching up i can already see that's a good pouring point now can you see that i've got a really good pouring area there yes. but there's a little bit of sand there so i'm just going to press Get it in out. press it in there you go so that nothing can escape so i can see that's a really good pouring uh, place and that is how you put and this i can't stress how you need to take time to get this right mm. okay um and we can laugh at nothing i'm not laughing at anything <laughs> And uh, I was just about to um, <laughs> um, uh, Star Wars Return of the Jedi when they go that. to Jabba the Hutt's place yeah. and they start throwing people out the window and they go into that massive digesting stomach oh, with yeah, the horns in. <laughs> That's what that reminds me of. <laughs> What's that called? <laughs> something of death or something? Oh, I don't know. The yeah, Sarlacc pit. There we it. go. There we go. Anyway, so um, it should look or like a pouring like hole. There we go. So, Excellent. Yeah. Well done. So what I'm going to do while Karen... Uh, Karen? Who's Karen? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, Brian. Who is Karen? <laughs> Oh, I've lost Honestly, it now. Honestly, one, um, one Carol job. One job. Get some with it. <laughs> I will just refine the pouring holes. Okay. Can I bring the product to air? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, Carol. So yeah. I love you. I love you too. I love you. Don't ever call me Karen again, though. I'm not a Karen. Uh, well, sometimes I'm. Anyway, so here we go. So. This, you get all of this. <laughs> sorry if I've offended anyone called Karen. That's a lot of people. I'm sorry. I love you all. Um, this is your sand, which by the looks of it, did you say this is that that you've got in that? It's half. It's, it's half. Yeah. Because you get it's, so much. It's compact in there. You know, like when you put your clothes in one of those things and you hoover out the air. Yeah. It's like that. You vacuum pack it. Yeah, exactly. So that's all of that. That's absolutely amazing. So you get all of your sand, which is Brill. You also get your, uh, presumably this will all come, this isn't gonna come assembled. Um, this comes assembled. And yes. this comes assembled. You can take oh. that off with the screws um, if you want to season your crucible. Yeah. Um, you've just got to put the screws into this bottom bit. Perfect. There's your flask. There's your little stand as well, which is absolutely perfect. So you've got all of that, um, which, is just, which is just brilliant. This is a great, this is just, such a great setup. Yeah, if and you, you can go see and every see what, time you flask, pour, that's going to be amazing. It goes in. If you go and just look for the flask and the sand elsewhere, how much it is, it's really expensive. Yeah, absolutely incredible, isn't it? Just amazing. Well done. So lovely we can bring you this as a bundle. Everything that you're going to need. Uh, we've got all the argentum and all the silver um, um, uh, coming up as well. Don't, don't, don't worry about that. We're going to look after you with that. You get your little spanners as well. Um, there's your flask, there's your sand, um, uh, there's your pouring pot, fantastic. One, four, nine. 
Now that is your start price. There's loads of people there. There's lots of people checking out already, which is absolutely fantastic. Well done. Mm. Well, yeah, I know. So Neri and um, Deb, you were in the in the um, in the gallery today, trying to find something oh, of a similar kind of price point where you get like literally the whole thing. Very unusual to be able to get all of it together. By the way, it it's, really um, is really really special to be able to get all of it together. Yes, the sand um, on its own, like the actual sand, is yeah. uh, is not cheap. Precisely. We are nowhere near done at 149, like nowhere near done. Uh, we're gonna give you the most amazing price point today. Uh, we've got Judith, Wendy, Linda. How many of these do we commission, uh, Neary? Yeah, we've got 150 of these. I mean, there's a lot of people there. There's a lot of people already checking out at 149. You're gonna be so, so, so um, uh, um, pleased with the price point. I know you are, it genuinely is phenomenal. It's a great, great, great deal, okay? So we're gonna give you the very best opportunity that we can, the very best deal that we can. We're at 149 at the moment, uh, but we're going to go significantly lower than that. Are you ready? Here we go. Let's take it under 100. Oh my gosh, there's so many people there. Any questions you've got, please do send them in and we'll do our best to answer them for you. We do have the Delft clay as well, which is fantastic. How many how many uses do you get out of the clay? Uh, sorry, out of the sand? Oh, um, loads. All you have to do um, when you're finished is, and I've put this in the instructions, is you just um, scoop out the black bits of sand, which is yeah. like a tiny bit, chuck it, and then the rest you just keep using. Oh, that's fantastic. You also get your keepsake sand cast pendant as well. So can I nick those um, instructions from you, darling? Right, so it's, it's these ones for this one. So it's these ones, here we go. So you get your, oh, see, this is just fantastic. Look, you get your instructions, there we go, with lots and lots of information on how to set it up, how to prepare your flask, all of that um, useful, useful information um, um, on how to use this particular um, uh, project. So really, really excited that we can bring you that as well. So you get that, all of that, and the sand, 99.99, we're not done. <gasps> Guest designer, Alison, I knew she was gonna come through and get this. Love her. Alison, she wants a duck. Ali, you need to do a um, dragon. Oh, a dragon. That would be amazing. Dragon! There we go. 60 second clock. No way near done. No Nowhere way near. near done. This honestly is absolutely sensational. Trying to find a deal, trying to find this kind of apparatus anywhere where you can get it in one go without having to kind of, you know, you see some places, you know, the deals look decent and then you've got to add shipping, then you've got to add uh, VAT, you know, whatever it might be. The deal you are getting today, honestly, is absolutely terrific. It genuinely, genuinely is. You need to be there. There's loads of you there. I mean, this is, I reckon, this is, I mean, deal-wise, this is <laughs> gonna be the best. Thank you, Bane. Uh, this is gonna be like literally the best sand casting deal. And no, that's I'm fine, I, no, I don't need one. Oh no! Carol doesn't need one. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Do you know what? Pro I thought of you. Who's, who's worn that? Yeah, but I could, there isn't another one. Okay, here we go. 69.99. What? 69.99. Go find it elsewhere for anywhere near that price. I tell you what, that's not going to happen. That's unbelievable, Jeff. Oh, gosh, it takes me back to 2020. <laughs> Gorgeous, well done, absolutely phenomenal. There's so many people there. Go, 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 go. We've got Anne, we've got Maker, we've got Catriona, we've got Shirley, we've got Vera, we've got Miss Janet. We've got Maker in Berkshire, Violet in Hampshire's got two. Maker in Cumbria, Davinia, Francesca. We've got Tracy, we've got Jean, we've got Elizabeth, we've got Kerry, we've got Deborah, we've got Bill. Uh, can I ask, I have a solid silver cup, which I don't use. Can I melt it yeah. down and use it with sand casting? Yes. Yes. You need, you need to. <laughs> I can't do sign language, but yeah, yes. If you can cut it up. Um, it depends how big it is. You probably need the big, um, bigger crucible that comes in the next thing. There you go. I confess, this is one of the most exciting uh, things I've seen in a long time. I've bought it. Yeah, Davinia, you are going to love it. You're going to love it, darling. Well done. Uh, Debbie Hampshire, wow, that's amazing. I know, isn't it just? It's absolutely incredible. You're going to love the Delft um, uh, clay that we've got coming up as well, which is going to be fantastic for your larger pieces because the flask is, if I just show you the flask for the, for the next one, much, much bigger. Can I use the sand with this? Yeah. Brilliant. So if I wanted to, I don't know why you'd want to use the sand and not the clay with this particular one, but if you wanted to use the sand with this, which is coming up next, and you can you cast know, bangles You know why things. you need both, yeah? Bangles and bigger things. Yeah, absolutely, casting. definitely. You know, you're not gonna get a big thing in the little one. No. You are, the only, the only limitation with this, wah, 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 wah. Yeah, we kind of heard that. I mean, whatever. Really? 
No, Neri, stop it. Stop it. No, no, stop it. What are you doing? He's going lower. No, stop. Because I've... 70 quid's amazing. What? Uh... Okay. Okay. We're going lower. You, know, you get everything. Sorry, I've just I've got my mask on, but um, no, don't apologise. I fine. am your father. No, um, you that get all crazy. of these, all of everything you're seeing here. Now, those you get the spanner, you get the extra screws, um, or the only thing you have to put together is this. Now, you'll notice that mine's shorter. Um, Deb, it's just the way I'm... Deb, it's 50 quid. Yes! No, that's stupid. That is stupid. Online, there are places where, like... Oh, blimey, sorry. <laughs> just literally, that on its own is about 50 quid. Just that. Do you teach? You'll get it. Oh. Do you teach? Oh. Get them for your students. Yes, absolutely. At 50 pounds, Amazing. that is terrific. It genuinely is. Go, go, go. Well done. Absolutely amazing. Well done. Loads of you there. Tons of you coming through. Loads of baskets. Any questions that you've got, please do let us know. Unbelievable. Absolutely fantastic. Go, go, go. 0800. Oh, <laughs> guest designer Alison asking if we can sell time because she's going to need time. I need time. I know too. that's it. Having enough time. 50 quid. Okay. I can't wait to see this. Fire it up. Fire it up. Here we go. Right. You're going to... Still some available down to our last 50. You're going to either need your mask or to just step over there. <laughs> no, Michael, you're fine. Don't worry about it. You're all right. Right, so what we're looking for <laughs> is a bushy flame. You need a strong torch. What flame? Bushy. Bushy. Who doesn't need a bushy flame? I need a bushy flame. If they can't hear me, you can translate. Yeah. Right. I'm going to heat up the crucible. Heating up the crucible. You don't have to do oh, this. Oh, God, what's that? You can put it in. Oh, God. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's the flux. It's fine. Get the fire extinguisher. <laughs> right, the crucible's cold because it's been in my car, which is why it's doing this. That's the flux burning off. Can you yeah. see it? Yeah, there's the flux burning off. Now, this is way too high for me to work. I'll do my best. I'm usually above it. Oh, God. Don't show me messages while I'm doing this. <laughs> woof, woof. Thank you so much for a fantastic prize. And my mojo is back and fire at all cylinders. Oh, God. Confetti. Right, I'm holding my flame actually at the metal. Okay, oh wow, look at this. Woo! Oh my gosh, I love it. No, oh, it will go through some stages. Deb, you're so good. So it takes time. So is the silver in there? Silver's in there. Oh wow. Oh, no, I'm my hesitant gosh. to turn this up anymore, so we'll just see what happens. It looks like it. it's turning. Or is it now? Yeah, it's, you'll see that it will start, it will glow red. Oh, so yeah, 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 Can yeah, you see yeah, that? Red. So then it goes really shiny. Red. And what we're looking for is liquid terminator, right? Now, red. this will take a while. No, it's fine. Look Just at keep that. your flame on it. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. I love it. I'm going to get a bit closer. Oh, wow. Can you see it's going shiny? Yeah. Now I put the whole 10 grams of silver in here. I suppose I could have put a bit less than I, but never mind. So it's going red, going shiny. And then you just have oh. to keep the flame. I'm going to turn it up. Wow. Keep the flame on the silver. Yeah, Deb, De Debbie Kershaw is officially the Jewel Maker Fire Starter. I know. <laughs> what a brilliant tool, what an amazing prize. I know, Nikki. Isn't it amazing, Nikki? I can imagine Nikki working with this. He's going to love it. Right, it's going. So you can see it going. Oh my gosh. It's not gone. It's starting to become. Catherine, I'll ask Debbie that question in a, in a couple of seconds when she's finished doing this. Right, can you see that it's starting yes, to oh go? Oh my gosh, it's unicorn blood. That's so cool. Right. Oh my god, that's so cool. I right. love it. I'm changing hands. It's 
just gone out of so much crap. Right, I need to change hands at this point. Oh my gosh, that is the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. Right, Carol. Yes. If they can't hear me, yes. I'm heating I'm heating the crucible lip where I'm gonna pour. So Debbie's heating the crucible. Oh my gosh. What we're looking for is a rolling mixture. Now that's not ready. A what? Rolling mixture. It'll start to roll. It will start to roll. Now at this point, I'm going to pop in. That is so cool. Oh gosh, what's that? Flux powder. Can, can, yeah, good. can you overdo it? No. No. So definitely do it for longer than... No, right, no. can that you is... see it's rolling? Oh yes! Keep it on the longer. It's starting to roll. Oh, that's so cool. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that is, that is literally the coolest thing I've ever seen. Right. Yeah, watch it back, hang on, watch it back on the web, come on. Hold on. Everyone watch it, everyone watch it. Quick, <sighs> quick, quick. My earpiece is gone. Right, give me oh, a minute. Oh, Debbie's earpiece has gone straight there, straight in there. Right. Straight into that uh, stomachy thing. Can you mm. see how... Um... I could take my mask off. Okay. <sighs> <sighs> Woo! I can't believe I just did that on live television. Now. <laughs> you are an absolute legend. Oh, thank you. <laughs> now, if you're using a small torch, you can only melt a small bit of metal or you'll be there all day. Um, this is just a, a go system torch, which you can actually get, it's a plumber's torch. You can get it from um, an, you know anywhere really. Um, things that I couldn't say when I had the mask on was make you saw all the stages there but I've written it out for you as you start you think oh it could be ready pop in a pinch of powder flux okay and then keep your torch on it that's why I changed hands with my torch when my torch went out you want to start to move that molten metal towards your pouring spout don't take the heat off it because this part of the crucible is not as hot as that part yeah okay? Sorry, I, ca I, can't see, I can't see your messages. Thank Bravo. you, I'll, I'll watch them back later. Um, so you keep your um, torch on there um, and you keep it sort of on this whole part because it needs to stay temperature because you'll, you'll notice that if you don't, it will go back to being sort of that sludgy instead yeah, of liquid terminator. Yeah, yeah. And then right at the end when you're gonna pour it, you just go sort of bang and you just dump it in. So make sure that you've lined that up before so you don't How have to touch do this at all. you know you've, got, you've done enough silver? You don't, it's just trial and error. So like with the sweets, it was half filling and I thought it's not so silver, so I bung some more in. Um, ah. So this could go either way. I can see a little sprue at the top, which means we may have done it, um, but this is the exciting part. Now this flask isn't hot oh yeah oh that's no. so cool so the oh my flask gosh this is gonna be i can't wait to see this it's not hot but what's inside is it's terribly hot so, okay um i've actually got a quench pot here if you have cast in place any stones and the last demo i did was cast in place yes um don't quench it because you'll you might smash your your stone so moment of truth i love this bit it'll either be half full ruined or yeah right so we've got half of a cast. Oh my gosh, that I, is so cool though. But you know why? Because I thought this, there wasn't enough silver in the pot. Um, because this is a, just let me quench this and I'll show you it, right? So let me pop it in. Oh. This bit. Right, let's just talk about the sand for a minute. We'll go back to that. You see these black bits of yes, sand? Yes, yes. Um, I just got to get the bin, hold on. No, go for it. The black bits of um. sand, you want to... Where's my little spoon? I had it a minute ago. The oh, spoon was that? Oh. I'll use the tweezers. What we, what you want to do is just scrape, scrape these bits of sand into the bin and then take this and just put it back in your sand pot again. Now, this is what um, happened to me when I did this, the sweet, how I knew I needed more silver. Obviously, I've only got the 100 grams. This is a really big... Um, heavy, like if you get spoon. that sweetie necklace, you'll see how heavy the charm is. So that has done half of it, but look at the detail. You can see it's absolutely incredible. So it's you so would need. Pretty. So I know oh. that I need at least that again because it's the gravity that pushes that down. Yeah. So what I would do now is I would just 
quickly redo this in exactly the same way. Yeah. I would bung this back in the pot straight yeah, away. Yeah, melt it. And then put some more in as well and then pour again. And it took me about three times to get my sweetie necklace. Here we go, hang on. Um, exactly as, so as I wanted it. So it is trial and it. error. It's so trial and error. So there's the sweetie. Can you feel how heavy that yeah, is? Yeah, it's really, really like heavy. if we weighed it, I reckon that that's... Quite oh, I'd grams. say that's probably going to be about I don't know at least no more than that. I'd about say at least grams. at least at least ten grams of sterling silver. Yeah, there's huge amounts in there. I will give it away. So I guess the, the kind of takeaway for me is is that Deb, who's done who sang casted you know loads and loads and loads of different pieces, it's still trial and error for her. So you'll kind of get a feel of what the ground weight is. So what I'm trying to say to you is, when you have a go and the first piece doesn't work, perhaps don't give up. Oh, Please no. don't give up. Like rings are easier. Things like twelve rings. grams, twelve point right. seven grams. So there's twelve point seven grams. Um, but you know, you're thinking that we're not doing like rings, which are just like thinner. Yeah. We're doing like heavy bits, like the duck as well. I think the duck was nineteen grams of silver. Wow. I put in. Now I did saw off a sprue, which was quite a, a large bit. You need to have the extra silver to push the metal right down to the bottom of something like this. Um, we, we've had somebody asking if they can cast um, a tooth. Yeah. I mm -hmm. love the yeah, idea yeah. of that. How cool is that? Yeah, you just, when you're um, pushing it in, just push it in very gradually and put even pressure, like I showed you with the ruler. Because if you push it on one side, you can crack it. But if I can push a sweet that I can break with my hands in, you can then you can do, do a tooth. tooth. You can yeah. do a tooth, you can do... Um, Oh, Any, just, anything yeah. you can you can an acorn you can do a shell oh, you can do I love the idea um, of doing shells it's rare unless you've done the piece before of getting it right the first time if you don't know exactly how much silver you're going to yeah, use yeah. so you I know there that I would put um probably double I'd probably put about that was 10 grams I'd probably put about 18 grams of silver in the pot because then I saw the sprue off and just use it again. Yeah. Now, obviously, it doesn't come out like you're seeing it there. I have then got my files, and I've, I tell you all this <coughs> in the instructions. In the instructions. Um, just let me show you something. So, does it? How does it relate, Deb? So, if we we've just weighed that piece, and there's 12 grams of silver in that. Yeah. Would you weigh out 12 grams of, of the silver or are you going to lose some through firing it? Through, through you know, kind of, you don't lose anything. So well, lose I've got my weights. little scale. So I think, oh, there's not enough in, in that one. So I'll bung a bit more. See, I'm not very exacting. So no, you, but I don't, I don't think um, it really necessarily matters this, unless you're going to be doing the same thing over and over exactly, and over again. In which this would cast a ring no problem at all. Oh, like gosh, yeah, a, you know, definitely. Because look, look at that lump of silver there. It's huge. But what we need is... Um, a lump of silver with like the sprue coming out the top which is like that where the funnel is and then mm. you would saw that off usually yes. you need that amount of silver for it to work and when i looked at the 10 grams there i thought that's probably not going to do it i knew it wouldn't um but that's all i brought with me now just another thing mm. if you use our gran our granules and you've got silver bits not with stones in but silver bits that you don't use at home i've got so much scrap silver then just take it cut it up and put it in with your granules Yes. Um, till you get the weight. Like everything that I've made here, apart from the duck, um, is my scrap silver. Oh, so that's amazing. Argentium yeah, um, so casts let's, whiter. So we have got Argentium. Here we go. So, I mean, you're going to possibly be able to tell the difference between these. Yeah, it's whiter. It, is, it, is, it will be whiter. Um, let's get that price point all the way down. So what you're getting here is 10 grams. That's roughly what you would use to cast one of the um, sweetie pendants, roughly, roughly. I mean, you're probably gonna need a bit more. You'd need but you, more. But, 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 but if you break that down, you're gonna be able to easily make a couple of rings out of that. No uh, problem yeah, whatsoever. Absolutely. Just incredible. So let's get that price point down. We're taking the price point down on the Argentium today. So, not, so Argentium is 940 silver. When you do, you know, if you are gonna be getting your pizza's hallmark, do advise them that it is Argentium and you know, they should um, <laughs> um, uh, hallmark that accordingly. Um, uh, but you know, it is, it is even finer, even purer than 925 sterling silver because it's 94% pure silver. Here we go, my lovelies. Let's get that price point all the way down for you today so like I say you know you're easily going to get a couple of rings out of this maybe even three rings out of this no problem whatsoever 20 pounds amazing that is absolutely incredible this I is love a great it. way to start because it's small little beads and um, it's going to get the flame in there and it's going to melt easier could you do could you use this with gold 
No, you want to you want a separate or crucible. rose gold. Separate. Well, no, crucible. I'm just thinking if you've got like old gold pieces yeah, of jewelry, so could you what, buy a separate one and do it? Yeah. You just don't want to contaminate no, it, do you? No, so you want a, just a different crucible. And also, just just to say that when the crucible comes, it comes kind of chalky like that. Oh. Yeah. So you have to season it before you use it. Yeah, like it. this. Um, so that one's the same. So my one's shiny, like inside, like someone's varnished it. You'd have, probably have to get that on the overhead. Um, let me just get that in. Right, yeah, so, so you can see it's shiny. You can see it's shiny. I mean, obviously that's been well used. Um, so what you do is, you know the flux that, that, I put, that I put in? Get the crucible hot, it will start to go red. Do it gradually on the first use. If it's been in anywhere near water or anywhere near um, moisture, like leave it to dry out. Heat it gently, and then when it's heating red, pop in, have your mask on, pop in uh, your flux, and you'll see it will bubble up, it will go because it's white, and then it will start to go like um, liquid clear nail varnish. And then you just move this around. You might have to take it off. Mm -hmm. um, you can take it off with these screws. Perfect. Um, until it covers the inside. So that stops your metal sticking. You only have to do that once. You might have to do it again in six months or something if it, it's looking dodgy. But um, you have to do that. Don't just stick your metal straight because it might stick. Yeah. OK, perfect. Thank just you for that. Gorgeous. So we've also got the sterling silver on its own. Here it is. So again, with the sterling silver you've got here, you've got 10 grams of the sterling silver. So again, you'll be able to easily get a couple of rings out of this. No problem at all. I mean, I, I can I can just imagine a lot of people, uh, you know, offering a service of, you know, if you've got your gold jewelry, you know, you've got your gold pieces, then, then you know, um, then, um, then uh, you, know, you know, I can make it into a piece of jewelry for you. Uh, You've got here 925 sterling silver, 10 grams of that, ready to go, ready to use. I would be multi, 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 multi buying this. It's absolutely yeah, brilliant stuff. Yeah, you need, you can mix. 14.99. You can mix it. Like if you've got old rings or old bracelets or old, you know, things left over from the 80s that you're never going to wear again. Mm. I've got tons of it. Um, you know, cut it up or saw it up and you can pop it in with a casting grain. You know, it doesn't have to be separate. I'm, yeah. I have broken gold and silver bracelets. Can I melt together and make one? Uh, I wouldn't melt the gold and silver together. Um, I would do the silver. So say you wanted a half silver, half gold. Uh, make a, ri a ring in your sand. In your sand. Um, use, practice so that you know how much silver you want for half. Cast the silver. Get a different crucible. Melt the gold, then pull the, the gold in it, and you will get right. gold Right, yeah, because they're going to have different boiling points, aren't yeah, they? they they're have different points to kind mm. of... Uh, hi, Carol, uh, Debbie, uh, and crew. How would you attach the cast piece onto your well, well, then you just... Um, I've got it. I've, I've written it for you. If you it's all in there. <laughs> Incredible price for the grain. I isn't know, it's it? great, isn't it? It's good, it's isn't really it? It's really good, Alison, um, I know. Then you just um, solder. So let me find the Amazing. instructions. I'll show you a picture. Wait a minute. So I've, I've covered all this. I've covered it. Start to finish. <coughs> Excuse me. See, that's a sneeze. So if you... <laughs> yeah, Dave. That's a proper sneeze, Dave. If you have a look, um, go up, please. Yeah, that one with the... So uh, he's now, Mr. Duck. Oh, He's ducky. on my soldering um, fire brick. Yeah. I've popped on, because I know I've only got one solder joint, I've popped on So Have we got any... Um, solder liquid uh, syringe solder oh, we'll have to have a look actually you i've might popped do. on a bit of um flux no you don't need flux paste paste. paste paste um so pop on your paste then pop on a bit of wire um or a half a jump ring or whatever you're using mm. and just solder it on so then it just becomes Perfect. normal silver smithing after that or drill into his head if you don't want to solder drill into his head there he is. Um, and then glue a peg in but i would say the duck's quite heavy be really um, heavy now that's copper as you can see like i was saying earlier that i thought that was a bit of sterling that's silver that's okay it when i shoved great. it in the pickle so that just shows that you can solder copper to silver or gold to yeah. silver you know you can do that um i just wouldn't put multiple metals in the same crucible because they've okay. got different um melting points. so can we do the other tool kit yeah with yeah. the delft clay yeah. so if i move these to this side here oh this is just so exciting. I love all of this. Now, this is the one I've seen before. Um, so you can use you can use the sand with this. It's just a bigger crucible. You can yeah. see here in this aperture here, you're going to be able to make everything from bangles to yes. uh, to you know to bracelets, you know, to much 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 larger pieces because it's a much larger flask that you've got here, which is fantastic. Okay. Yep. Can you just use scrap on its yeah. own? 
that's what most of these pieces are made out yeah. of me just cutting up my scrap and melting it you can even melt Ooh. it and put it through the rolling mill and make your own sheet and wire ah, so it's perfect. fabulous for recycling so you've got here your um scorify handle so yeah. th that is you've got this. your handle you've got your crucible you've got your clay your delft clay um what uh, 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 why would I use clay rather than sand? Um, it's a personal choice, really. Clay is, uh, it feels like clay. Like when you get it out, it's all sticky. It, it stops being as sticky as yep. you use it. Um, you do everything the same, apart from if you're going to use this flask, you, you do the holes separately, uh, differently. But mm. you get my instructions with this. Ah, uh, yes, and of I course. tell you how to do a cast in place oh, ring. Which is amazing. Um, oh my gosh, Deb, that's so beautiful. So this is the Delft clay. The difference is really just personal choice. Mm -hmm. um, this is uh, more of a clay. Uh, so you don't do the ruler thing or anything. You just knead it and push it in. And yeah. it's just like, um, yeah, like a clay, mm. like a putty almost. Yeah. Um, and the sand is a sand. So uh, p people tend to cast um, using both things depending on what they're doing. Mm -hmm. It's personal taste like any jeweler. Um, does this come as a bundle? Yes. Um, depending on the price, um, this flask and having another crucible is really fabulous. So yeah. even if you um, thought, oh, I might try Delft clay later, I think this bundle is worth adding in. If you want to start doing bangles or larger things, like that cup, someone said about a cup. Oh yeah. That's a lot of silver in that cup. So presumably you're going to, you know, cast something bigger. So you can use um, uh, the, the the sand with this. Yes. You can use the Delft clay with the with other, the other yes. flask yeah, as yeah, well. Yeah. It's all completely, it crosses over beautifully. Yeah. Um, Rachel, Maker and Five, Maker and Angus, well done to you. We're at 99.99, which is absolutely tremendous. It, it really genuinely is. Um, but we're gonna give you an even lower price point. We're gonna take it even lower, which is just fantastic. It comes with the instructions again, like um, uh, Deb says, but you know, slightly different ones. Which is fantastic. Yeah, the price we did last time is absolutely... Mm, was that for a bundle? So uh, the great thing about Wow, this, okay, that's a really good price. Um, you know, if you get both of these, um, if you want to pour into this one, it goes like that. Yeah. So that's where the two, the two um, Story. stories is good. Also, if you want to do more than one metal, then you probably need another crucible. So this goes on here, and then you've got freehand to, to pour it in where you yeah, want. Yeah, lovely. Um, so it's not like if you get that, you won't use this. Like I've got about three of these you're, crucibles. You're going to use all of them. Yeah, yeah, you're going to use all of it, which is fantastic, especially if you're going to mix your metals up. But brilliant, well done. Here we go. Let's get that price point down. We're at 99.99. You're going to get an even better deal. So if you're going to be doing your larger pieces, fantastic. You can use your sand with that as well as your clay. You've got your crucibles here. So if you want to use this crucible for your gold and your, uh, the crucible you get with the other one uh, for your silver, you absolutely go for it. Well done. Um, here we go, all the way down. This is tremendous. Honestly, this price is ridiculous. 49.99. Do you know, those two wow. bundles together cost less than the price of the flask, one flask, little flask, and sand when I first... F the one flask and the sand when I first did it was more expensive than these two whole bundles put together. Together, yeah, exactly. That's, that's, why that's I didn't exactly do it. That's, away. that's what a great, great, great deal you're going to be getting here today. With the clay, how long will that last? Do I need to keep replacing it? What, what would you say? Does Same it dry with, out? Or yeah, it what? will dry out unless you keep it. You've got to keep it um, <clears throat> in a like with the sand. I've um, just keep it in. You need with the sand. You need to keep it away from any dog hairs or anything that contaminate it. Yeah. So I have a lid on. But with this, it needs to be airtight. So I tend to wrap the remainders in cling film, then put it in a bag. And sometimes I'll even put um, a baby wipe in there that's wet just to mm. keep it moist. Yeah, yeah. So um, you just uh, scoop out the. I've lost it now because I've been up since 4 a.m. I can't even The scoop. clay that you need. Yeah, um, you can sc still scoop out the black clay as you do oh, the sand yeah, yeah. and then reuse the rest. Ah, oh, brilliant. Okay. Thank you, lovely. <laughs> 49 99 for you today. Congratulations. Well done. Uh, add it onto your order. Go get any more questions. Please do let us know. We've yeah, literally I didn't got a couple see minutes any left of those on the show. Oh, messages oh so many people just sending uh, in messages saying, a wonderful demo. Can I have a baby wipe, please? Just to oh, clear sorry, my hands. Yeah. Just saying, what a wonderful demo. How fantastic you know your designs are. And honestly, Deb, you've worked so hard on these projects you've done so amazingly honestly you must oh, be you. so pleased just um, don't ever be put off there's no like if that I was at home and that I did 
three times to get the sweetie pendant. I went, oh, right, and even myself, I bung that back in while the crucible's still That's exactly still hot. it. That's exactly bung it. Bung it back in, add a bit more silver, And this is what Deb's this. saying. The first time that you do something, it's probably not going to work. It would be unusual, actually, for it to work perfectly first time. Yeah. So if and when it doesn't work first time, don't be put off. Don't walk away thinking, I'm up, no, no, that's it, I've done. <laughs> um, you know, please don't lose heart because it will, because honestly, you will learn very quickly by looking by eye or whatever it might be, um, you know, the kind of weights that you need to go for. And honestly, this is a game changer. It is. It's, uh, you are making seriously, you know, beautiful, really valuable pieces out of your precious metals and repurposing jewellery, maybe. Yeah, yeah, repurposing your scrap, which is fantastic. Oh, we're going to do a discount. Oh, yes. Oh, we got time to do a 30 second clock. Okay, let's just do a 30 second clock. Okay, let's find them all at home. Let's take it even lower, stuff it. If Why not? If you've got any questions, just ask me on my Gem Guest Design Debbie Kershaw page. But the, the instructions for the, this one are quite comprehensive. Oh, brilliant. Thank you. Yeah, fantastic. Great show. Loved it. Oh, Patsy, that's so kind of you. Thanks, Bless you. Patsy. Thank you. Thank you, my lovely. Loads in baskets, Cumbria Maker, Maker Sharon, Maker in uh, London, Yulva. Gillian, Ludmila, uh, Joe, Anne, Violet, Kate, Bernadette, Maker, loads of you there. Fantastic. Um, do check out as soon as you can. Here we are, my lovelies. Go, 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 go. Well done, everyone. All the way down. Enjoy. Oh, what's it going to? That's cheap. 39 oh, that's amazing. Can I just say really quickly, um, please don't start doing this if you've never picked up a torch in your life. Yeah. Get used to a torch. Ah, so how much longer is it going to take you to melt the silver if you're using your normal torch um, rather it, than you're that? Not, it's not going to do it with a um, creme brulee torch. It'll mm. work with your little Durston torch. Um, it will just take longer and you might need to um, do lesser amounts. Mm. Um, make sure that you've got your hair back. You've got no sleeves. The reason I put the mask on was mainly for the flux. You don't want to be breathing that in. Safety goggles. I obviously wear glasses. Um, don't have any curtains or anything around. Put it on a heat proof surface, like um, a mic old microwave plate, an old tile, a baking tray. Um, I've put some of the um, health and safety considerations in the instructions. Safety, safety, safety first. I'm very used to a flame so that when that blew back, I'm very used to it, it doesn't matter. Um, keep way back from it. Start with a gentle flame if you've never worked before. There's lots of information on YouTube um, for casting. Make sure that you've got an idea of what you're doing. I wouldn't say like, I've never done any silversmithing before. I'm just gonna, you know, practice with your flame and work your way up. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay. Oh, you've covered everything there. Thank you so much, Deb. That's wonderful, isn't it? Um, amazing. 39.99 loads in baskets check out that's the best price that's ever been that's, that's amazing. absolutely terrific well done everyone listen coming up tomorrow you've got an amazing show silver plated collots coming up as your early bird special amazing floral settings in the nine o'clock hour ten o'clock faceted black jade bangle oh Ooh. my word clear quartz selection coming up in the 11 o'clock hour and midday you've got uh metal smithing essentials with charlie as well it's going to be an absolutely Fabulous uh, weekend. Uh, it's going to be absolutely incredible. Yeah, you get instructions with the first bundle. Do you get instructions with you the second instructions one? With yeah. the second you get instructions with the second one. You do get instructions with the second one as well. Of, of cast in place. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think so. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they come with that. You should do. Perfect. Um, so, uh, yeah, fantastic. So you do get your instructions um, um, uh, for the uh, um, uh, uh, with both projects, which is absolutely fantastic. There's extra Enjoy. information Get your silver. on my JM Guest Designer page from last time. Brilliant. It's pinned to the top. <laughs> We're going to put some crucible thongs, apparently, on the website and fireable gemstones as well. Oh, I like the idea of crucible thongs, actually, to be honest. Yeah, why not? <laughs> why not? Very, very tight fitting. Uh, thank you so much, Deb. You've worked so hard. Oh, you're amazing. You're welcome. Love you, sweetheart. Thank you so much. Listen, everybody, have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful um, uh, weekend. You've got an amazing weekend lined up on JM, so please make sure you're with us bright and early tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Thank you very much. It's been a brilliant, brilliant show. Add the crucible tongs onto your order. Why not? Why not? And fireable stones. Go, go, go. Check out your baskets. We'll see you in a bit.